Oh no. Oh no. Uh, how's it going, everyone? I'm ready to sip. Are you guys ready to sip? How's the sound? <laughs> Gonna be sipping long and long and hard with this one. Someone just said in chat as the stream was as the stream was starting. Um, uh, instead of I'm not I'm not stubborn I'm right. It was I'm not stubborn I'm Reich. <laughs> that was that was pretty good. Uh, let me get my links out one second, and we're gonna have a brief talk, and then we're gonna start. Uh, Dengenrampa 2 begins right now. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum, 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 bum. I like this music. I've missed this music. Okay, with an at here on on Discord. All right. Why can't I see the stream? I don't know. Why can't you see the stream? You should be able to see the stream. It's it's there. It's working. Is chat getting a scolding? <clears throat> Not really. No. Uh, but uh, some things do have to be cleared up a bit. Yeah. But. Uh, it's it's not gonna be it's not gonna be uh, it's not gonna be a scolding no not by any means no. Hey Joe, hey Dark, Dark Flashes, how's it going? Who is that knife guy? We don't know. We never found out. Okay, I think all my links are out, and I can see chat, and I can see OBS, and I can see Streamlabs. Uh, I need to move one window, and then we can start talking, which will serve as the as the intro for the stream, and then we will uh, restart the game, because the game is on right now, it's playing on the background, and we'll watch the intro, and then we will get started. Um, so if you don't care about my little intro here thing, and, and you want to go use the bathroom or get a drink or something, you probably have five to ten minutes to go do that. So um, there you go. You, you won't miss anything apart from me talking, which is very important. But you know, if, if you don't if you don't care, then you don't care. <clears throat> uh, first of all, thank you to. Oh, let me refresh it. Do, do, yep, go brush your teeth. Go brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. Uh, thank you to Scape Zero for the new sub. Thank you very much, Scape Zero. And Riley1466. Delta Alpha the Hermit. And Hunts55. These were when the stream was down. They're on my list, so I'll say thank you. Usually they don't show up on my list, but thank you very much. Uh, P Derelict uh, for the new sub as well. Thank you very much, P Derelict. That was an hour ago. Uh, Finemax100 for the 200 bits with Danganronpa Hype PogChamp PogChamp. I like PogChamp. That's one of my favorite emotes. Uh, Ranikel for the new sub. Welcome to the Dragon's Den, Ranikel. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sync Sync Lair as well for the, for the new sub. Wow, I need to, I need to go get my glasses or or, or contacts or something. I've, I've been putting this off for too long. I can I can like the screen is a little blurry. Wow, that's that's pretty bad. Usually it's fine. Uh, th thank you, Ranikel, and thank you, Sync Lair. Thank you very much. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, uh, Davy Coxie, for the hundred bits with the message "Raise your hope." We will try. We will try to be the ultimate hope. Thank you very much, Davy Coxie. Uh, thank you, Dimic97, for the thousand bits. Another day, another dragon grandpa. <laughs> another sprinkler gate. Oh god, I hope not. Thank you so much for the thousand bits, Dimic. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. You've you've given a lot of bits over over uh, so many streams. Thank you so much, Dimic97. Uh, thank you, JJ Mara813 for the new sub. Welcome to the Dragon's Den, JJ Mara813. Welcome, 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 Biscuit Badger. Uh, not not sorry, not welcome. Welcome back, uh, four month resub. Uh, Letiers, it had est 
Un nation complete. I don't know what that means. I don't know what I just said, but okay. Thank you very much, Biscuit Badger. Um, Kilo, use some bits to say. Uh, Kilo 11037, use some bits to say. Uh, hi for more Dengue and Rampa. Uh, Almo Gaver 235 for the seven month resub. Sub train for the Rumpa Strum. <laughs> I like that, the Rumpa Strum. Uh, thank you, Carlos Strife, for the new sub. Welcome, Carlos Strife. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the sub, Carlos. Uh, Lord of Sex for the two month resub. Love your streams and videos. Chiaki, best girl. Oh no. Who's Chiaki? Chiaki, best girl. Oh no, you just made some enemies in chat. If if I'm correct, whenever you whenever you claim a best girl, that's it. You made some enemies. Hope hope you deal with that. Okay, Lord of Sex. Uh, thank you, freaking moron, for the nine month resub. Oh dear, nine months. Thanks for staying entertaining. Keep up the good work. I'm glad that you find me entertaining after nine months. Uh, freaking moron. Thank you. Thank thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, Darksleeve, for the four month resub. Uh, All might in what all might all might in 2b outfit smash or texas smash what i feel like i don't understand a reference there or maybe i'm reading it wrong <clears throat> uh 2b and smash would be pretty good right I, I i i think i would like the smash 2b i think that would be pretty good yeah and joe is my wife you some bits to just point out that joe is my wife too okay thank you so much thank you everybody <clears throat> Um, okay, so, um, I feel like I forgot to say something, I feel like there's something, something on that, on that, uh, thing, I, I, in that list I was supposed to say something, oh, yeah, 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 uh, so we have some people that have, uh, that have been subbed for 12 months now, um, even though the, the subs haven't been available for 12 months, because when, when, the first day that you get one, it says that that's your first month, and it, and it counts as a whole month, even though, uh, really when you get to, 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 to two months is when you're actually been subbed for a full month, you know how it works, you know? Um, so, uh, yeah, so we we have some 12 month subs now, so there's, there's a, a chat icon, looks pretty cool for, for 12 months, um, but it also means that we're heading to the anniversary of, of streaming, which we're saying is September 25th, uh, it's probably a couple days before that, but we'll see. Um, I don't know what we're gonna do, uh, I don't know if we're gonna play some special game, or, or what we're, I have no idea, uh, but I'll think of something, or I'll talk to people in chat, if you have any ideas, let me know, um, what, what you would like to happen on, on the 25th, and we'll, and we'll try and do something special for the, for the, uh, for the one year um, uh, stream anniversary. Okay, so I wanna talk about the response that some people had to the finale of Danganronpa 1. Uh, and it's not actually about Sprinkler Gate, it's about the final stream when uh, I was annoyed at the ending of the game. So, um, uh, I'll keep this as brief as possible and then we'll get started. Usually we, we wait around for, for, for people to pile in anyway before we start and it's important for this one especially because it's the beginning. Okay, um, so there are a couple of issues. The first one is that people were, were getting annoyed that I was speculating a lot about what was going to happen. Um, so I want to address that and very politely tell you that you're wrong. Um, and the reason why you're wrong is because, on, on two reasons, storytelling is a is to me and many other people about speculating and about wondering what happens. If some if something is introduced, you want to, okay, well, how's that going to play into something else? Uh, all oh, this character just introduced, oh, what are they going to do? Or what are they going to say? What's this mystery here? That sort of thing. Um, that's on the one side. That's on general storytelling. But even if you reject that, um, Danganronpa 1 is a murder mystery game. You're supposed to wonder and try and work out what, what's happening. The, the, the gameplay itself is about working out who done it. Like, Monokuma even says that. Um, so even if you reject that first part and you think that storytelling should be more of a, a passive experience, which is valid, that's a valid way of looking at storytelling. That's not how I enjoy stories, but that's it's valid. Um, speculating and trying to work out what it is in a game like this, in a story like this, is, is part of the experience. Um, so, yeah, so... Please remember that, and if you don't like to enjoy stories that way, that's fine, but don't try and hate on the way that I enjoy stories, especially when I think that that's the way that this genre is meant to be enjoyed. Like, when, when you're reading an, 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 uh, an Agatha Christie book, um, part of trying to work out what happens is, is the main part, arguably the whole point of the experience. You know, you want to really, really get there. Um, that's, that's what it's, yeah. So, I, I don't want to repeat myself, so yeah, there's that. Um, the second part is that people were annoyed that I was not having a good time with the game. And this is the bigger point, and this is where we're going to get into uh, things that might be a little awkward. So, um, I got quite a few messages on Discord, and by quite a few I mean like five. Um, I don't know how many there were on, on the YouTube comments and, and stuff like that, but uh, there were people that were 
telling me that I should lie and I should pretend that I'm enjoying something when I'm not enjoying it. Uh, I can see why people some why why some people might want me to do that because it can make a more entertaining uh, stream. Someone even told me left a comment on the Mario Odyssey stream saying that you know like I, I don't want to watch someone who's not enjoying something, so you should pretend to enjoy it for the sake of being entertaining. Um, and I'm very sorry to to have to be this kind of streamer, but I'm not gonna lie to you guys. If I'm not enjoying it, I'm not gonna pretend. And at the same time. If I am if if I am enjoying something, I'm not going to pretend that I'm not. So I think I think the, the, the root of this problem and the root of this feedback is that some people were so upset that I didn't like the ending of Danganronpa 1, and they're so sure that it is a good story and it is a good ending, that they just thought that my reaction to it wasn't genuine, and there's no possible way that I couldn't have been enjoying it. So I just wanna say this, you know. Clearly, sorry if it, if it's if it comes across as wrong. Um, my reaction to and 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 saying that the story ending of Danganronpa One was trash was not a fabrication. It really was that bad to me. I'm, I'm like I really enjoyed the game overall, and I've spoken to people on Discord and on other streams about it. And uh, the, the case number, I think it was case number two and case number. Was it was it was it two and four were the best? I can't remember the numbers of them. The the, the one about okay. So there's full spoilers for Danganronpa one in the stream, by the way. So here, here's your here's your very brief warning about that. I don't know why you're here if you haven't seen the first one or you haven't played the first one because I, I I assume this one's gonna spoil the first one as well. So there's full spoilers for Danganronpa one um, throughout this whole stream. There's blanket spoilers. Um, I think it was two and four. Uh, the case of uh, Chihiro and Sakura. Like those two were absolutely fantastic, and I and, and again, I'm not exaggerating. I'm not and I'm not lying when I say they're among the two best pieces of storytelling that I've ever experienced in the medium. I, I'm not kidding. That's not hyperbolic. They were very, 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 very good. But on the flip side, there were parts of the of, of the first game that were very, 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 very bad, and I wasn't hamming it up that much when it comes to reacting to how bad I thought. The, the 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 ending was that's why we're playing it because like because I s so enjoyed those parts of the first game so yeah there 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 we go all right so please um so the last thing I want to talk about is that well it can is it possible to be 100% genuine throughout a stream and the answer is no um, when I'm playing a game by myself I don't sit here going and talking to myself going oh it's fucking bullshit oh I really hate this oh I wonder what's gonna happen or you know, I, I'm silent. I'm, I'm sitting here internally, you know, thinking along in, in, with the voice that's in my head and the other voice that's there too. And I, obviously I don't verbalize everything, right? I, I'm silent. I can't do that when I'm streaming because if I'm silent, you guys, like, why would you watch me? It would just be like, click, 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 click. And then the occasional, hmm, you know, like that's boring. So there's obviously gonna be some level of, of, um, of yeah, translation from, thoughts to verbalizing something and it's not going to be a one-to-one -one reaction so there is going to be some moments where um uh, I, I i will maybe exaggerate a little bit or i will ham something up a little bit uh because i don't know exactly how to hit these how do i verbalize this reaction that i'm having and sometimes i do take it too far and you guys have a point about that some people are like okay it got a little a little tiresome and sometimes we do run jokes into the ground and, and it gets a little tiresome i understand that it's it's a balance and i'm still learning how to how to stream effectively um but um i I'm not gonna lie, and I'm very sorry. So if, if you're expecting this more reserved, conservative stream from now on, and I'm gonna be like, hmm, yeah, that's it. Um, I, I'm sorry, but that's not who I am, and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna pretend I'm enjoying something or pretend that I'm not enjoying something. Um, and just a, a reminder here at the beginning, because I assume that everyone's gonna watch this at the beginning on the VOD. Uh, when I speculate out loud, and when I think something, is gonna happen and I start getting annoyed I'm not annoyed at you know there were a few people that said oh Joe Joe thinks something's gonna happen and then judges the game as if he's right even though eight times out of ten I was right which is kind of weird there was some moments in the last stream where people like oh he thinks that and 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 he's 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 already judging it when that's not what happens and then later on it is what happens so I don't know where that's coming from but anyway that's besides the point um the 
the issue there is that people think that I'm preemptively judging the game and I'm not. I'm judging what I think is going to happen. And when I say, oh God, that would be terrible. I'm not saying, oh my God, the game's terrible. I'm saying, holy shit. I hope that doesn't happen because if it does, that's terrible. It's just that I'm not going to, to say, hey, disclaimer, I'm not talking about the game right now. I'm talking about my speculation. Oh, disclaimer, I'm just thinking out loud right now. That's 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 part of it. And I think most people get that, but there was a significant amount of people that didn't. So yeah, I think that's it. I think we're done. I think we're done. Yeah, I think we're done. Oh man. Hi. Okay, so uh, one more. Let, let me go through the list one more time, and then we'll get started. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's um, let's watch the intro, and then we'll go through the list one more time. Let's go. So let's get rid of the image. Sorry if that was tedious for some people that are already there with me, but it was important because there there was more backlash to this stream um, than any other. Chat has been worse than Danganronpa. The worst that Chad's ever been has been with Monster Hunter World. But the 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 backlash and comments and 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 messages that I got was has never been more than the end of Danganronpa. So let's get rid of uh, let's get rid of this. Ooh, there it is. There it is. And let's Alt F4. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was what, what was the flying flying white bear? Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. And let's watch the intro. Here we go. Dengen Rumpa. Goodbye to spare. Monokuma Monomi? Okay, how are you back there? Oh, it's Mishima. Okay. Hinata? Chiaki? Sonia? Blade? Akane? Akani? What the fuck is that face? Ninja guy. Leon. Mahuri. Cute Hifumi. Come on, Danny. Danny, are you here? Wait, 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 what was that? Wait, 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 wait. Who's, who's that guy? Oh, God. They're, they're only flashing them for a second. We can. He's back! And he's changed. It was... Was that him? Ba ba Bar Barracuda Togami, right? He's back. What? How is he back? Fat Catchy? How, how is... How is... How is... Okay, let's let's okay uh, again. All right, let's 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 see what happens. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Okay, so um, the stream might be look look like it's um, it's uh, it's frozen right now for one second, but I'm just gonna because I all tabbed out and I'm gonna say thank you to sub subs that came in and everything. Um, thank you, Pixel Pinocchio. That's a cool name for the new sub Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Pixel Pinocchio. Thank you, Victus X, for the new sub. Welcome to Dragon's Den. Welcome to Prime Time to RXLVO. Thank you very much. Rexelvo, maybe? Thank you. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Wuggy Not, for the 9 3 sub. A deadly stream. A deadly Prime subscription. A deadly Wuggy Not. <laughs> a deadly, deadly. I hope they do that again. At least once. I hope they do that again. Uh, thank you, JJ Mara813, for the 400 bits to say, have fun, have fun with the game and watch out for the hidden 16 student, Makuro Ikusaba. Fear her. Thank you. Thank you, JJ Mara. Uh, thank you, WeLink1000 for 100 bits. Pure positivity stream. Yeah, I don't think so, but thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you, Lesuk, for the 9 month resub with a uh, smiley face. Thank you. That's a good smiley face. Thank you, Lesuk. Uh, thank you, Bunny in Boots 24. That's a cool name for the new sub prime. Welcome, Bunny in Boots. Welcome, welcome. 
Thank you, Tim, for 500 bits. All you said so far, Joe, well, it makes sense. There's only one thing I want you to address. How does Leon fit into you not enjoying the game? Wait. It's because of Leon. Yeah, you're right. Na Na Nalians or Nalians for the new sub. Welcome to Dragon's Den, Nalians. Thank you, Zarek Kavanax, for the 11,037 bits. 11037. Wait, what can it mean? Secretly cheer. Uh. <laughs> Secretly, one one zero three seven is the mastermind of the uh, for the whole series. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised. That is a lot of bits. Thank you so much, Sarah Kevin X. The 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 meme hasn't died. It's still here. What could it mean? Flip it upside down. What could it mean? I think that uh, I, I think that the the zero three seven is 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 um with uh with one of our kids uh, smeared poop on the wall is is the best joke I've ever had on stream, ever. I'm so proud of it. Even even looking back, I'm so proud of it. That is that is the best joke that we've ever had on stream. Thank, thank you so much for the bits, that's so generous. Uh, thank you, JGMara813 for 70 more bits with, wait, Leon, exactly. Uh, Dragon555 for the 100 bits. I can only stay for a little bit, but I got you a quick waifu joke. Oh, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Waifu Joe, they turn me into a waifu. Dragon Tails. Oh, do, do I, do I, do I, does Waifu Joe collect them and pretend to be a dragon? Waifu Joe needs to get some sleep. This is quite accurate. Quite accurate. Thank you, thank you for the Waifu Joe. Who's suspiciously lolly like I think. But thank you, thank you. Thank you for the Waifu Joe. Thank you, Victus X, for the 100 bits. Shout out to my VOD boys at home. Hey, VOD viewers. How's it going, VODs? VODerites? VOD, vo vo I don't know. What do the, what do the VOD people call themselves? Uh, thank you, Vindictive Taters. That's a cool name for the new Subway Prime. Thank you very much, Vindictive Taters. And last but by certainly no means least, Kratos Sauron for the eight month resub. Oh no, it begins again. Don't play too fast. I need to keep ahead of your streams. Uh, we're actually going to be doing some longer streams. Probably not today, but starting tomorrow, the streams will be longer. I think we're going to go for about five, six hours today, uh, but tomorrow we'll be going a bit longer. We might start somewhat earlier too for some for some days. I want to I want to get the game done a little faster than the first one. Yeah. So yeah. Thanks everybody. All right, let's get started. Let's finally get started. All right, here we go. Um, it's moving. Yeah, so we should be good. So press start. All right, so I'm playing the keyboard and mouse. Uh, the flying bear just just went away again. All right, so I loaded the game up yesterday just to make sure it worked, and that was it. So um, and it worked, so it's fine. Extras. I don't think we need to look through that. Options. Um, Everyone said that the everything was good with the. Uh, I think we'll only move vertical speed up a little bit. I think everyone said everything was good with the sound. You can correct me if I'm wrong after we get into the game and they start talking. Um, maybe we didn't save anything there. And let's go to new game and get started with from the beginning. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going English. And we're going mean again. And let's go. All right. Hey. Hey. Can you hear me? That sounds like Makoto. Are you okay? You seem pretty out of it. To be honest, I'm also... No, everyone else feels the same too. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Yeah, that, he sounds really familiar. Hey, are you listening? I can't remember what eye color Makoto's eyes were. Did he grow his hair out? I don't understand. Why am I here? What happened? I should try to remember that first. I began to think, disentangling the twisted knots that had formed in my mind. A deadly knot. Think, 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 think. As I gathered the fragments of my scattered memories, I began to piece together what actually happened. That's right, I... I... Starting PCS version 1.01. Ooh. Heart star music note. Dangarampa 2, goodbye despair. Game start. Okay.
That day, it wasn't just a typical day for me. It was a day that felt truly significant. And when that long-awaited day finally came, I felt proud in a way I can't really put into words. I felt like I had just become a part of something greater than myself. Does that make sense? Waffles, it just made me king of the fan site. It was Mishima's day to shine. Actually, that's exactly what it was like. I was truly in a dream. Hope's Peak Academy. What? That place was... What? That place was... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. That place was so much more than a school to me. Kids who love to play baseball will long join to... Will long to join the major leagues. Kids who love to play soccer will long to join the rep team. And ever since I was a kid, I felt the same way about Hope's Peak Academy. Uh, world's looking pretty not destroyed. Hope's Peak Academy is a government funded. So is this a prequel? Was the world not destroyed? Was it a lie at the end? I don't think so. Hope Speak Academy is a government-funded school for the privileged elite of society. It recruits top students from every imaginable field to inspire hope and in doing so shape the future. Whenever Hope Speak Academy is mentioned, it's only a matter of time before someone says, If you come here and manage to graduate, you'll be set for life. It's the same thing as last time, I think. And just so you know, that's not a joke or an exaggeration at all. Many of the current leaders of various industries are actually alumni of the school. Well, that's basically what Hope Speak Academy is all, all about. As they say, it's truly the ac Academy of Hope. There are two criteria you must meet in order to attend the school. One, you must be a current high school student. Two, you must be the very best at what you do. Unlike other schools, there aren't any entrance exams at this academy. The only way to get in is if the school scouts you itself. That is how Hope Speak Academy operates. Now, because of the talents of those who are chosen, the students of Hope's Peak Academy are called Ultimates. But even though I'm finally going to Hope's Peak Academy, the school I desired more than anything else, the truth is my circumstance is a little different than that of my peers. Well, I guess I can put that aside for now. You'll find that out soon enough, and it's nothing special worth talking about, I think. Anyway, I guess I should introduce myself first. I'm not so special that I have to introduce myself. And formalities are always a little embarrassing. Okay, so before we go any further, how how was the the, the volume of the voice? Should I turn it up a little bit, or is it fine? Thank you, L three two zero, for the eleven month resub. One more until a year. Time flies. It really does. It really does. It's a little low. Music is a little loud and it's a little low. Can I hit? Can I hit escape and 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 fix it right now? I, I'm afraid that I can't. I'm trying anyway. Okay, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Okay, maybe we can't do it. Maybe we can't do it. Is it is it an F key? F. Okay, we're just gonna continue for now. Well, this is what's expected. I guess that's how I should think about it. I pressed F1, it didn't do anything. I'm pressing it right now. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. It's okay. We'll just we'll just keep going. My name is Hajime Hinata. Hajime Hinata. Hajime. Hajime. Am I saying it right? I'm, I feel like I'm not. There's only one reason I came to Hope's Peak Academy, because I admired Hope's Peak Academy. You're the ultimate admirer. To me, attending Hope's Peak Academy is like being a celebrity or a superhero. In fact, instead of calling it admiration, it's more like it's always been a dream of mine. You're the ultimate dreamer. That's why. To feel like a member of society, Whoa. to become someone I can be proud of. I always wanted to. Uh... For that reason alone, I always wanted to. For that reason alone, I always, 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 until now, I never wanted to admit how painfully ordinary I really am. That's why I hope I might have admired talent individuality but i have finally forever tried my best finally came true three plus d huh what is this all right what kind of arsenal gear bullshit is this it's a door there's a door 
still, I need to hurry because I need to go inside this classroom. Need? What need? No, I should hurry. Oh, well, I found our waifu. She's sitting on the on the desk in the back. Um, we, we got her. We found her, boys. Oh, I like I like her with the black ribbon and her hair on the left. Is that really Chad Ketchy? Huh? Huh? Who goes there? Who goes there? Um, are you feeling all right? You look quite pale. Um. Hey, could you be? You're also a freshman at this school, right? Uh, then you're all. See for yourself. We're all freshmen too. Who's the freshest man now? These guys, everyone. The freshmen who were accepted into Hope's Peak Academy, the Ultimates. Why do you have bandages on your leg and your and your arm? I assume freshmen like us have been gathered in this classroom. Gathered? Murdered. <laughs> hey, why don't you just come inside for now? Eh? Ah, uh, yes, of course. Wait, why am I being so polite? I know they're called the Ultimates, but they're still high school students like me. That's right, first impressions are crucial in moments like this. I need to act more confident. Thus, to hide my nervousness from the others, and while trying my very best to act cool. Okay, so he's the one from the opening. The guy with the with the, the hoodie jacket looks really cool. I'd like, I'd like to have one of those. I'd like to have one of those. I'm, I'm becoming way, mo way more of a, of a weeb. Uh, because I like to have one of those. Oh, I, I remembered something the other the other night that's gonna piss all of you off. Um, so uh, as 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 a as a weeb in training, I just want to let you know that I've already surpassed all of you because I've lived the dream. When when I when I when I was seven years old, okay, my my first girlfriend was from Japan. She she was she was she was a, a Japanese girl named Veronica. So uh, when I was in elementary school, that was my first girlfriend. So I already beaten you all. I've won. I've won. So there we go. Not even a weeb yet, and I've already surpassed all of you. She was really nice. I stepped inside, closed the door behind me, and sat in an open seat at the back of the classroom. Anyway, what just happened earlier? I wanted to be here, and then a classroom door appeared right in front of me. Re we have a flashback already? Really? Really, game? Really? Really? We're two minutes in. As if it was, as if I was drawn to it. But how did I walk to this classroom? I don't remember. Something's weird. Um, excuse me? What? What is it? Was that his his voice act, act the same? Wait, hold on. Why are we all gathered in this classroom? No one said anything about coming here. So, is there like an entrance ceremony or a homeroom happening now? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's him. Actually, we were just about to discuss that matter. Discuss? It's all clear now. Well, since you're the the, the volume is a little low, I'm gonna I'm gonna raise after this. Well, since you were the last student to arrive, let's start the discussion. <laughs> Okay, goth demon horns. Uh, this is everyone. How do you know? I'm sad there's no Danny. There are only 16 desks in this classroom, and this guy is the 16th student. Oh, we're the 16th student this time. Damn. Come right back around. We're Makuro. It's us. Such ignorance. It's obvious if you bother to think about it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is that?
<laughs> okay, that is not Hifumi. I thought that was like cute Hifumi in the opening, but that is not what that is. What is that? That is that is so scary. Just <laughs> it's fucking Chef Boy RD. What the fuck? <laughs> or the the. The, the, the Pillsbury Doughboy, you poke his stomach and he goes, hoo hoo, that's, that's a, who the fuck is this guy? And just what are we gonna talk about? The reason we're all gathered here in this classroom. First, I need to confirm something out of everyone here. Is there anyone who actually remembers how they came to this classroom? Eh? We all looked around at each other. A surprised look appeared on everyone's face. Not one person raised their hand. I see. So before you realized it, you were in this classroom, then everyone here is in the same predicament. Very strange. Very strange. No matter how you look at it, it's unnatural. Even you stupid looking ones would agree, right? What's going on? It, it sure is strange. Nobody actually remembers how they came here. Alright, thanks Wendy. Hey. hey, what what do you mean stupid looking? So in other words The moment you set foot on campus you felt a strange dizziness and now you're here and you don't know why. That is what I experienced before I arrived here. Am I correct in assuming that's true of all of you? Okay, how... Uh, okay, we'll just keep going. That, that, that happened to me too, but... Eh? That dizziness wasn't just me? Everyone felt the same dizziness. That's weird. E even if it's just a coincidence, it feels too good to be true. Okay. Okay, Toko. Naturally. So you're saying it's not just a coincidence then? Hmm? Yeah, I like I, I like you, blonde Hermione. I like you. You're pretty good. So in other words, meaning we can only speculate who's responsible for this strange phenomenon. Wh who's responsible? What is it? It feels like this is going to get even stranger. Huh? I. D <laughs> you look different from the others. Ha! Huh? I don't know what you're so worried about, but that doesn't sound like a huge deal. Huh? What do you mean? <sighs> Is this the, the Mondo and the Leon of the group? So what I mean is... Are you the ultimate, ultimate car gang guy? I mean, it's a minor problem. Instead of trying to figure out why we're here, we should try to figure out why we can't leave. What's that mean? Uh, ooh, okay. Competition. Competition. Hmm. Hmm. Even bigger Owie. Hey, Owie. Hey. Nice owies. Uh, what do you mean we can't leave? Impossible. Huh? So seriously? I watched him rush over to the door and try with all his might to pull it open, but clatter, clatter, clatter. Oh, it's it's this. This is a guy. Okay, it, it won't open. I can't open it. Huh? It was it like the art style is so so strange that it was hard to tell. Huh? Why? A little while after I got here, I tried to leave to go take. A that door wouldn't budge at all. So do you still need to go? Is that why you're growling? You're holding it in? Hey, 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 hey what's going on? Sheesh. Even with all my might, I couldn't open it. It'd be absolutely impossible for all of you. What? Eh? What do you mean you couldn't open it? Why? That's not possible. What is wrong with your face? She, she's right. It's impossible. The crescent moon hair and, and the... This feels like fan fiction of the first game with these characters because I went through the door. When I went through the door, it opened autom It opened normally. It wasn't locked at all. Though I don't understand what forces are at work here. What is on your? What's on your on your back? Like a bazooka. It kind of reminds me of Makuro. There's no denying that we have been locked inside this classroom. Okay. Locked inside. What do you mean? I suddenly became aware of how heavy my body felt, as though a feeling of unspeakable dread began settling on my shoulders. Are we screwed? Or maybe we're getting mixed up in something dangerous? This is... Or perhaps, doesn't it make more sense to think that this is the entrance exam? I don't think they were an entrance exam. The entrance exam, you mean Hope's Peak Academies? However... But according to Hope's Peak Academy, no ent no, no, s but according to Hope's Peak Academy, no such entrance exam exists. But... 
they may say that publicly, but it's possible this is actually a special entrance exam. That's a good point. That's wrong. Ah, you're wrong. This is not an entrance exam. What? What was that just now? Hey, bastard. Hey, f <laughs> Hey, fat ass. Why'd you make that cutesy voice all of a sudden? Who are you? Hmm. I won't dispute your blunt remark about my weight, but that voice you just heard was not mine. Huh? <laughs> then who's what? Whose is it? Um. um, it's actually mine. Who's there? Where are you? Perhaps. Is the bear back? It sounds like it came from behind the teacher's desk. Behind the teacher's desk. Hello. All right, I see everyone has arrived. Let's begin. All right. What? Monomi from the that? from the opening movie. Monomi with her Sailor Moon staff. What is that? Um, it looks like a stuffed animal. That's right. I am a squeezably soft stuffed animal. That that voice before sounded familiar. Did they reuse voice actors from the first game? We've played so many weeb games at this point that I think they're all starting to blend together. Magical Miracle Girl Usami, aka Usami. Usami? Magical Miracle Girl Usami. I may not look like it, but I am your squeezably soft teacher. Nice to meet you all. Huh? Am I hallucinating? Am I the only one who's seeing this? Everyone say yes. On? Everyone say no. God damn it. Not Leon. God damn it. Okay, you're Noel. We're calling you Noel. Huh? Nah, I see it too. Huh? What's with this talking chihuahua? Eh? That's a chihuahua? Everyone. Does everybody here know what a rabbit is? It's a lovable animal that's very fluffy and soft. <laughs> That's what I am, a singing, dancing, talking rabbit mascot. Oh. Hold on, let me process this first. Okie dokie. Um. um, what do you guys think? I I've never seen a stuffed animal that can sing, dance, and talk before. Well, one of us has. <laughs> it's, it's probably remote controlled or something. Don't act like such a pussy over a child's toy. Hmm. Even if it's remote controlled, doesn't it look too lifelike? That's pretty advanced for a toy. Stop talking. Its movements and mannerisms are not the issue. More importantly, based on what it just said. Come on. It seems you know something about our current situation. Of course I do. I'm the lead teacher of this school trip. What school trip? Come on. Hey, what do you mean school trip? <laughs> a large group of students go on a chaperone trip with the lead teacher. It's the biggest event of the school year. We're not looking for such a literal answer. Now let's depart for the fun school trip. Depart? Wait, who said... Okay. What? Damn it. Huh? huh? I couldn't believe my eyes. What is the music? Not just my eyes, but my brain too. The world just stopped making sense. The classroom collapsed like a stage set, and what appeared before me instead was blue sky, white clouds, blue sea, white waves. What the hell is this? It's, it's arsenal gear. That's what it is. No matter how I tried to rationalize it, it was abnormal. Cl clearly unreasonable, utterly crazy, blatantly wrong, deadly. Um. Whoa, 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 what? Are you kidding me? This is a joke, right? Emergency! Where are we? Why? Huh? Well, what's going on? Everyone. 
Everyone, please stay calm. There is no reason to panic. See? Look around. Feast your eyes on this beautiful ocean. It's like your heart is being washed clean, isn't it? It washes away everything, even all the bad things. Say goodbye to despair. Hold on. Hold on. Give us the details. Where in the world are we? Where, you ask? Well, obviously we're... Out where it's better. Out where it's wetter. <laughs> out by the sea. Okay, so so we all we all blocked out and we were always here and they set up a they set up a classroom and they just kind of fell away and we we didn't know that we were already on the beach. I understand this is the sea, but what are we doing here? You know, your throat's gonna get hoarse if you keep screaming like that. But we were just at school, and now we are by the sea. This is impossible. Please do not worry. The school trip has just started. That's all. But, like, why are we on a school trip all of a sudden? You totally skipped all the stuff that comes first. She's right. We're all supposed to be attending Hope's Peak Academy. Ah, uh, Hope's Peak Academy. I see, I see. You don't say. You guys are feeling unsure about Hope's Peak Academy, then. In that case, please forget about Hope's Peak Academy. That's why we're having a school trip in the first place. Huh? The hell do you mean we should forget about it? Okay, it's the eyes. The eyes remind me of of Chihiro. That's 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 what that's why I, I stumbled when when I saw this character before. It's it's the eyes. Come on. Hey, what are you what are you just what are you scheming? What, what what? I'm not scheming anything. I'm doing this for everyone's sake. So that's probably going to be chat's, chat's waifu slash husbando right there. I'm praying from the bottom of my heart that hope will grow within everyone's heart. No there's nothing dangerous on this island whatsoever, so please, there's no need to worry at all. Wait. Got that hope, 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 hope. Island? Did you just say island? Yeah. Yep, and it certainly is beautiful. It was prepared just for us, an island free from other people in danger. Are you saying this island is uninhabited? Could it be? Perhaps you brought us to this uninhabited island to make us all- to make us kill each other? What? Huh? Whoa, that was a- that was a leap there? From- from- from not Makoto? Huh? What? what? Kill each other? Nuh-huh. Yes. -huh. No way. Bloody business like causing violence or inflicting pain is a big no-no on this island. Even the word kill, just saying it horrifies me. Yeah, so scary. What are you thinking? Then what is the school trip you mentioned? What do you intend for us to do on this island? Alrighty, I shall announce it to everyone right now. While you are all relaxed on this island paradise, you must get along and strengthen your bonds with one another. That is the main rule on this heart-throbbing school trip. <laughs> heart-throbbing school trip. That's right. Spend these peaceful and relaxing days nourishing hope and lazing about, free from pain, free from suffering. Truly, this lovey-dovey heart-throbbing school trip is... Everyone's homework. What? What the hell does that even mean? Now then. Let the heart-throbbing school trip begin! Alright then. It goes without saying, but I had no idea what she was talking about. I couldn't follow her words at all. And then, just like that, like a curtain slowly lowering. My mind ground to a halt. Super Mario Sunshine! All right, so Sonya and Ak Akane are our waifu so far. <laughs> oh, a little bit of darkness there. Dangan Island. Are you okay? Are we having fun chat? Huge panic at the heart throbbing school trip? Question mark. Fuck yeah, we want to save. Jack, would you like to save? Hey. Oh man. Um, one second. Uh, let me say thank you to some subs before we continue. Uh, thank you, Bracky Boo, for the new sub of Prime. Thank you very much, Bracky Boo, or Bracky Boo. 
Uh, thank you, and Hunter, for the 100 bits. I'm 30 minutes. I'm here 30 minutes late. Tell me what happened. Um, I think that just summed it up what you just saw. Don't worry. You, you, you've been here for 15 minutes. You're fine. Don't worry. You're good. Uh, Vfisk has resubscribed for... There's already been a flashback. Let's put it that way, and Hunter. Uh, Vfisk has resubscribed for six months. Only Brainlet's pick Hifumi. True Patrician's pick Kawakami every month until you accept... Like, 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 come on. Har Haru's better than both. Haru's better than both combined. Haru for life. Uh, Com Combustalmon? It's a weird Pokemon. Has just subscribed. Wel uh, welcome to Dragon's Den. Thank you, Combustalmon. Thank you, Victus X, for another 100 bits. Joe's waifu choice always um, dies first. Just remember that chat. Ooh, so I have power, right? I have power. Do I do I have the power to, uh, to, to, to decide who dies first? Uh... Wekis on fire or we kiss on fire has just subscribed. I thought I said your name before. Maybe maybe the sub right now, or maybe you gave some bits at some point, or maybe I read your name in chat. I don't know, but your name is familiar to me. But thank you so much. Thank you. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Mr. Randerus, for the three month resub. Thank you very much, Mr. Randerus. Thank you, Pow ba Pow Pow Giraffe. Cool name with the new sub of Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Pow Pow Giraffe. And thank you, Pop Workman, for the new sub of Prime as well. Welcome to Prime Time, Pop Workman. Thank you so much, everybody. I have the power to kill a waifu. Just letting you know, Tubi's voice actress is in this game. Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? She's default choice. Who is she? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Okay, we're back at the beginning now. All right. Are you okay? You seem pretty out of it. Really sounds like Makoto. To be honest, I'm also... No, everyone else feels the same too. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Maybe it's just the same voice actor doing, doing a different... Because he's definitely... He's... He's definitely a different voice. It's it, there's a different strain on 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 certain parts of it. Hey, are you listening? Hey, listen. Hey. Hey, are you sure you're okay? Leave me alone. There's no way I can leave someone alone when they look like that pale. White sandy beach, crystal blue ocean, the sun's rays beaming down on me, this soft tropical wind brushing my skin. I definitely don't know what's going on. I was supposed to attend Host Peak Academy. Why did this? Why am I here at a place like this? That rabbit thing said we're on a tropical island. You're right. Yeah, you're right. I have no idea what's going on. That's the only thing I can say with absolute certainty. Welcome to Dangang Island. I will explain the basic controls to you. Oh, thanks, tutorial guy. It's been a while. With the mouse, you can maneuver the reticule. Red reticle? Reticle? Not reticule. Reticle on the screen. If the reticle responds, press the left mouse button. You can then examine that person or object. Also, you can shift your point of view with the WASD keys. Plus, if you press the tab key, you can use a mysterious power to see everything you can examine. The world share has become super convenient if you're able to do all this from the get-go. <laughs> now then, please search this beach thoroughly and progress the story. Okay, can we, can we, uh... Can we, can we change the, um, the settings yet? Or no? No. Coconut tree. Oh, cool. It says what it is. I don't remember if it said that before. I guess it makes sense for there to be palm trees on a tropical island. That's a mighty fine palm tree, but now, but now it's not the time for me to be impressed by it. It's true. The crystal clear shining blue sea. It's perfect for a tropical island. Just what's going on here. You never wanted anything like this at all. Why is there a monitor in a place like this? The screen is blank. What is this being used for? Uh, thank you, Finn Freezer, for the new sub as well. Welcome to Dragon's Den. Welcome to the Rub Dub Sub Club, Finn Freezer. I'll see if I can if I can keep up with it as we go so we don't have to stop like we just did, but um that's unlikely. Surveillance camera. <gasps> A surveillance camera. Hmm, is that a camera? A surveillance camera. Are we being monitored or something? That's not it. I wouldn't say we're being monitored. I think we're just being watched for our safety. <laughs> well, it's a waste of time to think about it. Best not to worry. Look the bird flying. Looks like a folded piece of paper. What's with this guy? How can he be so calm in a situation like this? Maybe he's just a chill guy. Yeah, totally chill. Hey. Gonna pound back some brewskis. 
So how are you feeling? Are you calm down? <laughs> calm down now? Um, I understand your confusion after everything that's happened, but why don't we start with an introduction? Introduction? I'm Nagito Komaeda. Nice to meet you. Really? Okay. Nice to meet you. What was Makoto's last name? Nayagi? Okay. Ultimate lucky student. What was his Latin? The D doesn't fit. No, no, okay, I just, I guess I'm just seeing shit. The D doesn't fit. Uh, along with my introduction, I guess I'll also tell you about my talent so you know why Hope Speak Academy chose me. Well, even if I tell you, in my case, it's a pretty disappointing talent. A disappointing talent? What do you mean? I'm lucky. I'm lucky. What are you talking about? That's not it. It's not a joke or anything. That's my actual talent. I'm the ultimate lucky student. At least that's what I... <laughs> Ultimate lucky student? You're right. It's through a countrywide lottery, apparently only one ordinary student is selected at random to attend Host Peak Academy as the ultimate lucky student, and that lucky winner just happened to be me. Chosen by a lottery, is that really okay? I mean, is luck even a real talent in the first place? All right, so we're, we're not the same as that then, so what is our ultimate ability? Because because we're, we're an ordinary guy, but we're not the same as, as last time, I guess? How strange. What happened? Your face looks troubled. Oh no, I'm not troubled or anything. <laughs> oh, no, it's fine. I have mixed feelings about this too. Someone like I never thought an average, talentless high school student like me would ever enter Hope's Peak Academy. At first, I declined. I told them I didn't deserve it. But they told me that told me they really wanted me to attend. Apparently, the so-called luck of mine is a talent that even the school doesn't fully understand. To research it, the school picks the ultimate lucky student every year through an annual lottery. <laughs> Hope's Peak Academy is amazing if they can actually research something as vague as luck. I, I really like that, it's really cool. I liked it in the first game too. Well, thanks to that luck, a guy li like me was able to attend Host Peak Academy, so for that I'm grateful. This is trouble. But on the other hand, I feel a little out of place here. Uh, sorry, I have a bad habit of viewing most things through a pessimistic lens. Yeah, me too. Um, yeah, I guess that's it for my introduction. Hmm. Nagito Komameda, huh? He doesn't. I'm just gonna call you. I, I I can't. I'm just gonna call you Makoto. He doesn't seem like the most reliable guy, but he doesn't strike me as a bad person either. Hey. Now then, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm. Hi me. Hi me. Hi Jimmy. Hi Jimmy. Hanada. I'm so bad with names. This is something else that people got got mad at me for was that I gave everyone nicknames and everything. Uh, I, that's not being disrespectful to, to to the game or the characters or anything. I just don't know how to fucking say their names. So I just I just give them nicknames that I can say better. Hajime, Hajime, Hajime. Can we just call him Jimmy? Just call him Hanada. Can we call him Jimmy? I like Jimmy. We're calling him Jimmy. All right, we're Jimmy. But th then let me ask you a question. What is your ultimate talent? Um, I, 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 I opened my mouth, but the words would not form. I felt my thoughts stalling in my head, as if I opened a book expecting to find words, and instead found blank pages. It was that. Ooh, the the spooky music's back. It was that kind of uncomfortable feeling. I uh, thank you, Shohei, for the five month uh resub with the message. Hey, 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 Shohei. Thank you. 
Uh, Combustalmon has used 1,000 bits. Really happy to finally watch you live, watch a ton of your VODs. Also, it's Combust Lemon. But come on, Combustalmon sounds like a fire-type Pokemon. Like, come on. Combustalmon, come on. What does it evolve into? Combustalmon, Combustalmon. Like, come on, it sounds great. All right, co co Combust Lemon. All right, that's pretty good too. Thank you. Thank you, Combust Lemon. Thank you so much for the for, for, for the thousand bits. That's really, that's really generous. Thank you. Thank you so much. Combustible one. I'm sorry. And thank you, Victus, Victus X, for the 100 bits. You're the ultimate waifu, Joe. Ooh. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. We're the ultimate waifu. It was that kind of uncomfortable feeling. The memory I was trying to recall had completely vanished from my mind. Huh? Without realizing it, my body began to shudder as waves of discomfort began pounding against me. All right, so when when you try to make sense of things, you pass out? What happened? Jimmy, what happened? Ah, uh, it's nothing. I guess I'm still pretty confused about all this. I'm having trouble remembering some things. I understand how your memory might be confused after suddenly getting into a situation like this. <laughs> I'm sure you'll remember soon once you settle down. So, I don't think you need to worry about, all that, about it all that much. You're right. Yep. Then I guess we're done with our introductions, for now. Even though I don't know what's going on, I hope we can get along. Obtained Hope Fragment? Hey, did something just beep? What? What a weird sound. I hastily stuck my hand into my pocket. That's right, that strange mechanical sound just now definitely came from the, in from the inside of my pocket. What the hell is this? It's like a PDA or a smartphone. Why is something like this inside my pocket? Are you okay? Usami was passing them out earlier, remember? <laughs> oh right, you seemed pretty out of it when that was going on. And now that you mention it, I think I kind of remember, but what is this? <laughs> ding, 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 ding. It's an e-handbook. What the? Where'd you come from? I'm sorry. Oh, did I startle you? I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> Teehee, I know how to apologize like a good girl. Um... Anyway, don't you think it's cool? That handbook is absolutely vital for the school trip, so make sure you don't lose it. This device is that important? I I've asked everyone to use their e-handbook to gather all of the hope fragments. Hope fragments? That's right. um, on this island, you'll obtain hope fragments as you get along with your classmates. As your relationship with everyone improves, you'll be able to gather more and more hope fragments. Gather hope fragments so that the flower of hope achieves its full bloom. Truly, that is. The main purpose of this school trip. Love, love. love, love. Okay, are you making us all love each other? Because then when we start killing each other, it'll be even more delicious. Hey, hey she's gone. A stuffed animal. You can't have despair without hope. A stuffed animal that moves, talks, and also appears when it, wherever and whenever she wants. Regardless of who's actually controlling it, it still doesn't make any sense. And what was all that about hope fragments? What's her deal? It's like we're in a game or something. Oh, damn. <laughs> this feels like a game that's rather comforting. That means we aren't going to be in danger right away. You're probably right, but more importantly, you don't know anything about the other students yet, right? Yep. Yeah. Then I think it's best if you at least introduce yourself to them. That's also true, but where did everyone go? Perhaps. Maybe they're exploring the island as well? Exploring the island? Hey. As long as we're expected to live on this island, we should learn as much as we can about it. For example, what's this island's name? Is there a way to escape? What about food and living arrangements? So why don't we finish introducing ourselves to the others and explore the island at the same time? I pretty much went around and introduced myself to everyone already, but I'll tag along with you. So now he's decided to come with me. Well, I guess that's helpful for me. I know I'd worry if I was left on my left on my own. All right. Shall we get going then? But is this really okay? To feel so relaxed in such a strange situation? Perhaps it's the tropical climate? Or is it that, what's her name, Usami's fault? What happened? What is it, Jimmy? Let's get, let's get going. Right, right, got it. At any rate, if this is a nightmare, I have no idea if it's even started yet. Sheesh, what kind of nightmare is that? You are now able to use the handbook if you use it to check. You can use it to check various information throughout the game. I think I, I read a line wrong there. Sorry about that. You can open the handbook with the F1 key. It's super easy. Why is the period off there? Okay, I'm pressing F1. It includes the guidelines of the school trip and the report card, which documents everybody's information. There are various features inside the handbook. You can also save and load your game inside the handbook. Please check out the system page as well. But wait, there's more. You can also view the transcript with the F2 key. Damn, that's all there is about the handbook. I strongly recommend you play around with it yourself. Now then, please go forth and look for everyone else. All right, you can exit the beach with the R key. All right. Okay, let's turn, oh, voice volume is all the way up. All right, so let's turn, 
let's turn background volume down two, sound effects volume down two, and let's turn the main sound up on OBS. Okay, so it might be a little too loud now, so let me know. How, how is that? How do I save? Music is too loud? Okay, let me turn the music down. Okay, did that help or did that do nothing? That's good. Sound effects is too loud? Really? How's that? Is that better? One more down? Okay. Whoops, pet. I had one of those when I was in school. What, what are they called? Where you had the little little pet things, you had to keep it alive. Um. The Tamagotchis, Tamagotchis. I had one of those. I had a Tamagotchi. Hope meter, despair meter, until next growth. Clean. Regulations. Extreme violence is prohibited on the island. Please live peacefully peaceful and relaxing lives with your fellow students. Be considerate of each other and work together to obtain hope fragments. Littering is not allowed. Let us coexist with this island's bountiful nature and mutual prosperity. The lead teacher cannot directly interfere with the students. An exception to this rule is made if any student violates a rule. Okay. Okay, so we don't have... We don't have... Uh, we don't know their names yet. We have one hope fragment out of uh, six with uh, with Makoto. Date of birth January first. Damn. Likes Kusamochi. What's that? Dislikes Sakura Mochi. I have no idea what those are. Height five eight. Height five nine. One hundred forty three pounds. Uh, chest 33 inches, April 28th, likes pretty things, dislikes noisy places, uh, special notes, ultimate lucky student. Presents. Oh, it's back. Do we get coins? Are there coins? Question, question mark, map. Perhaps? I think everyone else is exploring the island. As long as we're expected to live on this island, we should at least try to learn about it. While we're exploring the island, why don't we also finish introducing ourselves to everybody? Okay, it seems like sound is good now, so just sorry, I was just fixing my window. Uh, thank you to Zykeprod for the two month resub. Never forget that the meat is always on the bone. Alright. I will I will try to never forget that. Thank you, Zykeprod. Thank you very thank you very much. Is that, a, is that a cryptic clue? Thank you, The Wazoo, for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, The Wazoo. Thank you very much. I think I said your name before, The Wazoo. It's happening a lot lately. Thank you very much, uh, The Wazoo. Yeah, you're right. Okay, let's get out of here. Leave here. Hey. Uh, about exploring the island. It appears a map of this island has been installed onto this e-handbook. If you use this, you should be able to find everyone easily. Actually... To be honest, before I arrived at the school, I did some research about everyone on the internet. I, ha I haven't learned everything about everyone, but I'm pretty sure I can give you some helpful info. Wait, you can research stuff like that on the internet? Uh, uh you don't know? This school is so popular, there are message boards online dedicated to talking about its students. 
Then was I also... Hmm. Hmm, I don't recall seeing your name there. I probably overlooked it. How unexpected. How unexpected? Well, it's not your fault if you really can't remember. I'm sure my name was mentioned on there. It's not a mistake. I was accepted to host Peak yep. Academy. Anyway, I'll help you out too. So why don't we begin making your introductions? Oh, okay, you're right. So first I need to introduce myself to everyone else on the island. Then... Oh, I should apologize. There was something I forgot to tell you. If you look at the map in your e-handbook, you will be able to see where everyone is. You can also instantly travel to any location displayed as we go. Also, when you travel to a point with an exclamation mark, the story will progress. It's super convenient. Now, let's go. Okay, so someone asked me to uh, make a prediction of who I think is going to live to the end of the game. Um, so I want to meet everyone first before I do that, and then we'll go through the e-handbook, and I'll, and I'll, and I'll predict. I, I'm assuming that it's going to be six people again that are going to live to the end, but maybe it's different. But that's, that's the assumption I'm going to make, I'm gonna, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick six that I think will survive to the end. What is wrong with that palm tree on the left there? It's just, it's just, just sticking out of an angle from the other one, with the base of it not even in the sand. Travel on the island can be done through this screen. You can move with WASD keys. You can run by holding the shift key while you move. Uh, if you press the Q and E keys, you can also instantly move to the next area. When the reticle, reticle responds, you can go inside places by pushing the left mouse button. You've probably realized it by now, but you happen to have your very own pet inside your e-handbook. I did realize your pet grows based on the number of steps you take, so try walking to places instead of using map, instead of using map jump. When you finish raising your pet, there may be a small reward. Damn. Oh, whoa, what the hell? Okay. This is different. All right, so beach, central island. Airport, yeah, airport, okay. How's our pet doing, how many steps? This is the most important thing. Until next year, 20 seconds. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna grow, it's gonna grow, it's gonna grow. Rocket Punch Market. Hotel. Yes! Oh, it's it's turning into a little a little bear thing. That, that the, 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 the girl Monokuma. Oh, yeah. Presents? We don't have any presents. Clean? No. Hotel. Oh, look at the cows! Ranch. Well, this is neat. And that's Central Island again, right? Central Island, okay. So there's, there's two islands? Oh my god. What the fuck? Okay, can we go can we go here? Will it let us? Probably not. I don't think so. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy, it looks like if we go across this bridge we can reach another island not far from here. Is it safe? <laughs> that's what we're going to that's what we're going there to find out, right? If it's not safe when we get there, then what will we do? Oh, we can go there. All right. Central Island. First Island. Okay. Oh. Uh, Fat Ketchy's here. First Island. That is some rough looking water in the background there. see a bridge in the distance but it looks like there's a gate blocking it. Mm. it looks like there's another island on the other side of the bridge but it seems like we can't cross it okay yeah that seems to be the case yep yeah, I agree <laughs> Jabberwock Park is that where Fat Ketchy is yeah he is okay uh, so I'm assuming that every single one of these around around the the island is 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 closed right now. So let's just, I just want to confirm. Yep, it is okay. But there seems to be something else there. I want to see it. Uh, thank you, Sylvanus Gray, for the seven month resub. Uh, woo, almost a term. 
<laughs> that is everyone's favorite joke when they get to the lighthouse, when they get close to nine months. Uh, thank you for the resub. Tim Foley's 100 bits. Jimmy, to say Jimmy runs like a Q-Op speed run. Yeah, he does. Yep. I see it too. Thank you for pointing that out. You can instantly travel with Huni. Yeah, I know, but you don't level up the pet like that. First island again. All right, so we're good. So what did I what did I miss? What's this thing up here? Maybe I, maybe I ran past it because I was looking at chat. Okay. Check pet. All right, let's check. Despair. Oh no! Oh no, we need to clean. Oh shit! Thank you, chat. Thank you. Damn, that was close. Level up. What do you mean level up? D -d 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 -d. No, that's not it. What level up? We're level two. All right. Oh, that looks cool. So this is a park. This is a park surrounded by the ocean. <laughs> hmm, it feels so nice. Such a laid back attitude. But if we weren't in a situation like this, I'd probably be enjoying some lazy sunbathing myself. If being the key word. How are your introductions going? I'd like to inform you about another feature. We haven't even met anybody yet. You may have already noticed, but you have a level assigned to you. Yeah, 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 I did. It's displayed on the top right corner of your screen. Yeah, your level increases by performing various actions, such as walking, examining, and talking to others. Damn. Damn. Every time you level up, you will become stronger than you were before. The number of skills you can equip will also increase, so please try your hardest to level up often. All right, I'm just, okay, good. All right, so the game is telling me to level up often. All right, so um, I'm gonna go and just run around in circles for the next hour to get to get levels up, okay? Uh, ah, Jimmy, there seems to be someone over there. Why don't you introduce yourself? No, 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 I wanna go level up. I wanna go grind. Yeah, you're right. Chat will love it. Chat will love it. It's a bronze statue of various animals, plus it's pretty huge. Amazing! Wow, what a grand statue. Yeah, it's grand. But isn't it isn't it also kind of creepy? What? You think so? I think it looks splendid. Splendid? I mean, look at it. It probably symbolizes the whole island. It sure is grand. This island symbol, huh? So it's a it's a tiger, a giant snake with a guy on a horse with a big bird behind him. Hmm. Looks cool, I like it. All right, there's another uh, another camera and another monitor. Okay, let's talk to Fat Ketchy. What do you want? What do you want? This guy's presence is overwhelming. He doesn't seem very approachable. Even his body is overwhelming. Hey. Ah, Barracuda, have time for a small introduction? Hmm. Introduction. <laughs> Come on, Jimmy. Um, hello, my name is Jimmy Hinata. My name is Byakuya Togami. Yep, it's him. It's him. How are you here? <laughs> I'm done. That's it, right? Did your memory get erased again? Back off. I can tell this guy is thumbing his nose at me. Hmm. Well, I suppose that's Barracuda for you. What do you mean? Actually, that guy is particularly special, even by ultimate standards. He's next in line to inherit his family's massive financial conglomerate. He's already begun managing the business operations, and his net worth is well enormous. How admirable! It's completely accurate to call him the ultimate affluent progeny. He's the epitome of exceptional. That's like a manga origin story. The background music is perfect, but SFX and voices are too loud. Are you sure? Can other people confirm? <laughs> you there. Jimmy, was it? fine most people are saying it's fine overwhelmingly fine overwhelmingly fine sorry it's gonna most people are saying it's fine so we're gonna stick with how it is sorry yeah tell me why did hope speak academy choose you what is your ultimate talent um the, the thing is i honestly can't remember what you don't remember <laughs> i'm i'm the ultimate detective this time apparently he lost his memory due to shock he can't really remember much <laughs> humph how foolish um, yes. I do believe we have finished talking. How much longer do you intend to stand there? Listen. Move along. That's the only thing you skinny types are good at, it seems. 
Let's just leave, Jimmy. Yeah, sure thing. His build and that overwhelming aura of refinement just pushes people away. Is this what it means to be ultimate affluent progeny? Okay. Uh, thank you, JJ Mara, 813 for 500 bits. Do you think one of your old backpacks is stuck on, is stuck on the statue? <laughs> Be the next Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'd like, someone left a comment on, on, on the, on the VOD on, uh, on YouTube saying that, um, why did he keep going for the backpacks when he hated them just to make fun of them? And I was like, no, I liked getting the backpacks. I thought it was kind of fun just, just swinging around getting the backpacks. I was... I was like, oh, that's, that sucks. What the hell? I like them. All right, um, so where are we going? I guess it doesn't matter. We can go to all the places in a row. Where's 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 Aoi 2.0? I want to see Aoi 2.0. I think that's her in there. All right, let's go see Aoi 2.0. Oh, thank you for the bitch, Jamara. Uh, thank you... Um, um, aren't you Duval? Oh, just a question through bits. Love the streams. I was wondering which first half did you enjoy better, God of War 2018 or Dark Souls 1? Dark Souls 1. This looks like a ranch. Through there, though there aren't many animals around. Right? Ah, uh, you found it out. You again. Oh no, chickens. Chickens didn't bode well last in the last game. You again. Seriously, where do you keep appearing from? I, I can show up anywhere, anytime. The system allows me to appear anywhere on the island. The system. It's all thanks to this handy dandy magic stick. Magic stick, huh? Is she talking about that toy she's holding? Hmm. Huh, still, I'm quite troubled. Are we in an arsenal gear? A, a ranch without any moo cows is like a soccer team without any balls. <laughs> you might want to rephrase that. Alrighties. Alrighty, just leave it to me and my handy dandy magic stick. Bibbidi bobbidi, bibbidi bobbidi, bibbidi bibbidi, bobbidi bobbidi. Turn into a moo cow! Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> Harumph, a huge success. What was that all? What was all that just now? A chicken changed into a cow? That's not it. Nah, it's probably some sort of trick or illusion. I bet it was set up before we got here. She was probably trying to make us happy, but I guess it had the op opposite effect on you, Jimmy. A trick? An illusion? Well, if you think rationally, it makes sense. A chicken can't just change into a cow. That's true. Messing with living things like that is just not cool, you know? Oh, what, what the fuck is this bird story? What's the bird story? Bird, do you have a coin? A tropical bird. That's what I should call it, right? I have no idea what's going on anymore. Touch it. Based on appearances, it looks just like a regular run-of-the-mill cow. What kind of trick is changing a chicken into a cow, anyway? That's weird. The the dripping. Uzami Corral, huh? I guess it's a ranch. Huh? That's weird. Uh. How can that rabbit own a ranch in the first place? Well, I shouldn't think too hard about it anyway. Okay. Let's talk about... Let's talk to Aoi 2.0. Hey, hey Aoi. Hey, who are you dudes? It's nice to finally meet you. I'm Jimmy Hinata. Uh. Gotcha, and who's this other dude? What? Huh? Haven't we already met? <laughs> uh, haha. I'm sorry. I pretty much suck at remembering names, and I've met so many interesting characters today. <laughs> I'm Nagito... Komade. <laughs> Said that wrong. If you can, please don't forget my name again. Yo, the Yo, name's Akane Owari. Nice to meet ya. Akane Owari. Hey, Owari. Aoi Owari. Yeah, hey, nice. N hey, Owari. Nice to meet ya. Ultimate gymnast. Yeah, you, you're, you're Aoi 2.0. Well. Akane is known as the ultimate gymnast. And an all-round super athlete. 
Rumor has it she's a wild troublemaker, but her athletic ability is off the charts. However, her basics and fundamentals are all over the place, so her gymnastic routines are mostly improvised. If she's in her groove, she performs splendidly, but if she's not, she loses interest and switches it up. How self-centered, no matter how you cut it, she definitely sounds like a troublemaker. Even so, she's called the ultimate gymnast for a reason, so her performances must be amazing to see. I can't visualize her as a normal high school student. I mean, she's got the physique of an Olympic athlete, among other things. Oh, we got a hope fragment. What? Nice. Huh? Don't tell me you. I want Oh, I get it. it. So you have a thing for sexy bodies, huh? Yep. You're being really loud. I know you're doing that on purpose. Hey, Owari. <laughs> I pretty much suck at remembering names, so I meant... Okay, same thing. I'm pretty sure I'll hit you up for your name again, so when that happens, I'm counting on you. You already ass you're already assuming that you'll forget, huh? Alright. Alright. What's this kid doing? She's sitting down and she keeps pressing her finger to into, onto the floor with all her strength. Um, are you okay? I haven't introduced myself, right? My name is Jimmy Hinata. Mm -hmm. Hmm? I'm Hiyoko Sayanji. Hiyoko Sayanji. I said that one, right? Yeah, Hiyoko Sayanji. Okay, good. We got one right. Are you a clairvoyant? No, you're a dancer. Okay, ultimate traditional dancer. Is this what is known as a lolly? She hasn't stopped pressing her finger onto the floor. Seriously, what's she doing? And her appearance and voice are so young, I can't believe she's actually a high school student. Actually... Hyoko's talent has made her known as the ultimate traditional dancer. As a rookie, the Japanese dance industry expects a lot from her. She's already performed overseas many times. It seems her performances are popular among young audiences, which is rare in the Japanese dance industry. Well, then again, her fans are mostly men. It's probably because she looks so young. Her fans probably all have the same niche or something. Squish! Squish! Please stop saying squish squish. Hey, what exactly are you hmm? doing? Hmm? I'm squishing. Squishing what? Mr. Ants! Duh! Whoa! What is with the eyes? Oh! Fuck me dead. Mr. Ant, of course. I'm squishing lots of Mr. Ants. Come again. <laughs> he he, if you squish their tummies just right, it makes this awesome sound. Hey, you! you wanna do it together? Uh, hell no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Humph, you wuss. This kid, her attitude doesn't match your appearance at all. Alright, so you're nuts. Alright, I hope you die at the beginning. Fuck me dead, not fuck me dad. Fuck me dead. That's 2B? Oh god. No way. Okay, I, I said that's what we we're gonna go for, I take it back. There's no way we're going for for ant ant killer lolly. No thank you. Wow, this is a pretty nice hotel. Perhaps the hotel Mirai, huh? It looks like it's named for the Japanese word for future. When we were told to live on this island, I was worried we'd have to pitch a tent or something. You know what? So was I. I'm glad. If we can live in a grand hotel like this, I don't think we'll have to worry about being comfortable. Comfort isn't an option here. We don't even know why we're being forced to live on this island. How can you just accept this? You're way too excited about living here. Hey. Well, it seems obvious that this area uh, would make a good base. So why don't we look around for a bit? Pet? But Aoi, Aoi 2.0 isn't here. Why is this guy so calm? It's like he doesn't think the situation is a big deal at all. Has he been through a lot of trauma or something? A map will be displayed if you press the tab key. I said the tab key. Don't make me, don't make me repeat myself. All right, so this is, we can move around normally here, okay. Okay, there we go. We cleaned up the pet. Did I miss a, did I miss a notification that the pet had taken a shit? Owari. Hey, Owari. Owari. Not Owie. Owari. Hey, Owari. Uh, Owari. Wario. Hey, Wario. Hey, Owari. I'm just gonna call her Owie. I'm also bad with names. Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, 
leveled up. Nice. There are no notifications. You just gotta check. Okay. Okay, so this is very much like Danganronpa 1. This cottage seems like a makeshift hotel guest room. Okay, we can't... I don't think we can go in. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Alright, can we go into ours? This one's ours, right? Is this us? This cottage seems like a makeshift hotel guest... Yeah, this, this... Is this not us? I thought this was us. Yeah, that's us. We can't go into it yet? Okay, that's fine. Hey, Mondo. Mondo meets Sakura. Hmm? That's right, you haven't told me your name. Oh! My name. I am the ultimate team manager, Nekomaru Nidai! Nekomaru Nidai. Ultimate team manager. Um, hello. I'm Jimmy. Your voice is too soft. Hold it right there. Your voice is too soft. Let your voice rise from the bottom of your stomach. Um, I'm Jimmy. No, you can be louder than that. Do it again. My name is Jimmy. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I am Nekomaru Nidai. Don't forget it, even if you go to hell. Okay. All right. Yeah, you said this already. You don't need to repeat your name so much, I won't forget it. <laughs> I will actually, ha ha ha, I agree to your terms. He for sure is boisterous, it's not just his voice, his whole body seems loud. Yep. Nekumaro Nidai is known as the ultimate team manager. The ultimate team manager? I think maybe he's the ultimate team manager. Hopefully he, he finally took a, took a poop. Hi Finn. Hi. Say hello to everybody. Hi. Say hi. hi. Say hi, chat. Hi. Good. Come here. Say hi, chat. Hi. Good boy. Good boy. So lately, lately our game with Finn is to is to pretend that we don't know uh, who's a cat and who's a dog. So Evie, e Evie is a dog, right? No. No? What's Evie? No. No. Oh, Evie's a cat. Okay. And Jana is a cat, right? No. No. What's Jana? What? Oh, dog. Okay. And Chloe's a cat, right? No. No. What's Chloe? No. No, that's a cat! Woof <laughs> 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 woof! Woof woof, there we go, yeah. But e Daddy, Evie's a dog, right? <laughs> Evie's a cat. What about Leo? Is Leo a cat? Is Leo a cat? No! No? What's Leo? Baby! He's a baby, you're right. Baby. 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 How many ants are there? Two ants. Two ants, but the girl was killing the ants in the game. Does that mean? Mean. Mean, yeah. Two flies. Two flies. Two flies. Two flies. What is he be needing? Uh, he had to cook over whatever cereal it was. Oh, okay. And now he's having strawberries. Having strawberries? He went to the fridge. Whoa. He brought them to me. Yeah. And he said, yummy. Yummy. Hungry. Are strawberries yummy? Eat. Say yummy. Eat. Say yummy. No, me. No, yummy. Okay, all right, see you later, kiddo. Thank you for coming to see me. Tea. I'll see you soon. Tea. Yeah, it's tea. tea. Thank you for bringing me the tea. Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Hey. Oh, yes. Oh, there are a bunch of, uh, bunch of notifications I missed, sorry. <laughs> Dimmick 9070 is 100% say, Barracuda, what happened to Owie? I ate her. <laughs> uh, Tim Foyle used to say, Ultimate Gymnast with built in airbag if things go wrong. Help Puppy 95 use 100 bits. Uh, a chicken can just turn into a cow. BB, 
bb deba bb bibu debu uh uh anderson no very well i will go along with this i i think uh i i, I think there's some uh some uh, shenanigans going on here with uh with with that magical power i'm pretty sure um Noserald used a bit to, 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 to point me to the pet. Double 58 uh, used 505 bits to say squish squish. No squish squish. This is why you, this is why you guys like lollies. No, no squish squish. Although when your when your when your uh, when your lolly melts, it, it does get kind of squishy. That's true. Just spend a minute looking all over Mondo 2.0, aka Nadat. He is, he is very Mondo, isn't he? Uh, thank you, K Roniverse, for the new Silver Prime. Welcome to Primetime, K Roniverse. I'm pretty sure I've said your name before, so welcome back. And if I'm wrong, then welcome, welcome. Welcome, Primetime. Nose Rel, use 100 bits. Take Finn to see new mommy fat catchy. <laughs> is, is, that, is, is that his name now? Chad has decided it's fat catchy. That's it. We're not calling him anything else. Rip Barracuda. Uh, Red Zeth, use 100 bits to say, can you make make it Hajimi instead of Jimmy that sounds awesome Hajimi Haj Hajimi sounds like I'm saying a bad word the ultimate team manager so he's not on a team he just manages one nope. that's he's not just a team manager after all he's an ultimate he's traveled to numerous towns and played an active role in various sports clubs managing their teams for instance he led some high school rugby team full of delinquents to victory in the national playoffs he also rescued a baseball club on the verge of being shut down and led them to national victory as well rumor has it he's even training that famous japanese pitcher who plays in the american league if that's all true he totally deserves to be called the ultimate team leader but okay. <laughs> well he isn't he gonna you know de facto be in charge of us now all right, you're gonna die quickly. But with a build like his, he'd be better off playing on a team instead of managing it. Why are you covered in chains? I like the whistle. Oh. Did you? I guess he went to the bathroom and he didn't. And he didn't get all the paper out. Uh oh, everyone's too afraid to say it. Nice bulge, dude. Nice bulge. Everyone's too afraid to tell him. Oh god. Oh. Hey. Hey, aren't you the guy who was squatting on the beach earlier and burying your face with your arms? Uh, yeah. You are a hey, boy, Hey, you gotta keep right? it together. Uh, hey, you gotta keep it together, you know? At times like this, it's the boy's job to keep the girl safe. Wow, that's sexist. You, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Did you want me to introduce myself? I haven't done it yet, right? Let's see. Let's see. I'm, I'm Mahiru Koizumi. I'll be counting on you from now on. Mahiru Koizumi. Mahiru Ko Koizumi. Okay. Mahiru Koizumi. I'll be counting on you from now on. Ultimate photographer. Actually... My hero, my, my hero is known as the ultimate photographer. She has a promising future as a photojournalist. I'm not an expert on photography, but I hear she's a young photographer who has won numerous awards. On that note, she's known for her skill at taking pictures of people. The ultimate photo photographer, huh? Well, there's a camera hanging from her neck. I kind of assumed that already. Aww. Honestly, I'm a little relieved. You guys seem decent enough. Hmm? Decent? <laughs> well, there's a lot of weirdos here. I can't tell if they're really ultimates or, like, just insane. I'm eager to get along with everyone so we can get off this island, but I was worried things wouldn't go well. Get off this island? What do you mean? Huh? huh? You don't know? That's what the stuff. That's what that stuffed animal, Usami, was saying. After you finish collecting all the hope fragments that you earn by getting along with everyone, Come on! this joke of a school tri trip will be over and we can all leave this island together. So are you collecting hope fragments too? Do you have your own, your own handbook and you have hope fragments to everyone? When I get a hope fragment, do you get one too? That, that's all we have to do we can go home is that true does she really mean that Jeez. hey you should be paying closer attention this is like really important hey well jimmy now that you know this you must feel a little relieved right okay so i like that i like that the 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 bear um uh monomi right M M i like that monomi said like apparently said all this in an introductory part and we blacked out and now we get to hear it from all the characters in pieces because it's a lot more efficient than hearing it from them and then everyone's talking about it when you go and meet them at the same time. So that, that that's that's a good thing that they did there, I think. 
because uh, otherwise there'd be a lot of repetition from that introduction that the bear says and then everyone talking about it again afterwards. That's pretty good. Well, Jimmy, now that you know this, you must feel a little relieved, right? As long as we live here peacefully, we'll be able to leave this island soon enough. So there's no reason for you to act so panicky. Even so, what's the reason? Why do we have to do something like this? I mean, to go through all the effort of bringing us here so we can all live together and get along? It doesn't make any sense. But... I may not know why we're here, but if that's all we have to do to go home, then that's all there is to it. I'm glad. Overall, I'm glad. I mean, it's really not that big of a deal. Not a big deal, really? We're told we're on a school trip without any warning, then we're taken to a place like this, and then we're told to forget about Hope's Peak Academy. Is he sure this isn't a big deal? Hey! Hey. Huh? You... Don't eh me. What about your introduction? I've been waiting like forever, you know? Ah, sorry. I'm Jimmy. Um, it's nice to meet you too. Hmm. I see. Jimmy Hanada, huh? Too bad. Sorry to disappoint you, but I've already made a mental note to remember you as unreliable Jimmy. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. We're out. We're out. What are the symbols on her clothes? I like them. It's a cool symbol. You better do your best. It's gonna to be tough for you to change my mind. You better man up and try even harder to do your best. All right, we're waifuing you and then rejecting you at the end. You're, you're, you're Makoto. There's two Makotos in this game. There's the other guy and then there's Persona Makoto. <laughs> I see, you're whipped already, Jimmy. Yep. Got it. Yep. I'm talking to both of you. You better man up and do better, got it? All right, we got a hope fragment. Um, yeah, I don't like you. You're not, you're not a waifu candidate, unfortunately, I'm sorry. I don't really like you that much. Like you're, you're not you're not bad, but I don't like you. Hotel restaurant, hotel lobby. Um, that seems to be it. Okay. Oh, there's another way in in here. No, it's here. Hotel's old building. Okay. Excuse me. Uh, no, no, no. This old building is in the middle of a renovation project, so you cannot go inside. It's dangerous, you know. Oh. Showing up out of nowhere is even more dangerous. Okay, Morgana. Thank you so much for doing that. Hajime. Jimmy, don't you think it'd be best if we looked around here somewhere? No! No! Yeah, you're right. Hajime. Alright, did we get everyone that was here? Mm, e oh, we show up on the map too. Oh, that's neat. Apparently there are people in the hotel lobby and the hotel restaurant, so why why isn't it letting us in? Did I miss somebody? Do I have to talk to them again? Do I have to talk to you? I'm glad. If we can live in a grand hotel like this, I don't think we'll have to worry about being comfortable. Well, it seems obvious that this area would make a good base, so why don't we look around for a bit? Why is this guy so calm? What kind of trauma has he experienced? <laughs> oh, you're here. Oh, do you, do you, do you, was he just blending in or what? Uh, kind of the same color as the gate and I'm, and I'm a little blind. Okay. How's it going, Chihiro? Who the hell are you? Don't talk all friendly and shit to me, dumbass. This guy's already in a crappy mood. Why, you? What are you looking at? You've got something you want to say, bastard? Now, now. Oh, it's like... Hmm. R relax. Fuyuhiko? Fuyuhiko? We're only here to introduce ourselves. Huh? What? Introduce yourselves? Hey. See, you haven't been properly introduced to each other, right? Pumph. So Chihiro meets Mondo. Name's Fuyuhiko Kuzuryu. Just so we're clear, I don't plan to act friendly and shit with you guys. Ultimate Yazuka. Oh, damn. Damn. He's a Yazuka Zero. Even though he's got a baby face, he's also incredibly rude. Um... Fuyuhiko is a high school student and heir to the... Kazurio clan? Uh, the Kazurio clan, don't tell me he's... Yep. I'm sure you've at least heard of them before, right? 
The Kazurio clan is the largest criminal syndicate in the nation with a membership surpassing 30,000. How admirable. Which means he's the ultimate Yazuka, the heir to a Yakuza clan. And it's the Kazurio clan, no less. Actually. By the way, mentioning his baby face around him is expressly forbidden, so you better be careful. I mean, didn't you just do it? You'll run out of fingers before he's done with you. If that was close, I nearly lost all my fingers. <laughs> Uh, Makoto, you're like my savior or something. Uh -huh. You're just exaggerating. Uh, guess not. Hey, bastard. Hey, bastards. Oh, it's a bastard, but it's, it's it's bastards. If we're all done here, how about you dumbasses make like a tree and fuck off? I like that saying. Did we get a hope fragment? Yeah, we did. Damn, we're leveling up. How's 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 the pet? How is pet? Oh no! Oh, this is we have to check this pet all the time. All right, I'm I'm starting to think. I'm starting to think, fuck the pet. Too much work. So this is the hotel restaurant. Amazing! It's enormous. We could easily hold a banquet here. It's kind of, it kind of has this tropical open country feeling. Open, even though we're stuck on this island. Hmm. Are we really stuck here? What else could it be? Sorry. Oh well, let's finish introducing ourselves first. Look, there are two people talking over there. <laughs> That's right, I'm having a hard time because it's full of poison. It really sucks. Oh shit, there's Pepto-Bismol coming out of his nose! Speaking of which, it'd be great if you could use your mouth to suck it out. Um... Poison, I see. Hey, do you guys have a moment? Huh? Whoa, denied. Denied? Good day. Hello, it is nice to meet you. Hello, my name is Jimmy Hinata. Nice to meet you too, Sonia. Hello there. Well, why hello there? You must be the new guy. My name is Teru Teru Hanamura. On the streets, I'm known as the ultimate cook. Okay, I like your voice, but you're creepy as fuck. But could you guys call me the ultimate chef instead? It has more of a big city flavor to it, you know? Ultimate cook. <laughs> I hope we get along well. I am sorry. Oh, that reminds me, I have not properly introduced myself either. I am terribly sorry to keep you waiting. My name is Sonia Nevermind. Sonia Nevermind. All right. Ultimate princess. <laughs> I'm a foreign exchange student from a small European kingdom called Novoselic. Novoselic? I may cause trouble here and there, but I hope we can get along well. Same here. I hope we get along too. White porcelain skin, sparkling blue eyes, and her hair glitters like fields of wheat. Yeah, she's dead. It's like she has this mysterious charm that I want to gaze at forever. Yep, she's dead. <laughs> she's dead. Are you enchanted? Well, that probably can't be helped. She's known as the ultimate princess, which means she's actually royalty. The ultimate princess. Normally I'd be surprised to hear that, but it's not just her beauty. She's just so graceful and completely at ease, even though she's a real princess. Um, um, this may be rude of me to say, but truthfully, I feel happy. Huh? What are you happy happy about? Well, the, the eye candy of the of the first one survived to the end. Huh, I don't know. I in my home country, I did not have a single friend my age whose standing in society matched my own. So to be able to do something like this with everyone is a new experience for me. I shall praise you. I shall extol your virtues. Extol my virtues. <laughs> Thanks. Y you, you too. What the? I suddenly feel the urge to drop to one knee and bow. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Ass eaters. Hey, you, you three. Am I being left off the menu or something? No, that's not it. <laughs> Oh, I'm just, okay, Teru Teru, I'm probably just gonna call him Chef. Um, I think that's a good nickname and it's and it's also respectful to the character. I think I'm just gonna call him Chef. Boyardee, no, just Chef. I think I'm just gonna call him Chef. It's so like you to check out the restaurant first as the ultimate chef, do you like it? <laughs> <laughs> I would be lying if I said I wasn't interested. And since I do not want to be a liar, then truthfully, yeah, I like it. Well. So, yes, that's I like the big it. city flavor of my hometown. A country atmosphere like this is also splendid. First fan art. Call him Fuckboy RD? 
Oh my god. All right, where's 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 the fan art? Do, 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 do. Did you say that on purpose? If so, your bait was successful. Oh no. Oh no. What did I say? What did I say? The D doesn't fit. <laughs> No, I didn't. I didn't say it on purpose. Uh, I'm glad I said it though. Damn. Damn. No. 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 No skirt on 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 2B. Damn. First anger romp two sketch. Thank, thank you, Mary. Damn. Fuck boy RD. We're not calling him fuck boy RD. Thank you, Mary. Um. Uh, Leaf good. Uh, says with 400 bits, are we human? <laughs> Are we human or are we ass eaters with Oari? <laughs> hey Oari. <laughs> are we human or are we dancer? Uh, that was good, thank you. Thank you. Uh, Myers Codex is resubscribed for two months. Thank you very much, Myers Codex. Thank you, thank you. And thank you, Technician Tim, for the two month resub with the emote pog champ. Thank you, Technician Tim. Uh, I think we're definitely ass eaters. <laughs> hey, are you Understand. refined, cultured, guilty as charged? Not, no, not that. You just don't seem very worried, huh? Damn, is this guy a player? Maybe he is fuckboy RD. Worried? What's there to worry about? Actually, I'm really happy. Happy? Why is that? Mm -hmm. If I can get serious real quick, I have a sneaking suspicion that Miss Pico is actually a bit of a freak if you catch my. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah, alright, we'll call him fuckboy RD. Alright. All right, yeah, that's it. Fuck boy RD. All right. <laughs> Every stream, I'm worried that there's not going to be any good jokes or anything, to, anything to go with. And then it always happens anyway. It's like it's every stream I'm really, really concerned. It's like, oh, this is gonna be the one where there's n nothing funny is gonna happen. It's gonna be completely fucking dead the whole time. Oh man. What do you think? What? Bonjour. She's bonjour. <laughs> She's probably wearing a black thong too. What are your thoughts on that? Now then, shall we discuss this somewhere privately? Come on, come on, come on, come on. No thanks. Hmm. Well, putting that aside for now, this might also seem unexpected to you, but I feel Miss Sonia over there has a good chance of putting out. You see, everybody knows princesses are groomed to lack common sense, right? I understand. For example, I could tell her my loins are full of poison and ask her to suck it out. Is that why he was talking about poison earlier? Um... Pardon me? What are you talking about? <laughs> we'll discuss this later. <laughs> I better not see you try that again. Mm -hmm. Anyway, when I fantasize about stuff like that, I can't help but look forward to living on this island. <laughs> when it comes to cooking and love, I, I... like... The fingers are really suggestive to me now, man. Just... Fuck why already, man. F passion is the most important ingredient. <laughs> This is like, he fooled me from the last game, but he's a Chad. This guy seems dangerous, but for a completely different reason. Seventh Island? Oh. Hotel lobby. I'm glad. Yeah, even the inside of this place looks grand too. If this was really a normal school trip, I'd be smiling by now. But why are we the only ones in this hotel? Now, now. It's an uninhabited island. It can't be helped. For an uninhabited island, this hotel looks pretty well kept, and it seems electricity won't be an issue. What in the world is going on with this island? Uh, did we miss somebody? No, we didn't. Okay. Might have missed a coin, though. Are those arcade machines or a foosball table? Space even has an arcade machine. <laughs> Isn't it great? This sure is a grand hotel. It's like we're at an inn in the Hot Springs District or something. The Hot Springs District. Okay, let's talk to Makuru last. You're very generic looking. There's some girl playing an arcade game and she looks completely absorbed by it. Hajime. 
Jamie, you haven't properly introduced yourself to her either, right? Yeah, you're right. She seems really focused on her game, but I guess I should try to talk to her. Um, excuse me. I'd like to introduce myself. Hey! Chia... Chiaki? <gasps> Chiaki? Oh, I'm sorry. I must must have been a little too focused on my game. Are you the ultimate video game player? <laughs> a little. Are you sure about that? Um... Uh, let's see. Oh, right. Introductions. Got it. I'm Chiaki Nanami. The ultimate gamer. Video games are my hobby, and I'm a fan of all genres. Chiaki... Nami? Nanami? The ultimate gamer? Diva? Video games are my hobby, and I'm a fan of all genres. Nice to meet you. Even racing? Ultimate gamer. Okay. What's well, something in common? I'm Jimmy. Nice to meet you, too. Yep. Yeah, totally. It seems like this conversation is going rather slow. <laughs> well, she is gaming right now. Well? It's more like... I'm the kind of person who has to gather my thoughts before I can start talking. Like, I can't talk that well unless I've already prepared everything I want to say in my head. Especially when I'm meeting new people. Well, if I get used to them, I can usually talk a little faster. She's still focused on her game and she hasn't looked at me at all. She may be the ultimate gamer, but how can she play video games at a time like this? <laughs> Yawn. Sleepy. I'm sleepy. Okay. Well, she was like the. She seems like the most normal out of everyone that we've met. I kind of like that. State your business. All right. Well, I just want to introduce myself. Is that all right with you? An introduction. Understood. Understood. I don't mind. All right, Kyoko. I'm Jimmy Hinata. Nice to meet you. My name is Peko Pekoyama. It is nice to meet you too. Peko Pekoyama. Are you wearing a black thong? Ultimate Swordswoman. Oh shit. Actually, this dignified looking woman is known as the Ultimate Swordswoman. It's hard to believe someone with a cute name like Peko Peko Yama could be so skilled with a blade. I've heard she's a kendo master and that most adult men don't even stand a chance against her. Well, there's definitely something up with her. Her eyes are really intense. Yeah, no, it appears. I like it. If what that rabbit said is true, we are expected to live together on this island. Yeah, you're right. Huh. It is necessary for men and women to, who live together to respect each other. Don't try anything inappropriate. <laughs> I would prefer not to kill anyone. Kill? Isn't that sword on your back made of bamboo? Yes. Though it may seem impossible to kill someone with this, a mis-aimed blow can be fatal. Well... Well, an aimed blow can be fatal too. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, we leveled up. Nice. Alright, let's check on the pet. No poop yet. No poop yet. Okay, and this goes to the restaurant. Okay, so we can get we can get out of here. Do they have more dialogue? Did you talk to them again? Um. Real friends who are my age and my first trip with those friends. <laughs> Hehe. I cannot help but feel joy. Well, she's a princess. It makes. It makes sense that our lives are completely different from her own. Okay. Uh, outside. So this, there's a little bit, uh, it's a little different, but it doesn't seem that important. So we'll just go to the next area. We didn't get a, we didn't get a hope fragment from Fat Catchy, did we? Whoops, wrong one. Oh, no, we did. We, we got a Hope Fragment from Fat Catchy. Okay, so we have uh, whatever the fuck that is. One, two, three, four left to, four left to meet? Really? I thought there was more than that left to meet still. Okay. Rocket Punch Market. So this is the supermarket, it's pretty big. If we're on a tropical island, does that mean we're in international waters? You're right. Thanks to this place, we won't need to worry about food and other necessities for a while. For a while? Wow. It's just a figure of speech. But there's no guarantee anything here is edible. What if all this stuff is poison? What? Hmm, you certainly are the skeptical type. Of course I am, even this supermarket is strange. Look around, we're in this gigantic supermarket and there's nobody else here except us. Hmm. Well, that can't be helped. Didn't Usami say this island is uninhabited? That's exactly my point. Ugh. What happened? What happened? 
It's nothing. You're creepy. Alice, she's staring at me funny. Um. Uh, uh, um, um, you know. Uh, I'm sorry. sorry. Why is she crying? Hajime. Bullying a girl. Not cool, Jimmy. I didn't do anything. <laughs> uh, so your name is Jimmy. If it's okay with you, may I please remember your name? Of course, I don't mind you remembering it, but... M my name is Mikan Sumiki. Um, from the bottom of my heart, I hope we can get along. Aw, she's so nice. Aww. Ultimate nurse. All right, number one. Fuck, everyone's gone. This is the new number one. Boom, right up to the top. D done. No other decisions left to make. My mind is drawing a blank from nervousness. And I went through all the trouble of preparing 5,000 different topics to discuss after introductions. That seems excessive. <laughs> it's okay if you take your time and remember slowly. We'll wait as long as it takes. We'll wait for you forever if that's what it takes. Huh? Uh, isn't he just putting more pressure on her? Well, I guess I'll just ask you since I won't get anywhere asking her, so what's her deal? Uh, Mikan is the ultimate nurse. Mikan? Mikan? I like you, Mikan. If you ever get injured, you'll need her help, so it's best if you get along with her now. If you get wounded and don't treat it, there's a good possibility you'll get an infection and die. Don't say something so morbid so naturally. <laughs> I feel like I feel like she maybe has like like a, a, a toku side to her that maybe she likes to see the blood. I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry for laughing so suddenly. It's just I can't help it. I'm so happy. I can't remember the last time I made any friends. Uh, not that you actually want to be friends with me. I'm so sorry I said something so presumptuous. I'll do anything you say, just please don't hate me. Man. Bullying a girl. Not cool, Jimmy. Seriously, why does this keep happening? I'm sorry. sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Damn, hope fragment. Please, I want us to get along. Please don't hate me. I don't hate you, so please calm down. Alright. Those are some really thick... Thick bottles of cola, huh? Fucking thick. That's yeah, that's one big cola bottle, yeah. I bet it go flat before you could even finish drinking it, yeah. Mono mall. Oh no. Looks like a vending machine, but it doesn't seem to accept money. Do I have to use some type of coin? <gasps> yeah! They're back! Coins are back! They're back! It's a surfboard. That being said, I'm not in the mood for water sports. <laughs> One of the girls must be, though. Uh, alright, let's keep going. Uh, what's this over here? Night vision goggles. Uh, so these military goods, huh? They even carry night vision goggles. I can't believe the supermarket even sells stuff like this. Okay. Alright, who's this abomination? Peeking, peeking. Hello! Oh, hi, who are you? Um, I'm Jimmy. Hello! Why does she have a condom above her tie? Okay, I hate this one. Your tension is super low. Are you feeling all right? Oh! Ah, that's right. Introductions are a go-go. E, buki, mio, da. Put it together, and what do you get? E, buki, mio, da. Ultimate musician. All right, introductions are finished. More importantly, check out this bombastic supermarket. I see, I see. Bombastic, sorry. They go, they got, they got hamburger, ramen noodles, chili beans, bratwurst, pasta, ooh, melons. No problem. Americans, Chinese, Mexicans, Germans, Italians, and even people from Yubari would shop here. Yeah. Man, I'm getting hella stoked. I'm 31 flavors of stoked for all this deliciousness. And when I'm excited, I get hungry mungry. I don't understand it myself. Why do I get hungry when I'm excited? Why do I get excited when I'm hungry? Quahaha, <laughs> <laughs> the human body sure is a mystery. <laughs> I hope yours stays a mystery. Um, this energetic young lady is known as the ultimate piss off. She used to play guitar in an all girl band that was super popular with other high school girls. 
apparently their hit single after school Poyo Yon Hour sold over a million copies. A super popular all girl high school band that sounds familiar. But due to creative differences, she left the band to pursue a solo career. Creative differences. Oh my my! Are you interested? Wah, you could hear me? <laughs> Duh. Ibuki's a music musician after all. Guitar! Like Schubert, Bach, Edison, Van Gogh. <laughs> Perez and Senna, I too am an awesome musician. Oh, so you're saying you have a good hearing. Wait, most of those people you mentioned weren't musicians at all. <laughs> Don't sweat the details. And Hunter used 100 bits to say, Joe likes, Joe likes his nurses, eh? Anderson Lily. Don't, 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 don't let her know. It's not like she, it's not like she knows already. Don't let her know. Don't let her know. Uh, Oanzi has uh, just subscribed to Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Oanzi. Welcome, welcome. Uh, and Ganel used five bits to say, "Hi everyone, I'm new. Holds up, Spork. My name is Yubuki, but you can call me the ult ultimate of doom." Lol. Hey, got yeah. I, that's that's exactly what I thought too. Yeah. So random. So random. Yeah, that's exactly what she is. Maybe Lily should do some nurse play for you th for then? What, again? The boy RD doesn't fit. <laughs> I'm glad everyone understood what, 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 what I meant by that. Okay, good. Uh, do we need to flush some poop down the toilet? Is Ibuki here? Yep, she's here. Alright, there we go. She's down the toilet. Alright, we have to flush our Ibuki, sorry. Someone's pissed about about my uh my my my, my low my low tier waifu choices. Airport. This is an airport, right? So those things over there must be uh, Leon's airplanes. Oh, right, that makes more sense. Could we just use those planes to escape this island? Yeah, who knows how to fly? Uh. Nah, that's impossible. You're the ultimate me mechanic. If they were damaged, I could fix them, but it looks like the these planes are just for show. Just for show. Man. The engines have been completely removed. Nothing I can do about that. Completely removed? Whoever brought us to this island must have also done that, right? The same person who's controlling that stuffed animal, Usami. But who's doing this? Well, I, can, I, think of, I can think of one person I hope it isn't, and why did they bring us to this island in the first place? And how did they do it? The more I think about it, the less sense it makes. That's right! Oh yeah, that reminds me, you and me haven't been introduced yet, right? Name's Kazuichi Soda. I'm the ultimate mechanic. Yep. Nice to meet ya. Okay. So you kind of, kind of visually reminds me a little bit of Leon, but not really. So I shouldn't call him that. Uh, we'll call him Soda. <laughs> As expected from someone called the ultimate mechanic, Soda is a savant when it comes to fixing machines. If he says it's impossible to fix this plane, it's truly beyond repair. Hey. Even so, to actually remove the engine, whoever's keeping us here must have planned this to a T. You think so too, huh? Doesn't that seem pretty strange to you? That was close. Yeah, it's pretty strange, but I think it's an acceptable level of strange, you know? Huh? I mean... Well, think about it. It's not like we're being forced to do something dangerous or anything. Uh... That was mentioned in the safety precautions for this school trip. Remember? The school trip guidelines written in the e-handbook. Yep, we read them. Yep. Yep, extreme violence is prohibited on this island. Please live peaceful and relaxing lives with your fellow students. Oh, it's going through it just in case we didn't already. All right. For now. It looks like we're being kept safe, so why wouldn't this be like any other school trip? Hmm. There's nothing dangerous on this island. Spend these peaceful and relaxing days nourishing hope. Just as Usami said earlier, it seems these rules are in place to help us do that. Are you saying you believe what that thing told us? She forced us to come here, you know? What? Don't be such a pessimist. 
you should look at the situation with a bit more hope, you know? Optimism is essential for people to live satisfied lives. That's right! Well, I guess it's okay if we just enjoy our vacation and see how this whole thing plays out, right? <laughs> yeah, if you stare closely at that strange looking bunny girl, she might start looking pretty cute. I'm actually jealous of how carefree he's being right now. Okay, he's the ultimate ninja. You fiend. You fiend. That's a different voice. Stop right there. If you value your life, do not come any closer. Huh? Fine. Humph. I said stay back. Oh, very well. I shall accept that courage of... Very well. I shall accept that courage of yours. What's this guy talking about? <laughs> he, he, he. Would you like to know my name? Others may see your courage as recklessness. However, I welcome it. Listen well. In honor of your courage, I shall reveal, reveal to you my name. May you never forget it as long as you live. You may call me Gundam Tanaka. Remember it well, for it is the name that will one day rule this world. All right, he's a Gundam. Ultimate breeder. Oh, whoa. what? What happened to your eye? We rule this world? He's kidding, right? If he's actually serious, that's pretty out there. Let me ask. Now then, it is my turn to ask questions. Whose master are you? Eh? You! Which tribe did you make your pact with? Answer me. Huh? What do you mean pact? What Burn do you mean tribe? The fires of pandemonium! <laughs> All right, I like this guy. Answer me now, though I shall cast, though I shall cast you into a watery grave once you do. Then it's best if I don't answer. Perhaps. I think he's asking if you used to have a pet. Pet? No, the only animal I've taken care of was a hermit crab we passed around in elementary school. Impossible. So a mere insect. Taste ah, your Your magic essence caps at a lowly five. Trash. <laughs> Trash early. Neil. Um, is it wrong to call trash trash? Trash like you should not dare to speak to one as grand as me. My name is Gundam Tanaka. Oh my god. What? Who do you think I am? I am the great and powerful Gundam Tanaka, supreme overlord of ice. Hold on a minute, something strange just came out of your scarf. This is the Tanaka Empire! <laughs> Taming evil by using myself as a bed. Truly, this is the secret art. Taming evil by using myself as a bed. Truly, this is the secret art of the Tanaka Empire. <laughs> it's like something you'd see on a nature show. I guess he totally fits the bill of ultimate breeder. <laughs> One of my four dark div- That- It's it's not divas. Devas of de destruction? Devas? That, I don't know what that is. I, I want to say divas, but I don't know what that is. Uh, Mirage Golden Hawk Jump P has this to say. We're not used to going easy on our enemies, so don't make us angry. You wouldn't like us when we're angry. Fuhaha. <laughs> Davas? <laughs> Davas? Fuhaha. <laughs> Level up. Alright, I think we met everyone. Um, yeah, I know he seems a little odd, but apparently he did splendidly as a member of the breeding club. I've heard he can tame any animal and even managed to succeed at proliferating an endangered species. Rumor has it he can speak to animals. Well, that's probably just a joke. I'm sure it's not, because it's this game. Speak with animals. Well, he's certainly uh, eccentric enough uh, in that regard. I mean, there's no way a normal person would attempt to raise hamsters inside their own scarf. Ding dong, bing bong. Was that a school bell just now? Huh? Jimmy, look at that monitor, monitor over there. Congratulations, everyone! It appears that everyone has finished collecting the hope fragments. I'm... I'm so happy! So, I've prepared a present for everyone that'll make you all very happy. I apologize for the trouble. But please gather at the beach. <laughs> May Shining Hope be with you all. What to do? She said to meet at the beach. Is that going to be okay? I'm starting to have a bad feeling about this. But Thinking won't solve anything. We can do that after we go to the beach. Is that precaution really enough? To be honest, I'm really worried, but it would look bad if I was the only one who didn't go.
Uh, JJ Mario uh, 813 used 99 bits to say, is Soda secretly the child of Leon and a shark? I mean, look at those teeth. Yeah, the teeth are a bit weird. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with, uh, with, with, with the teeth there. Yeah. Um, hold on, I think I missed a couple of, couple of, uh, messages. Uh, Solhide has subscriber prime. Thank you very much, Solhide, for the new subway prime. Welcome, Solhide. Welcome, welcome. I thank you, Axon589, for the 100 bits. Hey, just tuning in, what's going on compared to Danganronpa1? Uh, we're on an island in some of the school, although we were, were at the school at the beginning. Um, Chad Ketchy's back, but, we, but he doesn't seem to be giving up much information. Uh, he's also gained a lot of weight. Um... It's there's not much comparisons to make so far. Monokuma isn't here, or if he, if he is, he's disguised himself as a white bunny rabbit instead. Uh, Axon five, sorry, that was that was Axon five eight nine. Sorry, uh, Bully Hunter seventy nine has resubscribed for five months. Hope this won't be this won't be a disappointment too. <laughs> oh, okay, I see what it is. Hope this won't be disappointment too. Uh, finally able to catch the stream again, and don't forget to vote for Dishonored. Oh no! Oh no! You you! Oh no! Oh no! You you you're you're plugging your your game for the vote. Thank you, Billy Hunter seventy nine. Um, let me scroll up. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, now that you've been introduced to Chiaki, you're allowed to witness this everlasting masterpiece. What? Fuck gamers and fuck gaming. What did you say, laddie? I said fuck you, gamer. Big mistake, noob. Wait, no, no, please. Don't put me in your cringe compilation. Snap. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not the cringe compilation. Uh, fake and cheated. Use 100 bits to say Gundam Tanaka Craigasm. Yeah, he's pretty good. I like him. He's he's really over the top, and I kind of like that. It seems more genuine than 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 the musician girl, but uh, but maybe that's not fair on her. Um, Lucy Streamer has used five bits now. You you've met everyone. Can you make your prediction? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that when we're all in the same scene together. And if that doesn't happen soon, I'm gonna open the notebook and go through. Uh, Hansel has subscribed with Prime for the first time. Thank you, Hansel. Welcome to Prime Time. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. And I think that's uh, the list done. Yep. All right, let's get back to it. Hey. Hey, being absent-minded won't get us anywhere. Let's hurry and head. Oh shit, I hit I hit a button on the keyboard, sorry. It's just basically let's go to the beach. Uh did our pet take a shit? No. Okay. So we met everyone. How many how many girls and how many boys are there? So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight girls? Is it is it completely split half half? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are you a boy or a girl? You're a boy. Eight. It's eight and eight. Okay. Eight and eight. Okay. Dislikes milk. Likes fried dough cookie. Dough cookies. Okay. Let's go through it. I think you can hit like E or something to cycle through them, right? So that's us. That's Jimmy. That's Makoto. Uh, that's Barracuda. What's the one? Oh, is that we get pages later on? Gundam, Soda, um, uh, Fuckboy RD, uh, Nekomaru, Fuyuhiko, Fuyuhiko, uh, Heiwari, uh, Chiaki, Chiaki, Sonia, Hyoko, Mahiru, Mikan. Ibuki and Peko and Peko. Okay, so all right, so I'm gonna. I kind of feel like he's gonna be the first one to die because that the first person we interacted with the first game a lot was Sayaka, and that was the person that came along with us. And I feel like it's gonna be that again. We've already bonded with him, and that's gonna he's gonna be the first one to die. But I feel like he's 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 the the. the he has a bigger plot to play in the story. I can't tell if this is the Kyoko of, 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 of this game or or the Sayaka. But I kind of feel like we're the Kyoko. We're, we seem to be taking this way more seriously than anybody else. And our our ultimate is is under question mark. And like maybe we're the detective this time. Um, it's either I think the first death is either going to be him or it's going to be her. I think it's going to be either, either those two. One, one of those two is going to be the first death. I think. 
But I wouldn't be surprised if also he made it to the end. Because I, I, I really don't know. I really don't know. Um, okay, let's see. Uh, we're going to survive. Okay, I think there's going to be six people that survive to the end. Obviously, we're going to be there at the end. I think Fat Catchy is going to be there to the end. I think you're going to be there to the end, Owari. You're going to be there to the end, Pekko. Four. I have two more. Oh god, I have no idea. I'm sorry, I have no clue. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much fucking guessing. I'll go with you. You're, so I have one more. Five. Five. Oh god, I hope it's not you. I hope you don't get to the end. You're a little too off the wall and wacky, but some, sometimes the wacky ones make it. Like, Dan, Danny made it, and so did uh, so did Aoi. The chef... The chef is definitely not going to make it. Like, it could, it could be him. You're definitely not making it. You might. I'll go breeder guy just as a shot in the dark. Th those are my six. They're gonna make it. So Jimmy, uh, Fat Catchy, Breeder Guy, uh, Hey Owie, uh, you, and and this one. Th that that that's that's my shot in the dark. Maybe I'm completely wrong. The rest are gonna die. We'll see what happens. Now we have to go to the beach. Can we just fast travel there? Oh, we're right here. Never mind. We're right at the beach. Okay, let's check our pet before we go in. No, 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 no poops. Uh, how long have we been live for? What about dies and murders? Well, I, I've already said who. Oh, so who's gonna get murdered and who's gonna get? Who's just gonna die after a um, after a thing? I don't know. I think it's too. I think it's too 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 soon to tell to, 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 to know about that. Who's gonna Who's gonna murder and who's gonna kill each other? But I think that might, that might be fun to just to just guess. He's gonna get murdered. There were there were there were six trials last time, but there was there were more murders than that. Uh, you're gonna get murdered. You won't get murdered. You'll you'll murder someone. You'll get murdered. Uh, you'll definitely get murdered. Uh, I have a feeling you will murder someone. You'll get murdered. I'm not sure about you. I'm not sure if you have a darker side to you yet. I hope you get murdered. Let me settle in a little bit more. All right, after the scene, I think we'll take a break. Let's go, let's go through the scene and then we'll go. Such ignorance. You guys are the last to arrive. What are you dilly dallying for? <laughs> Sorry to keep you all waiting. That's fine. Well, it's all right. More importantly, this is our only chance to talk between ourselves before that rabbit returns. <laughs> yeah, let's talk. Listen. Now then, let's hear your initial impressions of this island. Now that you mention it. I happen to notice numerous blocked off bridges on the central island. Oh! Oh, those are, the, those are there so everybody doesn't get lost. I tried to cross one of them and that rabbit showed up and told me so. And to, and, sorry, and told me, so I'm telling the truth. What? So we don't get lost? Is this island really so big? <laughs> but if you look at it in depth, it's just a normal island, right? It's got a resort and everything. Well, not that I've ever been to a, res a resort before, but... Hey, hey! Also, there's a big ranch. Um... 
Um, there's also a large supermarket too. It looks like it stocks everything from food to living amenities. Mm. The hotel was really nice too. It'd be great if we can stay there. <laughs> The restaurant inside the hotel was also very nice. It seemed to cater to a more plebeian taste. Hey. Can you guys listen to what I want to say too? I found something very important on this island. I can't stop girls. <laughs> I really like this guy. Very, very cute girls. Aha. All over the place. <clears throat> gross. I'm getting goosebumps. Or gross bumps. <laughs> All of you are fools. I can't believe nobody has mentioned the most serious truth. Huh? The most serious truth? Not possible. If no one here realized it, you're all bigger fools than I thought. Huh? What did you say, you fat bastard? Don't be talking all big and shit. Such ignorance. Small dogs shouldn't bark so loud. The most serious truth. What does he mean? Sonia, never mind. Okay, I wish we'd, we'd wait until now to do the speculations because it's easier to see them all. What happened, Chad Ketchy? Hey, Amy again. I'm, I'm terribly sorry. sorry. I haven't discovered anything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm such a use useless fool. I'm sorry. She doesn't need to cry and apologize so much. <laughs> Kiki, -ki -ki, I see. So that guy figured it out as well. Hmm. You know too, Gundam. What is it? If you wish to know, you must pay my price. After all, this world is ruled by the law of equivalent exchange. Stay back. Covert. Is someone like you capable of offering a tribute that would satisfy a tyrant such as myself? He probably doesn't know what it is. Yeah. Makoto. I see. It seems everyone has explored this island, and just as Yuzami said, there seems to be no danger. Barracuda said he found something, though. I wonder what it is. What is it? I wonder what Barracuda found. Since he's acting so mysterious and stuff, he probably found something big. Hee <laughs> hee, I'm looking forward to it. Hey, oh, are hey, hey! Hey, hey, if you're gonna talk to me about something boring, I'm just gonna swim, okay? Don't just do your own thing. Uzami's coming here, too. Uh. Then let's hurry up. Chop, chop. What a free spirit. Oh, they're free, all right. <laughs> you sure talk big. Is being an affluent progeny that big of a deal? Understand. The most important thing in the world is nothing is more important than a cute girl. The fucking fingers, man. Sheesh! That barracuda, he sure is beating around the bush. Aww. Every time barracuda runs his mouth, Fuyuhiko looks ready to kill him. Why do boys always have to provoke each other like that? I'm not sure I can answer that. Actually, you know what? Maybe these two are gonna... Like, last time the equivalent characters of these two lived, maybe this time they'll die. Maybe they'll be the opposite. And maybe the person you hang out with at the beginning will, will live instead of dying. I don't know. I don't know. A lot to think about. However, Despite how big this island is, I cannot believe it is uninhabited. Just what in the world is going on here? I do hope the supposed truth Barracuda has found will provide us with a hint. <laughs> the most serious truth, huh? That sounds so deep. That's totally I have it. no choice but to confront Buyakasha directly to find out. <laughs> See, even the game fucks with their names. She's already given that guy a nickname. I guess in that sense, she's pretty amazing. Damn. We're, we're like this, man. Me and mm. Worst Girl are like this. The most serious truth. Mm. Ah, I fell asleep. Don't fall asleep. How could you be tired right now? Damn. This is this is my girl. This is my girl. Damn it. Did he really call me a small dog? Wow, he's angry. I shouldn't try to talk to him. You are right. I do not really understand what he means. Listen! Everyone, please be quiet. Ugh. I don't know why, but I feel compelled to be quiet. I guess this is what being royalty is all about. <sighs> um, how many people want a quick break right now before we continue? Best cheer, Skittles. What? Skittles? Oh, she's Skittles, is she? Thank you, Pinch Bottom. Who's... Thank you for the... For the, uh... For the new sub of Prime Pinch Bottom. Thank you very much. Okay, enough people are saying yes. Uh, I think most people are saying no, but enough people are saying yes that we'll do a quick break. So let's do a five minute break and then we'll come back, go brush your teeth, and then we'll continue the story. Yeah, quick break. Thank you again, Pinch Bottom, for the sub of Prime.
Uh, Alright, so let's turn the game off and play some Spider-Man. I want to feel like Spider-Man. Get some backpacks. How long do you plan on- oh, what the fuck did I hit? How long do I plan on streaming today? Uh, at least until 7 o'clock my time, so at least another uh, two and a half hours, at least. I might go to 8. Uh, I probably won't go past 8. Um, the streams are going to be longer as we play this game, but it, it won't be that long today. But I'm planning to, to possibly go as long as um, 7 hours for, for most of the streams um, for, for this game. But um, today won't be seven hours long, so at least seven. There's fan art. One second. I made a choice meme for whenever, whenever you start thinking. What? Don't sweat the details. It's just a story. Jo oh, great. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Th 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 thank you so much for making Worst Girl be be our our, our nemesis. Will you watch Danger Rampa 3 after this game? Sorry for asking you too much. Uh, I I just didn't see it. Sorry if you if you asked a lot before I saw it. Uh, I might. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't watch anime, but if that's how the story concludes, then maybe. Anyway, let's continue. Hey, what's the most serious truth? Did did you find out something about this island? Hmm. <laughs> have you all gone to the park that's across the bridge? The park with that weird bronze statue of all those creepy animals, right? Listen, when I saw it, I remembered a story I'd heard before. There's an island in the Pacific Ocean, a beautiful island paradise where summer never ends. It consists of, of a central island surrounded by five different islands. It's also said that five holy animals symbolize each of those surrounding islands. And listen, that island's name is... Leon Jabberwock Island. Could it be? Could this island be? Jabberwock Island? Is that the name of this island? Very strange. Still, there's something on my mind. In fact, according to what I've heard, Jabberwock Island is already... Hmm. <laughs> Never mind. Hold on! Hold it right there. That's a rather incomplete story you've told us. Don't worry. No need to shout. I'll let you know once I obtain more information. Uh. Meh, I don't care what this island's called. Nico Nico Island or Papua Island or whatever doesn't change the fact that we all got to live here, right? Yahoo! Living together on this tropical island sure is exciting. I'm super looking forward to it. <laughs> right on. This ain't a bad school at all. Hey, you guys. I like it. Mm, I like this island too. <laughs> Can't say the same about the rest of you cretins. Huh? Huh? Did I hear something? Hmm. I'm still worried, but I don't feel as worried as I did earlier. <laughs> Yeah, since there's no danger or inconvenience, I feel like this won't be a problem. Hey, listen to what you guys are saying. We need to stay calm and think about this. We're all here to attend Host Peak Academy, right? But we're living on an island like this instead. No matter what, it's completely weird. You fiend. You fiend? Why don't you st why don't you stop talking for a while? Go cool your head off or something. Eh? To tell you the Plus, truth. Plus, even if we wanted to leave, there's no way we can. <laughs> there's no ship and the planes are just for show. It appears. From what I've discovered, there's no way to contact the outside world either. In conclusion, it would be impossible to call for help. Um. Then why don't we just swim home? It's impossible. There's no way we can swim that far. Show some spirit. Show some spirit. What? Are you stupid? I'm telling you, that's impossible. But then, what if we cut down some trees and made a raft? I won't let you. Nah, -uh, you can't do that. That's the biggest of no-nos. Got it? Please recall the guidelines of this school trip. Littering is not allowed. Let us coexist with this island's bountiful nature and mutual prosperity. Got it? I want everyone to get along and live peacefully on this beautiful tropical island. What's with these rules? Who cares about that? That's enough. Stop. This rabbit seems to be rather finicky about these so-called rules. Based on that, what if your actions place everyone here in danger? Ooh. The word danger is a bit much. I wouldn't do something like that. Hajime. Jimmy, I understand how you feel, but you need to calm down a little, okay? I feel like... I feel like our character is the only one that's really taking this seriously. F for now. For now, as long as we don't do anything weird, it seems there's no danger. Well, us and Fat Catchy. Yep. And as long as we gather the hope fragments, we'll be able to get off this island soon. You're all just gonna believe that? 
there's no other choice but to believe. For now, that is. Hey, hey! Anyway, Usami, what's this present you mentioned in your announcement earlier? Love! Ah, that's right. Well, of course, I didn't forget. Love, love! Love, love, this is it. Don't be upset. I've prepared one for all of you. For you, for, sorry, for you all, so don't worry. What is this? <laughs> it's an Usami strap. If you squeeze the tummy, it talks. I'm Usami. Magical miracle girl Usami. I'm an itty bitty girl who's sweet like milk. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Love, love. What a waste of time. Aww. Man, and I got my hopes up too. I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed I even had my hopes up. You think so? Really? I think it's pretty cute, especially how the ears look like a rabbit's. Well, Usami does mean rabbit, you know. Regardless, a large number of Usami straps ended up on the beach anyway. As I figured, after everybody received their strap, they just tossed them on the beach. That's littering! That's littering! We're, we're all screwed! Hey! Yeah, there you go. You can't taint nature, nature with trash. Oh, so you agree they're trash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Why? This is the second time she said something after I said it. What does that say about me? I hate what I am. See, even you think they're trash. Usami sadly picked up the straps and looked at us with a lonely expression on her face. Ugh, and I even prepared one more present too, but now I don't want to give it to you bad kids. Could it be? Hmm, you have something else? Um... Well, compared to the Usami strap, it's not that big of a deal. Basically, I prepared a motive for everyone. A motive? Hey! That's right, a motive for everyone to get along. We've come all this way to a tropical island, so I thought it'd be great to do something island themed. <laughs> Like what? Are you thinking of throwing a big party or something? Ding, ding, ding. Correct! Whoa! Is it a festival? Or maybe a miniature shrine? How wonderful! Anyway... Excuse me, Miss Sonya. My <laughs> loins are still full of poison, and I'd appreciate it if you could suck it out with, suck it out with your mouth. Wait! Knock it off, fuckboy RD. Alright! Oh, your tenderloins? You betcha. That's... Just ignore him, Sonya. I've got it! If we're talking about fun parties on a tropical island, maybe it should be a barbecue or something. <gasps> ah, a campfire sounds fun too. Let's kill! Let's find a hoop snake and kill it. You serious? Is looking for for one not enough for you? I see. It seems everyone has different ideas, but if we're gonna be at the ocean, if we're gonna be at the ocean, then first. <laughs> Ta-da! This is what it's all about. Oh, swimsuit episode! This is... A swimming bag. Love, love! Correct, love, love. Whoa! Whoa, then that means... Ta-da! That's right, I have swimsuits for everyone. Well, school swimsuits, actually. I hope that's okay. Are you telling us to go swimming in a situation like this? Yes. It's not like I'm ordering you guys to swim or anything. It's just, if you want to go swimming, you can. There's no way I'm going swimming. There's no way anyone would be so thoughtless as to go swimming in a situation like this. Someone's already got their swimsuit on. Yahoo! Yeah, Yahoo! Eh? That's right! Oh yeah, this is what I'm talking about. With weather this nice, there's no way I'm gonna pass on swimming. I agree. Did the fingers just sparkle? Even my loins agree, see? Alright! Your tenderloins? I understand. Wait! Seriously, don't try to understand. Hey! How long has it been since I last swam in the sea? Alright, let's go change. Those of us who were excited to go swimming went to get their swimsuits from Usami and ran straight to the hotel to change. Hey. What are you gonna do, Jimmy? Hajime. I understand you don't I understand how you feel, and I won't force you to do anything you don't want to do. <laughs> but if you feel up for it, I'd be happy if you came along too. After he said that, Makoto ran over to the hotel as, as well. There's no danger on this island. There's nothing tragic waiting to happen on this island. Is that really true? If so, am I actually wrong? <laughs> Humph. You're not swimming? So it looks like she's staying too. That's unexpected. She seems like the more active type. Hey, you're not gonna swim? Huh? Huh? Of course I am. Why? Then why didn't you go with the others to change? So annoying. I don't need to change. All I gotta do is take off my clothes. No, what about your swimsuit? Does she always have one on? You. There's no way I'm gonna wear something as embarrassing as a school swimsuit. She's just wrong about so many things. Oh, she she she's she's modest with her cleavage poking out like this too. What the hell? All right. So let's hurry and swim. With those words, uh, Awari. It's Awari, right? 
Owari quickly began taking taking off her. Whoa, hey. I won't forgive you. Hey there, shameful behavior like that is a no-no. If you're gonna sw going to swim, you gotta wear a swimsuit. So annoying. Psh, what a pain. Phew, phew. So she'd rather be naked than, than wear a swimsuit. You're not going to swim? <laughs> nah, it's more fun to step on the crabs walking on the beach. I, I see. You're not gonna swim? Sleepy. Mm, I'm like really, really sleepy right now. I see. It'd be a problem if you fell asleep while you were swimming. I'd probably drown. More like definitely drown. But to be sleepy in a situation like this, she sure got some bold nerves. It's my narco girl. Uh, speaking of which, everyone has returned. As Usami said that, I turned around and I saw a group of people wearing swimsuits jumping into the ocean and shouting with joy. But we're not going to show it though, because we're a big tease. I've never been more wrong. Yahoo! I'm so happy right now. Damn, the bulge. The bulge, man. The bulge. Okay, is that the nurse on the right? Is that nurse girl? All right. Damn, I think I like her the most. <laughs> Look at FuckYRD with the suntan lotion. Probably going around asking all the girls, Hey, you want some suntan lotion? You want some lotion? <laughs> and the guy still has the scarf on in the bottom left there. Yahoo! Yeah. Yay, the, the sea! sea. Uh, the water is so cool! It feels great! Uh, uh, too salty! This water's too salty! It's not going easy on me! Hey, I got some suntan lotion from the supermarket. Would anyone like a rub down? You're quite considerate. <laughs> now then, will you apply it right away? <laughs> huh? Rubbing lotion on a muscular man. All right, no problem. My tastes are pretty open, you know. God damn, he is a fuckboy. You seem a little too open. Like you're covering too many bases by yourself. <laughs> I'll make sure to slather you with lots and lots of oil. What is this feeling of intense bloodlust? It feels like a resort. There's no other way to describe it. Seeing the other students having all this fun. I, I. <laughs> yep, yep, I'm very happy. Everyone seems to be getting along with each other, so I'm very happy. I thought this would be hard until everyone got used to this, but they're all acting like ultimates. Ding, ding, ding. Let's keep up the pace and I'll do our best to peacefully enjoy this heart-throbbing school trip. What's this feeling of alienation? I can't really put it into words. Am I really wrong about all this? Alright, this is pretty clever. I gotta say, so far this is a lot stronger of an opening than the first game. This is really clever. It's it's playing on, on your expectations of having played the first game and, and you really feel the same thing that the character said. This is, this is pretty clever. Fine. I just gotta do it, right? Then I'll do it. That's right. I'll do it. Huh? Jimmy, did something happen? Hey, hand me one of those swimsuits. Jeez, I can't believe I was the only one worrying. I feel like an idiot. I don't care anymore. I'm gonna go for it. Alright, what's gonna happen? I'm gonna seriously enjoy myself and have fun. Hey, you guys! Damn. Don't forget about me! Yeah. It's like me thinking this is gonna be a good game, and then just boom, boom, boom. Hit, hit, hits you with the holes. Hey, you guys, don't forget about hey, me. Hey, wait for me. Let me join in the fun. Wait, huh? Suddenly the sky grew cloudy. Huh? What is this? What's happening? These strange clouds. This doesn't look natural at all. Hmm? Huh? Huh? Hey, what's going on? What did you do? This is obviously not right. It was sunny just a few minutes ago. Whoa, whoa, whoa what? Hey! What is this? Huh? I didn't do anything. What is all this? There's no way something like this shouldn't be happening. And at that exact moment, 
just when it seemed like this couldn't get any more confusing, it suddenly happened. Oh, <gasps> he's... Uh, uh, my check, my check. Oh, shit. It's Shodan. Oh, shit. Uh, 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 can you hear me? Can you hear me? Who the fuck's Mike? That voice was so laid back and so gleeful that it seemed out of place. But it was different than Usami's. As if an endless storm of malice could be felt raging behind that laid back voice. The moment it f I felt it, my body shuddered. <laughs> surprised? You were totally surprised! Right? Well then, sorry to keep you all waiting for so long. Let's leave all this worthless entertainment behind. Worthless? It's time for the main attraction. You guys better hustle over to Jabberwock Park. Could, could it be? Could it be this voice? If this is... Oh, this is very bad. I gotta do something, Smooth Skins. I won't let you. It's all up to me. <laughs> Hit with me. <laughs> Maybe the fucking bunny's gonna be the first one that dies. Hey, hey, wait. Very strange. It seems that was an unusual occurrence. Mm. It's best if we go to Jabberwock Park, was it? Let's hurry. Hey! Hey, wait. But what about everyone who's swimming? Naturally. There's no time to wait for them to change. I have a bad feeling about this. I'll head over first. Shit, just what the hell is going on? I'll be really pissed. If it's something fucking stupid. What is this? What the hell is going on? Okay, Jabberwock Park, right? Aww. Boo, there's just too many Mr. Krabs. Bye. Fine, I'll just step on them later. You crabs better run while you still can. Yeah, fuck the crabs. You hear the footsteps? Yeah, there's, there's footsteps on the sand. Completely unplayable. As we arrived at Jabberwock Park, Uzami's shouting voice could be heard ringing throughout the park. I won't let you. Where are you? Where are you hiding? Hiding? Who are you talking to? <laughs> Poo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Huh? Hey, hey. Hey, hey, where are you? Show yourself. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, everyone got here in time. That's good. you all for waiting long time no see guys i am monokuma i'm the headmaster of this academy <laughs> monokuma <laughs> appears ahem now that i have made my dashing appearance the first thing i need to say is lame this is so friggin lame lame i say lamer than the lamest lame sauce <laughs> oh wait lame sauce is that tasty just as I thought it was you, but how? Why is Monokuma here? Monokuma. Silence! Metal Gear. Ah, shut up! Hey! Um... I'm livid, you know, and I'm about ready to barf thanks to your lukewarm attitude. <laughs> Just what's with this heart throbbing school trip crap anyway? I'm bored, so hopelessly bored. Hey. This just ain't fun at all. You better knock off this farce right now. What are you thinking? You've got to make this, you know, meet the demands of the world. Nobody wants to see high school students living calm and peaceful lives. What everyone wants to see is blood. <laughs> Other people's misery and this bear. What the hell is with this stuffed animal? Nothing he's saying makes any damn sense. What? What is going on? What is that thing? Okay, so you've had your memory erased? Or you're not really Chad Ketchy. How could you not be him, though? I won't let you. <laughs> maybe it's maybe it's Chad Ketchy's skin stuffed with like like three robot bears, and that's why he's all bulgy. Be careful, everyone. Stay back and leave this to me. I don't know why Monokuma is here, but as long as I have this magic stick. Yeah! yeah. Opening! Oh god. Hi. Damn, the budget on this game. St stop! Dun-da-da-da! 
Uh oh. No! My magic stick! Now then, what to do after my flawless victory? First of all, you're too plain. White rabbits are far too plain. So, I'm gonna make you in my image. <laughs> this is what happens when you defy me. I'll crunch ya, I'll bite ya, I'll rip you apart. <laughs> Stop it! Hey, hold still. This wooden stick isn't gonna shove itself in, you know? Lude. No! That's a no-no. That's a big no-no. Ta-da! All done! What? Is that pants or a diaper? What is this? No! I'm not supposed to look like weird like this. Change me back to normal. What's this? My, my. Defying your big brother's fashion sense? Is Monomi a little troublemaker? Me? Big brother, Monomi. My little sister. Your current sister. position is too wishy-washy, so I'm setting you to be my little sister, Monomi. <laughs> Though it's only an external setting, after all. Hey! Why do I? What? Why do I have to be your little sister? What? what? Big sister, then? You want to be the older sister that got separated at birth? I don't like hmm, that this. That doesn't really feel right. Yeah, you're definitely more like a little sister. Call me so big that's how brother. it's gonna be, Monomi. From now on, if you ever disobey me, I will never forgive you. Ooh. How? Even the display changed to Monomi. I won't forgive you. Hey, I won't let you make up your own settings. Ah! Oh shit. Abuse. Stupid fool. Do you think you can win against me? No! It hurts a lot when you punch me. <laughs> now you've learned your lesson. How about that? What is this? Living stuffed animals fighting each other? That's like completely insane. <laughs> uh, if only I still had the magic stick, I could have totally beaten that awful monocoon. Well, you did have it, but you, you didn't use it in time. <laughs> Hoo hoo, it's your fault for leaving yourself open. Even a one second opening is a life threatening is life threatening on the on a battlefield. Hey, hey. Hey, what's with this stupid performance? Huh? Who friggin' knows? Hmm. But it's always something bad is happening. Huh? What? What is this? What's going on? Fuck, <laughs> sob. Huh? Huh? Now she's all weird looking. <sighs> weird looking? She matches me now, you know? How insensitive. What the? There's more of them? What did you say? What does this mean? What is that black and white tanuki? Bear it! I'm not a tanuki. I'm a bear. I'm Monokuma. What's going on? I, I don't understand it myself, but a new stuffed animal appeared. I mean, why is that stuffed animal even talking? Damn it! Seriously, I'm not a stuffed animal. I'm Monokuma, the headmaster of Hope's Peak Academy. This is Monokuma. Huh? Did you say headmaster? Anyway! Regardless, it appears everyone has gathered. Now then, as the headmaster, I shall make a formal declaration. Yeah. From this point <laughs> onward, the killing school trip will now commence. Killing school trip. <laughs> school trip where everyone gets along has no stimulation at all and it's so damn boring nobody wants to play a game like that hey, hey. you guys agree with me right thank you for so waiting. let's begin our killing school trip do your naturally best. you guys are the contestants you're kidding right killing contestants i won't forgive you what are you saying i will absolutely positively not allow such bloody events oh oh shit <laughs> damn this time you hit b into the kick Jeez, your brain child. sure is tiny, Monomi. How many times do I have to tell you? Pay attention this time, except in ma manga, a little sister is never smarter than her big brother. <laughs> uh, uh, I feel sorry for the for, for, for Monomi. Now then, we got off topic for a while, so let's get back to the explanation of the killing school trip. <laughs> what, what do you mean, killing school trip? What are you saying? Isn't it obvious? You guys are going to kill each other. Well... Kill each other, I see. Are you kidding Kill me? each other! Alright, Danny. 
No way, no way, no way! What are you saying? That's impossible. No! Well, don't you think it's kind of lame and boring that you can't leave this, leave the island unless you all get along? So I'm changing the rules. Yeah! If you want off this island, then please kill one of your friends. And then make it through the class trial without getting caught. <gasps> Class trial. That's right! That's right. The class trial is the real charm of this killing school trip. Allow me to explain. If one of you gets murdered, then sur the surviving members must participate in the class trial. At the class trial, there will be a showdown between the blackened killer and the other spotless students. During the trial, you'll present your arguments about who you think the blackened is. The outcome will be de decided by popular vote, and if you arrive at the correct answer, only the blackened killer will be punished. The rest may continue their school trip. However, if you choose poorly, then the one who got away with murder will survive, and the rest of you will receive your punishment. As far as the class trial rules go, that's all there is to it. In other words... Which means, if you kill someone and make it through the class trial, you get to live and leave this island. However, if you are found guilty during the class trial, then you will be punished. Hoo hoo hoo, it's a familiar but simple rule, right? What the heck? A little too familiar. You keep repeating that word punish over and over. What's the deal with that? Hmm. Basically, it's an execution. That is... E execution? Oh, the reused assets. The pleasing punishment that follows the class trial. This is one of the perks of the killing school trip. <laughs> what sort of spine-tingling punishments will we see? I can't help it. I'm already getting excited. There may even be some unique punishments, like impaling you through the head with a thingamajig claw. Hmm. Ahem, any method of killing is fine. Popular ones like bludgeoning, stabbing, strangling, and poisoning. To shooting, beating, running over, burning, bombing, slashing, drowning, elect electrocution, crushing, cursing. Shing! Please, cursing, choose whichever killing method you prefer. No time limit, so you can kill as you please. It's an all-you-can-murder buffet. A theme park of murder. That's awesome. That's what Pop this killing school trip is all about. I clutch my chest without realizing it. With each beat of my heart, a sharp stabbing pain coursed through my body. I didn't understand what was happening to me. Damn it. D don't fuck with me. That's right. Th that's right. Who on earth would kill someone? No way. I'm not ordering anyone to kill. Whether or not you kill someone is entirely up to you. No, But no. be careful. Youth doesn't last forever. <laughs> It'll be too late if you guys wait till you're in your 40s to start killing each other. I won't believe. I don't believe I won't any believe. of this. I don't believe any of this. I don't believe any of this, What's he says on? as he combs his hair. What if nobody ever gets murdered? Does that mean we'll never leave this island? Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? Is there fan art? One second. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. A new rule has been added to the game voting file. I made that joke yesterday. On, on Discord, that's that's funny. Uh, I was gonna add that you can now downvote the game as well as vote it up. I, th I think we'll do that for one of the future votes, yeah. <laughs> that is a, that is a creepy looking Monokuma dragon there. That looks really cool, thank you. Uh, oh, there's a bunch of uh, thank yous I need to send out as well. Uh, thank you to um, Buyers Remorse 7 for the 10 month resub. If all these characters were stranded on an island, what movies would they bring? Uh, hopefully all of them. All of them. I don't know. I don't really like questions like that. Like, if you were stranded on Desert Island, and it, what book would you bring? It's like, oh, a book that teaches you how to build a raft. You know, like, that, that sort of thing. I don't know. I think it doesn't matter. No matter what you bring, you're going to get bored of it eventually. After after a few weeks, you're done. Uh, Fuckboy RD would, would bring a, a bunch of anime, though, clearly. Uh, Ganele used five bits. Awari, light of my life, fire of my loins, my sin, my soul. Awari, the tip of my tongue, taking a trip three steps down the the palate to tap at three on the teeth. Awari, let me smash. Uh, nice, nice, nice poem, nice poem. Um, at least part of that is is one of the Lana Del Rey songs, isn't it? I can't remember the whole song. Uh, thank you, Chaziko, for the new Subway Prime. Welcome, Prime Time, Chaziko. 
Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Cairo Scorvier, Scorvier for the new summer prime as well. Thank you, Cairo Scorvier. Welcome, welcome, welcome to part time. Thank you, Vis Victus X for another 100 bits. 10 out of 10 masterpiece confirmed. Exactly, exactly. For sure, for sure. Ganale, you swipe bits again. If no one gets murdered, you have to explain why 10 o'clock at night was objectively the correct choice. How, how dare you bring that up? Who knows? Anyway. anyway, I'd like for you all to go through with this killing school trip in a healthy and positive manner. What's going on? Wait, just a minute. Why do we have to do this? What's this? Well, it's obvious. There's a reason you all need to kill each other. Eh? Hold on. Hold on. You've been running your mouth for quite some time now. I have no idea. I don't want to get violent, but if I do, I have no idea what might happen. I'm gonna do it. What? A fight? Do I need to beat the crap out of that black and white bear? Ooh. She has like a... A tough side, damn. Owie 2.0 may be better than Owie 1.0. No, 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 there's no way. There's, there's there's no way she could be better than the original Owie, right? There's no way. No, there's no there's no way. Why, why not even entertain the thought? Nice nails. Let's go. Who would dare try to kill? I'll put a stop to it with force if necessary. Why you? If you, if you keep saying stupid stuff, the athletes in our group are gonna lose their patience. Fine, fine. Uh, is that so? Well, I guess I expected this reaction. <laughs> if you guys wanna do things by force, then I'll have to fight back with a little force of my own. All right, who's gonna die? <laughs> and then, and then you know, come back later for no fucking reason. Force, what are you gonna do? Surge, O oh gods who dwell between light and darkness, in accordance with our contract, I summon thee now. Come forth, Come forth mono, beasts. mono beasts. What? Alright, I have the glass, I'm ready to sip. Alright, you know, I'm not sipping, that was kind of cool. Oh no, they look like ass. Okay, I'm sipping. I've seen lots of strange and surprising things since I first arrived at this island. But still, the phenomenon taking place right now in front of me was blatantly out of this world. Huh? Huh? What? Why did the statue this? move? Wrong! That's no statue. They're mono beasts. Ah! Monster! Shouldn't you be like, holy shit, those are so cool, you're the mechanic? Hey! No, I just said they're mono beasts. The strange thing about genuine surprise is that when it happens, your voice won't let you express it. I was forced to accept that. The sudden appearance of a monster might be normal in anime and video games, but not an anime video game, and that's precisely why I couldn't grasp the reality of the situation. I couldn't even feel fear, all I could do was stand aghast. No, no this can't be. This is just too weird. Oh, hold on to me, waifu. I'll Don't protect you. Tell me. Am I having a nightmare or something? Yeah, yeah, a nightmare, he says. He just admitted his brain is a total flower patch. She's nuts. Jeez, you guys sure are a skeptical bunch. If something doesn't fit within your narrow notions of common sense, you just deny it outright. Damn, I feel attacked. How stupid. Ignorant cavemen are better than you all. I don't like Classifying this. events according to their genre is a disease of the modern age. Everyone. Everyone, please stay back. I will protect everyone. I can't lose. Even at the cost of my own life, I will protect everyone. Huh? What's this? Ugh. Ugh. Ha! Uh, I know. This is nausea. Your sickly sweet sense of justice makes me want to puke. Let's go! Alrighty it's then, it's decided. Time! You'll be my example to everyone. Damn. Really? Oh shit. Whoa, that seems dangerous. Huh. Well, she's not gonna be in Danganronpa 3. Huh? What? What? What is that? A blah 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 blah. It's only the first stage, and. Manomi is already dead. What? 
Is that a demon? Or perhaps it's a weapon from the future? Is there Pepto Bismol on his shirt? <laughs> Mono beasts are dreadful weapons of destruction. The sudden appearance of a monster. Even though a life threatening monster appeared, not a single one of us tried to run away. It's not that we didn't realize it was a monster, we were just vastly out of our element. We had never experienced anything like this before, and had no idea how to deal with it. Well, Chad Ketchy has, the reality was very lethal at this particular moment. <laughs> That's right, this is what I wanted. This feeling of despair! Giving an, ex giving an example was totally the right call. <laughs> Unlike the exuberantly laughing Monokuma, we were completely frozen. As though we'd forgotten to breathe, we just stood there, horrified. We were powerless, no different than ants washed away in a storm after the creepy lolly girl had killed them. Well now! Now then, I believe I've made my point! Just so we're clear, you guys can't defy me. If you don't want to end up as fish food, you better not disobey me! Just so you know, I don't feel mercy or sympathy. Cause I'm a bear after all! An excuse like, I got high off this tropical atmosphere won't work on me at all! Hmm. Also, in addition to this, this this feels like theater to me. Like the the, the like I, I don't I don't think she's actually dead. This this feels like theater. Like like this was planned all along. For sure. Also, in addition to the Killing School trip, I've already updated the e-handbook. There, there, the rules for the Killing School trip are written, so you better read them thoroughly. <laughs> Ignorance of the rules is no excuse either. Well, that's also true of any society, really. Now then, enjoy the remainder of this liberating and harsh school trip. After he said his piece, Monokuma and his mono beasts vanished before our eyes. In truth, I was horribly tired. Everything was just so unreasonable. I didn't even care if this was the aftermath. Shady aftermath. Everyone else looked the same. We all had this tired expression on our pale faces. That's what just happened. Um. 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 I won't believe. I won't I just believe. Won't believe it. That's it. That's all there is to it. <coughs> It'd be one thing if we were up against a human or even an animal. <coughs> what the hell can we do against a monster like that? What's going on? It's impossible. Why is something impossible happening? It's certainly possible. Well, it's not really impossible. Those mono beasts or whatever they're called are machines. This monokuma must also be also be the same. As long as they're machines, it means someone made them and is controlling them. Yeah, about that. Then who could be responsible? Why were we put into this unexplainable situation? Answer me. Hey, who is it? Who? Uh. Ah. <laughs> uh, it could be anyone. Yeah. It's not like I believe it anyway, but there's no way I'd believe something like that. Anyway. More importantly, are you guys hungry? Let's stop thinking about this and just eat. Oh. You can eat first. Listen. No matter how confused or upset you are, I don't mind. However, remember this. I don't know who in the world is orchestrating this, but we don't need to be cautious of those machines or even of whoever's controlling them. More than anything, we must be cautious of each other. Ourselves. Being brought to a tropical island with complete strangers in order to kill each other to escape. Damn, look at the legs on Owie too. That creates fear in our minds, and the desire to escape that hopeless fear is our worst enemy. We looked around at each other's faces. It was obvious from looking at their expression. Everyone was forced to admit the truth of what he just said. We had to be honest with ourselves and admit that we also had that potential. Only a student who kills a classmate can escape this island. Which means, in order to escape this hopeless situation, we, we must sacrifice a person. However, there's a possibility that a killing may never occur, but even I'm no different. So can I, tru can I be truly confident that something like that isn't going to happen? No. There's no way I can know for sure. In this nightmare of a situation, I don't have the confidence to say that outright. Once you're suspicious of something, you'll start to be suspicious of everything. Even of yourself. Damn. Don't trust anyone. That's why it felt so hopeless. That's why we were despairing. That day became a day unlike any other. A day which held a more significant meaning. It was a special day, 
a very meaningful day full of despair. That was the beginning. The killing school trip had begun, and this trip tropical island was the stage. Hmm. Literally. Oh, here we are again! The real intro starts now. Showing that you killed her. Jimmy. Gamers rise up. Waifu. Owie 2.0. Crazy girl. Crazy guy. Not Leon. Uh. Wendy. Fuckboy RD. Looks like the same elevator from the first game. Makoto. Uh, totally not Mondo. Crazy Girl. Paco. Chat's Waifu. Secretly my Waifu. Chihiro but not Chihiro. Fat Ketchy. No Danny. Rip. No Danny. Welcome to Dangan Island. Panic at the heart. Throbbing school trip. Surviving students. 16. Prologue. Okay. Oh damn, the Pepto Bismol's back. Okay, I would do a tw I would do a poll to see who is Chat's waifu, but I have a feeling that will reveal to me uh, who might die, so I'm not going to do that. You've obtained a present. Faux show, broken wand. It's broken for show. Uh, faux show? Like for show? Like it was broken for show? Or is faux show a, a, a word that I don't know in, in Japanese? Like the whole thing was for show? Last Judge of Seven, use 40 bits to say thank you for keeping me entertained while studying. Please put these bits into Finn's college fund. Oh, thank you so much, Last Judge. Thank you. Uh, Grill Scout <laughs> has used... Uh, uh, sorry, it has resubscribed for two months with the message yeet. What's a yeet? I know what a neat is, but what's a yeet? Thank you very much, Grill Scout. Cool name. Thank you. F for sure. Rule 5. Once a murder takes place, a class trial will begin shortly thereafter. Participation is mandatory for all surviving students. If the blackened is exposed during the class trial, they alone will be executed. If the blackened is not exposed, the remaining students will be executed. As a reward, the surviving blackened will be forgiven of their crime and allowed to leave the island. The body discovery announcement will play as soon as three or more people discover a body for the first time. Same rules as last time, I believe. I think it was three. It wasn't two. Yeah, it was three. Destroying any property on this island without permission is expressly prohibited. This includes the surveillance cameras and monitors. You are free to investigate this island at your own discretion. Your actions in this regard are not limited. Hmm. Additional school trip rules may be added at the headmaster's discretion. Yeet is the present tense of yo- Oh, okay, that explains it. Thank you. As I, as, I raised, as I raised my head from the e-handbook with a heavy sigh, I saw the dark courtyard of the hotel. I sat on the bench, paralyzed with thought. Is he really going to make us do this? There was no way I could believe this was that this was now my reality. Even so, this was undeniably real. Uh, thank you for another bits, Tim Foyle. Um, okay, now this is epic. That feel you're trying to get gamers to rise up, and then a Chad bear takes you to an island with a bunch of normies and Veronica's. No, <laughs> thank you for the for the bits of wuggy knot. Looks like Chad Ketchy has joined the Ass Eaters and took the name too seriously. Damn, damn. 
Like he's such, he's so good at it that the that that the girls like feed him a bunch of food afterwards. Like damn, what a Chad. What a Chad. He's still ca Chad catchy in my heart. Even so, this was undeniably real. No matter how much I didn't uh, want to believe it, the moment I experienced and felt it for myself, it became undeniably real. Yeah, Arsenal gear is very convincing. This is a reality that could not be more different from my usual daily life. School, studying, exams, eating ass, job hunting, going for walks, going to school, riding the train, lectures. That kind of daily life is no longer mine. As I looked up, I saw stars glimmering in the night, covering the sky like a sheet. They looked as they were about to fall into my hands like fluttering snow. For the first time since I arrived at this island, instead of the night sky I'd grown accustomed to, I saw a night sky that was far too beautiful. As I stared blankly into that night sky, I suddenly imagined those words in my mind. A student who murders their classmate will be able to leave this island. When we were forced to hear those words, we just stood there silently. Nobody said a word, and eventually, everyone scattered and vanished. And it led straight on to the first night, a night so beautiful, and en it enchanted me. And yet, my heart was horribly upset. That kind of beauty was definitely far different than my usual daily life. Chap Chapped one. Destination, despair, daily life. Ding dong, bing bong. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Oh shit! <laughs> Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Nighttime can be confusing. If you're out at night and accidentally meet a killer, then it sucks to be you. But if you're worried about that and can't sleep, I've prepared a cottage on the hotel grounds for each of you. Every single one of you, please feel free to rest in your own rooms. However, before you go to bed, I strongly recommend you lock your doors. Damn. You never know who might be planning to kill you. We can always go see our bro, though, because Makoto never locked his door. <laughs> Bye-bye. Damn, that's ominous. A cottage, huh? Hotel Marai. Oh, how's our pet? Still not pooping? Damn. Damn, I wonder if it's gonna grow into a new Monomi. The biggest, most awful, most tragic sprinkler in 10 p.m. history. <laughs> Can we leave or do we have to go to our room? I guess I'll head over to the cottage right now. Okay. Oh, this is nice. Pink Air 3D has resubscribed for 11 months with the message rule rule seven. <laughs> Don't fuck with the sprinklers. Thank you, thank you for the reset, Pink Air 3D. Uh, and Hunter used 100 bits. Wouldn't it be cool if two completely unrelated murders happened at the same time? That would be cool, but I don't know how the game would handle it, right? How, how would the game um, how would the game do the two trials at once unless they would try to incorporate it and you would have to figure out that it was two killers at the same time? Maybe the game will do that. I have no idea. That would be kind of cool, yeah. Damn it. As soon as I entered the cottage, I collapsed onto the bed. What the hell? As I screamed silently to myself, I buried my head in my arms. I didn't want to see anyone anymore. I just wanted to be alone forever. Damn, I hope that you locked the door or else some guy in a mask and a knife is gonna show up. I have nobody I can trust because even if I wanted to trust them, I don't know anything about them yet. The only person I can trust is myself. No, even I don't believe that. 
Damn, I trust myself. In truth, after I was forced to hear that dumb rule, you can't leave unless you kill someone, I realized there's a part of me that really wants to get off this island. And at that moment, I let out a scream. Ah! Available to do voice acting, by the way. Uh, a scream erupted from my mouth. Ah! It rushed from my mouth like water from a collapsed dam. Ah! Why me? Why do I have to go through with this? Ah! I began to lose my voice and it faded entirely not long after. What followed was silence. No, not complete silence. I heard the faint sound of crashing waves in the distance. As if the waves were murmuring into my ears, this is no longer the world you knew. And once again, I buried my head in my arms. Why am I here? What am I doing here? There's a fan meme? Okay, one second. Is that the sound Joe makes when he achieves orgasm? Nah, I'm such a chad, I've, I've never achieved orgasm. Pfft. Who's that for? Uh, I'm not seeing a link. Where is it? Can someone link it again? I'm not seeing it. Two kids, two kids. By the way, yeah, you you don't you don't need to to, to achieve orgasm to uh, to ha to have kids. There are syringes. What what is going on? What is that thing? It's number fifteen, Burger King foot lettuce. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, gather ye hope buds while ye, while ye may. Killing time is still flying, and this same flower that smiles today, tomorrow will be dying. Yeah, I, I don't think anyone's dying in this stream, but someone's going to be dying next stream. Unless the, 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 the death is, is pretty soon. Uh, Ralph Pogs used 100 bits. Nice Rex falling impression. Thanks, thanks. I forced my eyes shut. Yeah, it's pretty close, isn't it? I wasn't tired or anything, but I just wanted to sleep, if only for a short while. I want to put an end to it all, and if by chance I managed to wake up the next day, it would be awesome if I was back to my normal life. With these meager expectations, I fell into a light sleep. Do -do 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 -do. Monokuma Theater! Oh, and the other Monokumas are watching. Ahem! Danganronpa 2! To those of you who purchased Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair, thank you very much! To those of you who are borrowing Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair from a friend, you always risk losing friends when you borrow their things, so you should try to buy your own copy just to be safe. Now then, it's been a while since the main story started, so I'll give the keynote address right now. From now on, I promise you'll be charmed by this world. It genuinely deserves to be called a true game, unlike the last one that wasn't a game. So make sure you get excited and immerse yourself in the heart-throbbing action to your heart's content. Now then, now until then. the very end, please enjoy this game to the fullest! Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make! Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is gonna be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! So, it definitely wasn't a dream after all. I was forced to acknowledge that yet again, which put me in a bad mood from the get-go. I guess for now, I should go outside. Like, Jimmy is a little, is a little frostier than Makoto. Like, Jimmy is, is, is more, is reacting more to what's going on. I like that. I like that. Makoto was just kind of eh, you know? Too much of a blank slate, and, and sometimes he would react to things, and sometimes he really wouldn't. J Jimmy seems more like a character, and I like that. No, oh, no, 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 you're not allowed to go out. Monokuma, why are you here? No way! Hey now, don't be so worried. I'm here for fun reasons. Oh no, fun reasons? Hey, um... I want you to find my stuffed animals. 
I got ahead of myself and made too many. But I thought it'd be a waste to just throw them, throw them away, so I've hidden them all over the island. If you please. They're scattered all over various areas, so you just go right ahead and look for them all. Do they have coins in them? Why do I have to do something like that? Too bad. Because I said so. You can't say no. I've already hidden one of them in this room, and I won't let you out until you find it. Well? Good luck. Damn it, that's selfish stuffed animal. Okay, it's gonna be under the bed. This bed is pretty comfortable. Oh, so wrong, so wrong, so wrong. What is this? It looks like a shelf. I feel like I shouldn't put anything here. Oh! <gasps> Is, you, is that him watching, or is that a, like, what? This room has a lot of windows. They probably wanted to feel, tropi to feel tropical and open. Well, this isn't really this time to be grateful for that. Damn, man. Damn, man. Huh? I've been found. Oh. I thought it was him just watching us. Oh, okay. Well. Oh, so they don't show up on the uh, on the tab thing and it's interactable? Oh, okay. Good job. I've also left you some mon mono coins. I'm so generous. Isn't that These wonderful. coins can be exchanged for fabulous items at the beach and the rocket punch market. I've also hidden the stuffed animals in other places too, so do your best and look for them. <laughs> if you find them, find them all. Surprise, surprise. What? Never mind. I should just go. All right, so I don't think you showed up when I did tabs. You're just supposed to look for them. Okay, is that the only way to get coins? Because if it is, I really like that. I don't have to click on everything in every single fucking, uh, in uh, every, every, um, in every setting. This is where the Monokuma plushies are placed. Putting stuff like this here without my permission. There's a room for showering beyond this point. It's pretty large and it looks easy to use, but I've never really felt comfortable showering. What? Well, it's this kind of situation after all. Uh. Ah! ah, shit, it's Shark Man. Huh? Oh, it's just you. Don't scare me like that. I, I could say the same for you. Hey. But by the way, did you see them? Damn it! Oh man, not good. What the hell? Are what the hell are they? Definitely not good. What are you talking about? Uh, the bridge, you know? Remember that bridge at the central island? Did something happen to it? Uh, no shit, why the hell else would I be here? This is bad. If those monsters are in front of the bridges, they're blocking them off. Wrong! They're not monsters, they're mono beasts. Uh, oh my god, it's here! So the mono cool. beasts are the guardians of Jabberwock Island. Throw a Pokeball at them and you can catch them. They're making sure you guys don't think about ignoring the progression by going to the other islands. If those monsters are his gate are his gatekeepers, it's better if I don't get close to them. Damn it! Fuck, oh, so annoying. I can't stand this anymore. Hey, get a grip. Your face is getting weird. Aww, man. Oh, yeah, it really is. What the fuck? I can't. There's no way I can get a grip. We're gonna get eaten by monsters. There's no way I can enjoy vacationing here now. Hey. Hey, what's all the noise? Ah! Ah, another m -m -m monster <laughs> And I came all the way here to get you both, but if you're going to call me a monster. Yeah, you're here to get us. Well, obviously. I was sold to come get you because we we kept waiting and you two never showed up. Everyone is waiting at the hotel restaurant. Hurry up and join us. Everyone's waiting at the restaurant. Oh, just fuck boy, you make us breakfast. Uh, whatever, man. I don't care. I don't care at all. Ah! I'm out of here. Hey, where are you going? That's why I tried to save. But Kazu Kazuki Leon sprinted away like lightning. Noel, I guess I'll head over to the restaurant. On, uh, let's check on the pet. Did it poop overnight? No. The, the steps count here is it was at 200 and something, right? So if I just run around, will it go below 200? The steps here count, or is it only outside? Does. Oh, pooped. All right. Okay, it's gonna take forever. Let's just let's just keep going. Oh, 
Huh? I thought everyone was waiting at the restaurant. Yep. I thought I'd get some gaming in until everyone else arrived. Mm. But I guess I should get going too. Damn. Playing video games all morning, huh? She truly is the ultimate gamer. Yeah, apparently so am I. Okay. Damn, the gamer rose up when she went up the stairs. <laughs> You're late, Jimmy. And where is... His last name was Soda, right? Let's go with Soda. Where's Soda? I thought you were together. He ran off somewhere. Huh? Huh? Where? Well, he pretty much said he was running away, but... But... Running? But where? <laughs> There's nowhere to run away. What a weirdo. However... However, after what we witnessed yesterday, his behavior is understandable. Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Did something happen yesterday? I don't remember anything happening, and even if I did, it looked totally fake anyway. Understand? Yep, yep. Not worth remembering at all. I'd be a lot easier to deal... It'd be a lot easier to deal with all this if I could just deny it outright like that. Hey. Didn't Danny do that in the first game? So, why why have you gathered us here? <laughs> Not yet. Not until Soda arrives. He needs Soda with his meal. Ah, wait a sec. That means the reason you told us to come here is... Pointing! We oui. Apparently, Monsieur... <laughs> Barracuda has something to tell us. Really? What? I'm gonna do it! Obviously, we're here to discuss our strategy for defeating that monster. It's impossible! There's no way we can fight that thing. I mean, it, it has heavy weapons and everything. Show some spirit! Anything is possible with a fighting spirit. Let me tell you this. A bold boast. However, let me give you some advice. That was close. The truly strong do not raise their voice so recklessly. Hey, hey! Hey, hey, let's start talking already. <laughs> Humph, this is probably some lame attempt to make us feel better or something. Don't make me repeat myself. Don't make me repeat myself. When everyone is here, then we can start talking. Ah, jeez, oh, geez, fine. I'll just bring soda myself then. Everyone wait here. I'll find him and bring him here, even if I have to tie him up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm a little jealous now, getting tied up by Miss Mahiru. Should should Fuckboy RD have Manfred's voice? I'm a little jealous now, getting tied up by Miss Mahiru. <laughs> well, maybe I should run away too. Just kidding. <laughs> Disgusting moron. That's fine. Now then, let's have breakfast while we wait for everyone. Let's eat. Let's eat. The moment he said that, he started wolfing down the pile of food in front of him. Um, where did that food come from anyway? <laughs> when I arrived this morning, it was already here. Ah, uh, they even have crab and shrimp? Aww. Crab and shrimp are such a pain to eat. I hate them as much as I hate Mikan's ugly, stuttering face. <gasps> How dare dare you insult my waifu wow yeah so she's so so blonde lolly is the is is the the, the 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 taco of this game right she's she's hard shell and soft shell together she's the taco of this game um i'm curious if any of the other ones have a, have a darker side to them with my ugly stuttering face gross that's it. That's the face right there. Why? Why are you being so mean? <laughs> <laughs> You're the kind of girl that bullies just... L that bullies just love to torment, aren't you? Honestly. You should stop now. Oh! Uh, I got it. Teru Teru prepared this food, right? <laughs> mm -hmm -hmm. Unfortunately, it wasn't me. Eh? You see, the food I make doesn't taste as shitty as this does. <sighs> this is bad. It tastes yummy to me. Hey, Aoi. No, 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 no. Just yummy, right? Compared to the world-class dishes I make, a dish that tastes yummy would still be considered shit. Nonsense! In fact, even comparing them is out of the question. Oh, man. The, the art style is so surreal sometimes. Comparing my dishes to this lowly peasant food. How rude. Hey, hey. Don't take it so personally. I understand. I'm just saying, if you guys ate my food, you wouldn't be able to control yourself. What? What does that mean? Well done. Well, let's just say your jaw wouldn't be the only thing that drops. Oh. Would her black thong drop? There's no mistake. In fact, your panties would drop too, like the black, <laughs> like the black thong Miss Pecco is wearing, for example. What did you say? You creep. How do you know about that? Oh shit! She just admits it. He he guessed correctly. However. Oh damn! There's there's some really there's some really hot fucking waifu uh waifu uh. Uh, competition for this game. It's not like the first game where there's only like two choices. Like this, there's, there's there's a lot of fucking waifu competition. However, if uh, Fuckboy RD did not, 
However, if Fuckboy RD did not prepare this food, then the one who did is... Could it have been Monokuma? Is it safe to eat food cooked by something like that? Don't worry. That's why I'm tasting it for poison, to make sure it's safe for consumption. But you don't need to eat that much to check it for poison. Hey! Okay, thanks for waiting. I brought him. You are a boy, right? Hey, st straighten up more. Shouldn't a man like you be embarrassed to walk like that? Aw, man. So stop, don't pull. You're gonna rip my sleeves. <laughs> yeah, even though you look all flashy, you're actually a big coward. Be careful. Are you gonna be okay? People like you are usually the first victim, you know? I was just thinking that, actually. <laughs> I just want to go home already. Crash, clatter, boom. <laughs> ah, what? What the? Okay, so when 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 our our, our nurse Fu uh, went in the bathing suit and went into the ocean, she didn't have the bandages on, right? So she puts their decorative band bandages. They're just there because she likes to wear them. So she's kind of into you know a little bit of light bondage maybe. All right, competition is is heating up. Oh no 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 no! I I, I, I tripped. Can you even call that tripping? How in the world did you end up in such a compromising position after tripping? Well, it certainly makes me happy. I'm very happy right now. <laughs> oh, I'm so embarrassed. Please help me. Ah, she looks so adorable when she's embarrassed. It's so moe. I'm practically snorting with joy. Moe? We we should help her up. Are you okay? Ah! Uh, my head is throbbing a little bit. Uh, a little, but I'm okay. Your head's definitely not okay. Hey. She's beyond being just a clumsy girl. That fall of hers was like a magic trick or something. Um. Anyway, everybody's here now, right? Then let's get going. Mm. Since I'm getting sleepy. Hmm. You're right, though I'm not quite ready to stop eating breakfast. I should begin my talk. So it's finally starting. That took way too long. Oh, we can talk to everybody. Here we go. All right. Hey, Allie. Hey, hey. Can I just, can I listen while I eat? That's enough. No. Lies. But I got all this food on my plate. <laughs> um, what the hell is he scoffing about? <laughs> Such a cluttered, vulgar way of piling food. There's no semblance of theme or principle on this plate. You honestly but think most importantly, that is a large you pile honestly of think food. that is a large pile of food. You? What you say? Let me say. Let this. me say this. Do not even think about copying what I do. This much food is beyond you, lowly peasants. I'm the only one who could possibly eat this much food, for I've overcome the hardships of the past. The hardships of the past. With his confident attitude, it doesn't suit him at all to talk about stuff like hardships. Try saying that again. Well, yeah, if, if, if the world really did end and this is based at some point some point in the future, then, you know, his his him being overweight like that would be like a status symbol that he he got past that. But that, that doesn't seem to be the case at all. Hey, I can't just ignore someone like that. Hey. Owie, you shouldn't. If you attempt an eating competition, you'll ruin that perfect figure of yours. What? Why you? Do you have any idea how much money I spent sculpting my physique? Are you telling me I need to lose weight? What are these guys even fighting about? Huh. Maybe we're the only ones that don't know that the that, that, that the world ended. And then uh, and then at the end, um, th th they'll say, you know, they say to me, What do you mean? You don't know that the world ended? And I'll be like, well, you never asked! Hey! I hope Mikan is going to be okay. Even even if she's a nurse, it'll still be difficult for her to treat her own wounds. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like my guess was correct. So Miss Pico was wearing a black thong. At this rate, I should make my move with Miss Sonia too. <sighs> Sorry, we seriously need to keep an eye on him. This is the Tanaka Empire. For my four dark. Devas, Devas. I can't remember what you guys said. Davas of destruction. It's snack time. I shall engulf huh. this world. Feast upon your meal. I can't remember. You, you guys told me what it was, and I can't remember how to pronounce it. Davas. I'm gonna forget. It's gonna be new. It's gonna be different every single time. Davas. It's hard for me to move around with normal undergarments. That's the only reason. <laughs> Good. 
Good nom nom it's nomming. morning. Good nom nom morning. Nom nom nomming. <laughs> Man, I slept so much. I hate everything about you. Just kidding. I was worried about what's going to happen from now on, so I couldn't fall asleep. You're going to live the whole game, aren't you? The whole game you're going to be here. She should probably sound more worried. Okay. Hey, hey! She literally tripped over nothing. Seriously, that sort of thing should only ever happen in manga. <laughs> or did she do it on purpose? If so, that's super annoying. She wanted to show everyone that she wasn't wearing a black thong. Oh. Chicken meat. Make sure you consume as much chicken meat as you possibly can. What are you talking about? <laughs> if you want muscles, then you must consume chicken. Chicken is low in calories and high in protein. Hmm. Now's not a good time. <laughs> hmm. I see. No worries then. Mikan, are you okay? You said your head was throbbing. <laughs> I'm alright. It, it actually happens a lot. Thank you very thank much. Thank you very much for worrying about me. <laughs> Makoto. Hajime. Hey Jimmy, did you see the new rules in the e handbook? It looks like this killing school trip isn't a joke after this all. This is troubling. That Monokuma thing is serious. He really wants us to start killing each other. Sorry. Ah, sorry. Looks like my fear is contagious. If he really means that, then my face must look really pale right now. Um. Hey Sonya. I did not know Mr. Monokuma could cook. His appearance would suggest he is ill-suited for intricate work. I wonder if it is all right. It's not Monokuma doing the cooking. Maybe who's ever controlling that thing prepared this food? Yeah, who's controlling it? Sleepy. Mm, so sleepy. I just want him to finish the story already. Huh? What's with the whole people like you are usually for the first victim remark? As long as I lock myself in my room, there won't be any problems. That's something victims usually do too. Yeah, poorly. Don't talk to me. As usual, he's so standoffish. He? Listen. First, I have a question for you all. That Monokuma thing ordered us to kill each other. So under these strange circumstances, what do you think we need right now? <laughs> Who the fuck knows? Get to the point already. Don't make me repeat myself. If you want me to get to the point, you better hurry up and answer my question. Huh? What do we need? We need food and sleep, obviously, right? No! No, you've forgotten about shitting. <laughs> what? Have you finally taken your angry poop? Did, did, did it happen? Which means the answers are a good appetite, a good night's sleep, and a good shit. Hmm. Does anyone have a real answer? Perhaps. Could it be a bond? A bond? I... This is what I believe. As long as the ultimates work together, there's nothing we can't accomplish. Thou oh, art I. It's obvious. You'll be able to create a hope that can overcome any despair. That's why, if we want to escape this island, we need to promise each other that we'll shit together. Gross! Wow, he said that with a straight face. How is he not embarrassed? <laughs> ah, just as I figured. That was kind of lame, huh? However... However, he does have a point. That must be why Monokuma is enforcing a rule that will cause us to be suspicious of each other. I see. I see. That was a pretty good answer. Since it's impossible to face our enemy as individuals, under these circumstances, we must fight as a group. <laughs> However, what we need to achieve... What we need to achieve that solidarity is not something as easygoing and optimistic as a bond. Huh? Then what? Listen. What we need right now is a disciplined... Is a disciplined leadership provided by an unmistakable leader. I see. I see. Even sports teams need captains after all. Rejoice. Rejoice. I shall accept the position. I mean, the ultimate team leader should like, 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 what? Huh? Hmm. Now then, I'll wrap this. I'll wrap up this introduction and let's move on to the main question. Hey! Wait just a second. What? What is it? Jeez. What did you just say? I don't care how you excuse it. You're being too forceful. Deciding to be the leader all on your own, and why does it have to be you anyway? Not possible. Who is more fit to lead other than me? I am the ultimate affluent progeny of the Tokami household, destined to stand above all others. What are you saying? So seriously, I'm telling you that attitude of yours is too forceful. Wait! My hero, please wait. It's true the Barracuda may be a little forceful, but given our current situation, I believe it's a leader's duty under circumstances like this to be forceful to a certain degree. But... That may be true, but if we just need someone who can lead, can lead people, then even Sonya can. No. No, perish the thought. I am merely a figurehead. No, perish the thought. I am merely a figurehead. Hey. Well, he must have the qualities of a leader if he can accept that the role under these circumstances. Mm. What? You're weird, Makoto. If everyone's okay with it, I'm okay with it too. It's all clear now. Then I guess we've made our decision. Don't worry, as long as I'm the leader, I won't let anyone become a victim. I will guide, I will guide you, you all. all. That much, I promise. Alright, you're dead. 
Yeah, so reliable. It's true, he's reliable, but I'm a little surprised. I didn't think he was the type of guy who'd say something like that. I expected the ultimate affluent progeny to look down on us like we're bugs or something. <laughs> Now then, let's move on to the topic at hand. For real this time, I have something to show you all. For real. Something to show follow us. Follow me. It's at Jabberwock Park at the Central Island. Come follow me. After saying it so bluntly, uh, Fat Ketchy turned and left the restaurant, stomping his feet along the way. Just as I thought, he sure is forceful. Aww. Jeez, we may have made a mistake in choosing him as the leader. That like, the ultimate leader guy isn't gonna make a, like, a comment? No? Though everyone made similar complaints, they all followed Barracuda out of the restaurant. Except for Aoi and Yusuke. Hey, Aoi. You don't have to pay attention to me. Just go. I'll catch up with you soon. You don't seem so persuasive when you have that look on your face. I can't help it. When I get hungry, I lose most of my energy. So... After she said that, uh, Awari ate the entire pile of food on her plate in one gulp. Scarp, snaff, glorp. Om nom nom. Man, that was good. You ate so fast, I doubt you even tasted it. Ugh. What happened? Are you choking? Damn it. Crap. Now that I've eaten a little, I'm even hungrier. So annoying. Are, do you have two stomachs and they're both in your boobs or something? Like, what's going on? Jeez. jeez. Uh, Fat Ketchy better finish this talk fast, because once he's done, I'm going to eat as much as I can. I guess I should go for now. Let's go, Jumpy! Magazi! Sandy! Champy! Not even going to try. I better hurry and follow after Barracuda. He's at Jabberwock Park, I believe. Whoops, over here. What are you doing? You should hurry over to the park. Yeah! What? Didn't the same thing happen last time too? Hey! Jimmy, how many times are you gonna surprise me? I just spoke to you normally. Anyway, you should hurry over to the park. Damn it! Shut up, I'm going back to my room. Seriously, this is all just one big hassle. Ah! Ah, damn it. Seriously, if we're on tropical paradise, then why are we in this situation in the first place? Isn't that right? Isn't a vacation supposed to be nothing but lounging around and sipping coconut juice? Relax. Snappy me won't change a thing, okay? Hey! Jimmy, it's decided. You better come to the beach with me later. Huh? Oh! For coconuts, damn it. I saw some big ones that fell on, onto the shore. I haven't figured out how to split, the, split them open, but once I do, we're gonna have ourselves some coconut juice. Never had coconut juice, is it good? You can't just will a coconut to open. Just give up and get some coconut juice from the supermarket. Ah! Right, you just don't understand. Fine, be that way. I'm never gonna ask for your help again. He left. I hope he goes straight to the park. Now then, I should hurry too. Uh, thank you, Nightblade Cthulhu, for the new set with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Nightblade Cthulhu. Welcome, welcome. Forlorn Winter, 69 bits to say Panty Shot. Is that when the girl fell over? And Koi Vision for the 12 month resub. I guess the first one we've had today, isn't it? One year Pog Champion. Thanks so much, Koi Vision. Hope you like the, 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 the final form of the chat icon. Thank you, Koi Vision. Are there any that I missed? Oh, there are, there are a bunch of, uh, of, of comments here. Um, I don't think I'm going to read them all, sorry. I'm, I'm hoping to see if we can get to, uh, to, to a, a death this, this, this stream. <laughs> In two years, it's just fire. Yeah, th th thank you, Koi Vision. All right, uh, should we should we go the the long way or what? Can we go explore right now? Damn, back to the good part. Fuck yeah. Bum 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 bum. Oh what? Oh, uh, we get to buy things now instead of just getting it randomly? Oh, that sucks. Okay, we'll just wait for now then. That sucks. 
to the left to get there. Oh shit. Look at this thing. That strange mono beast machine is blocking the bridge. I shouldn't carelessly approach it. These seem overkill. Okay, did our pet poop again? Wow, it did. Oh, it's gonna grow in 18 steps, okay. Level up. Oh, and our pet, our pet leveled up too. It's set on there, okay, cool. Oh, it's in a cocoon. Until next growth, 90, oh, let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it, 98 steps, let's do it. Nice steps, it shouldn't take too long. Oh, there we go. See, it didn't take too long. Less than a minute. Oh, it's like a snake thing now. Cool. Cool. Can we give presents? No, we don't have any presents. It's like a snake thing. Snake Emmy in the background? Oh, can we can we get the, can we get the, the the broken staff thing? Here, have this. Proof that you've cleared the prologue. Yuzami had this magic stick, but it's seriously broken. For show. <laughs> for for show. Mm. All right, so two thousand steps. Let's do it. Let's just do it now. I'm really curious. Skinny people, you're awfully slow. Um. It seems you're just too fast for us. Ah. Uh, Jeez, I never expected a fat soul like him to move so fast. What? So what's supposed to be here? What? Here, really? Such um, ignorance. If you haven't noticed it yet, then I was right to dismiss you all as idiots. Hmm, I wonder what he's talking about. Hmm. I what it could be. Probably the camera, right? Can we talk to everybody again? It is like it is like a game of spot the difference. I'm actually quite good at that. <laughs> a fatso that can move fast. Is he talking about pigs and cows? What? Humph cowards. Alright, this this doesn't seem worthwhile. I see. Barracuda probably wants us to see that thing right in front of us. Okay, this doesn't seem worthwhile. Let's talk to our, 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 our waifu. Um, um, I think it's better if you properly eat breakfast before you move around. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm sorry, sorry, I'm meddling too much. Where's, where, where's, yeah, here we go, where's fuckboy ID? Well, mornings at guess the that's about aren't so it. Bad. Well, even so, I still prefer the quiet mornings of my big city hometown. Yeah, this is boring, right? What is that? 21 days left. An obviously out of place object placed in the center of a peaceful park. Oh, damn, is it? Is that is that is that when we have to, to steal the the treasure from the palace and then we're done? Looks like a clock, but something seems off. It's counting down. What's going on? Was this here when we came last time? No. No, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Hmm. I found it this morning when I was exploring the island one more time. It's unknown when it was actually placed here. It appears. Monokuma must have placed this object. What does this countdown even mean? 
I have no clue. <laughs> Once again, something has appeared that I don't understand. But it's got nothing to do with me, because I refuse to believe this is happening. Hold on! Could it be? It better not be a bomb. Are you kidding me? A b b b b b b b bomb Not possible. Scoop! If they wanted to blow up the island, they would have done so by now. There's no need for a countdown. Um... Then what are they counting down? Hmm... It's a mystery. Right? A mystery. Are they going to do the same thing again where another character is going to be like, yeah, you're right. A mysterious mystery, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, no, they didn't. Yeah. Yeah. Monomi? What? Why are you here? Um. I heard everyone talking while I was patrolling, so I came over. Um. No, not that. Didn't um, Monokuma kill you? I see. Ah, uh, so that's why you were surprised. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. After all, I can never die. It appears I see. you can you must be escape. I see, you must be an undead abomination risen from the foulest depths of the netherworld by black magic. <laughs> Do you want me to make you my thrall? Hey, hey. Well, Nomi's a mechanical stuffed animal, right? Doesn't that mean she can't die in the first place? <laughs> now that you mention it, she'd only need like a spare or something. <laughs> a spare? What a mean thing to say. <laughs> However, you have arrived at the perfect time. There's something I wanted to ask Come you. Come on. What is the meaning behind this timer and this countdown? Answer me. Mm? Huh? Countdown? Wah! Wah! What is this? Um, I'm sorry. I don't know what this is. Hey. You really don't know? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't really have a grasp of what Monokuma is up to. Huh? You don't know, even though you're Monokuma's little sister? That's wrong! I'm not my brother's little sister. <laughs> Did she accept the role or not? Which one is it? Alrighty! Uh, anyway, let's all do our best. Let's kick the evil Monokuma off this island. <laughs> if you don't know what the countdown is for, you're useless to us. Get lost. Um... Um, let's together... I said get I lost. I said get lost. Yeah! Yeah. I'm sorry. Um... Um, perhaps you're being a little too harsh? I'm starting to feel sorry for it. <laughs> Miss Sonia, may I call you Miss Sonia? No, I insist on calling you that. I won't be fooled! There's no need to feel sorry for that thing. She's obviously working with Monokuma. Hey, bastard! Who the fuck cares about that stuffed animal? More importantly, what the hell is that clock? Hmm. Looks ominous, doesn't it? Who put that object here, and how did they do it in just one night? Hmm, I can't imagine. Hmm. Which means it doesn't make any sense. Also, it's deadly. It's deadly. <laughs> a deadly countdown. A deadly bomb, a deadly statue. However, that's not all that's unimaginable. This island is full of mysteries that we can't begin to imagine. For example, how were the 16 of us brought to this island? Hmm. I wasn't trying to think about that since it's been bugging me too, but he's right, that is a mystery. <laughs> There's more. Why is Jabberwock Island, which was known for being a popular resort destination, now an uninhabited island? There's no sign of tourists or even citizens on this island. Is something like that even possible? This too All must be the will of All civilizations are destined to collapse. Nothing begets existence, and existence begets nothing. <laughs> so it collapsed? You are right. Society is much like fruit. Once it matures, it is inevitable that it will eventually rot. As the economy grows, the private sector stagnates. As elders and brewer cats become more and more powerful, as time passes, this power becomes the status quo and crushes the seeds of any possible reformation. That is... Such a sad trend. Hmm... Hmm, I don't really understand all that, but I feel like the situation here is somewhat different. So... Maybe the Mono Beasts killed everyone on this island. What?! And that's how it became uninhabited? It's certainly possible. It's a possibility, but we don't know that for sure. Hmm. This mystery remains a mystery, it seems. <laughs> It's like everything, it's like everything here is just full of mysteries. Hmm. Nice expression there. You're right, it's mysteries on top of mysteries. It's mysteries all the way down. However, since these mysteries are overlapping with one another, I doubt some no-name group is behind this. Well, what are you trying to say? So in other I mean, words... the situation we're in is undeniably the work of some enormous organization. <laughs> enormous organization? Hmm. Monomi, Monokuma, the Mono Beasts, they're all machines that require major technical skill to operate. Are we screwed? There's no way that just some random high schooler could have put it together. Plus, they need a ton of funding, and there's no way those things were made just for the hell of it. In other words... That organization might be controlling these machines and monitoring the island with those cameras. Then... Could those fiends be hiding on this island? Not possible. Not likely. They're probably running this from somewhere else, somewhere safe. Oh? Where would that be? 
Hmm. I don't know. Anyway, there's no mistake that an enormous organization is behind all of this. Hmm. I see. A big organization, huh? I can't imagine what kind of people they could be. It's definitely not just a model and, 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 and her sister. There's no way. In other words... Well, let's see. There's my Togami Corporation, Sonya's Novosela Kingdom, and the Kazurio Clan. It would definitely have to be a, an organization as powerful as one of those groups, if not more so. And definitely not just two girls that just decided to do something on a whim. Huh? Huh? I'm used to being mistrusted. Do what you will. Hey! Hold on. I don't care about you or the Kazurio clan, but I won't allow you to doubt Miss Sonya. Miss Sonya is a hot blonde princess. There's a sharp distinction between her and you punks. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Just shut up already, loser. Whoa! Loser? Are you talking about me? Yeah. It's obvious from your flashy clothes that you just want to stand out because you're actually a loser. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> must be hard to make your living in the lame-ass loser industry. <laughs> Too far, dude. That's going way too far. Dude? Hey, Barracuda, were you serious just now about this being related to your family and Sonya's and such? <laughs> I'm just using them as an example. I'm not saying they have anything to do with this. Okay, I'm really sorry to do this all, all to you, because I know that a bunch of you are, know the image I'm about to talk about, but for some reason I looked at him and it just kind of burned into my head. Have you seen the Gabe Newell picture of him, like, crossing his arms and putting his head back a little bit, and he looked... <laughs> I can't unsee it now with... <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> He's in this pose all the time. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> but you're certain that we're up against a huge organization, right? However, even if such an organization exists, why would they make us go through something like this? Anyway, whatever. How long are we going to keep talking about this? Why don't we talk about something more realistic? <laughs> Our enemy's purpose is still unknown. As long as we find out who's behind this, we'll learn their purpose. So in other words... So what we must do now is find out who our enemy is. If we do that, we'll be that much closer to a breakthrough. Luckily, according to the e handbook, we are free to explore this island. Listen, there will definitely be a clue about the enemy on this island somewhere. Let's start looking. I'm gonna do it! Alright, let's get this crap done after you go back and eat your food. <laughs> um, what are we looking for? Hey! Owari, oh, were you even listening? We need to find clues that will tell us who our enemy is. Fine. No prob- No problem. No matter how large this organization may be, they will not be able to stand against us. Go by they four are destined dark to devas fall of destruction! Devas. Yeah, he says devas. They are destined to fall and turn to ash at the might of my four- Four dark devas of destruction. Wow! Wow. Hamsters came out of your scarf. <laughs> Teehee, they are so adorable. Aw, what? You're adorable. Adorable, you say? Th th thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh my my! You're pretty happy about that, huh? Huh? Look at that guy talking to Miss Sonya all, all casually. I'm definitely gonna beat the crap out of him later. I don't get it. In this tense situation, we all need to be a lot more cautious. And yet, I'm relieved everyone is in such high spirits. It's strange, but I feel like I can rely on them. This must be what it means to have the confidence of an ultimate. Then what am I? Am I confident enough to call myself one of them? Damn it, I still can't remember. What talent am I supposed to have? Listen. Anyway, let me just... I can't unsee it. Anyway, let me just say this. There's no time to think about something as foolish as killing each other. You must do what you have to do. Observe, speculate, recognize, comprehend, even if it seems impossible, just persevere. But most importantly, follow my lead. I'll make sure to return you all to your normal lives, and then keep dying. This is your leader's order. This is your leader's order, understand? <laughs> wow, that's like, totally awesome. <laughs> that right hand of his is so plump. I've got the perfect nickname for him. Ham Hands. Ham, Ham hands. hands, you say. Hmm. I never Interesting. I the day when someone called me something like that. Huh? Why are you getting mad? Naturally. Why would I get mad at something as petty as that? She observed me directly and thought of a nickname. There's nothing dishonest about a name like that. <laughs> Perhaps I've always yearned for this, though it may seem ironic for me to realize that in this particular situation. 
He's totally monologuing right now. Such silly Don't talk. worry about it. I was talking to myself just now. I see. I don't really get it, but I guess this guy isn't just some overconfident, narcissistic jerk after all. Despite our situation, he's mysteriously calm. He might just be a reliable person after all. All right! All right then, we should listen to Barracuda and not waste our energy thinking about pointless things. It's true that we're not in the best situation, but it's also not the worst. Great! Because we're not alone. We have friends and we can count on... That we, sorry, we have friends we can count on to support each other. Gross! Seriously? That sounds so lame. <laughs> Uh, I knew it. I was thinking to myself just how lame I sounded for saying that. Oh, you're so pleasant, pleasant boy. Friends, huh? Until now, I never really thought about friendship. That sort of thing seemed embarrassing. I never would have thought about it in this situation. No, actually, it's more like because of the situation. In the end, we never solved the mystery of the ominous countdown. But without losing heart, we all went back to the hotel. Believe in your friends, huh? It'd be difficult to believe in them right away. But it'd be nice if, they, if it could happen a little at a time. Huh. If I'm starting to think like that, doesn't that show I'm making good progress? Damn. Where's my hope fragment? Now then, there's no reason to hole up in my room and stare blankly into space. Since there's time, it'd be a great idea if I went ahead and talked to, to everyone. Free time! I know it's sudden, but it's time for a brief tutorial. During the school trip, there will be moments called free time. During free time, you'll be able to strengthen your friendship by spending time with other students. Also, if you give them a present afterwards, you might make an even better impression. You can obtain presents from the Monoku, Mono Mono Yashin and the vending machine at the supermarket. When you strengthen a friendship, an intimate event is activated and added to the report card. Ooh, intimate event. Also, if you show any hope fragments you've gathered to Usami via the report card, you can gain new skills. Feel free to strengthen your friendships with as many people as you want. Also, when you spend time with someone, time will pass, and you will return to your cottage afterwards. After passing the time several times, your free time will end, and you will continue on to the main story. By the way, you can skip free time by resting in your cottage bed, although I don't really recommend it. Please use it if you want to, just to continue the main story right away. Free time! Do, 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 do. Uh, which means I should say thank you to people who, um, who might have subscribed. Uh, Notes are all these 100 bits. We are 95 Dark Souls references short of one reference a day for a year. Oh, are we? Damn. Sorry, I, it, it was too hard to make that that many references. It, 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 it was the Dark Souls of memes. Sorry. Uh, JJ Mara 813 used another 100 bits. I won't say how, but remember the Chapter 3 event in Dar Danganronpa 1 where if you had an item, uh, you got a special event? Well, in this game, there are way more of those. So sometimes an event happens if you have an item. Like if you had, like if you had a coconut, you could have had an event. Really? How would I have gotten a coconut already? Could I have gone somewhere and gotten a coconut and then came back? That seems kind of weird. Hmm. Uh, thank you for telling me. Uh, Victus X has used 100 bits. Check pet. I did. I did. That was 17 minutes ago. I did. I, ch I checked the pet. Sorry. I did. I'll check it again after this. Uh, JJ Meyer used another 100 bits. Uh, also, you can get random items at the beach. Uh, so you can get random items, just not at the store. Yeah, I remember them saying there was another machine there. Maybe it's a different machine than the one at the at the, at the supermarket. Uh, Tim Foyle used some bits to say. Uh, Monokuma, Morgana, Monami, fuck, Mary kill. Oh, God. Why, why, are you, why are you doing this to me? Well, if if if, uh, if I kiss Morgana, she'll turn into Aoi, right? So we'll we'll uh, we'll we'll marry Morgana. We'll kill Monokuma, and I guess we're fucking Monomi because that's the only other option. There we go. Yeah, done, done. That's not that's not bad. That's not bad. Uh, Ricket has resubscribed for 12 months. Another 12 months up. Whole year. I'm only here for the anime, boys. What do you mean? Are you only here for the anime? comma boys like you're addressing the boys hey boys i'm only here for the anime or are you only here for the anime boys and you were checking out the bulge on the totally not mondo guy earlier i have questions ricket thank you for the year sub thank you um tim foil you says you can't get angry about the story being bad now joe the return of chad catchy shows real character growth <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's go to the beach. Okay, what was what kind of stuff was on the market? One second, I want to see if there's if there's the same sort of stuff we'll get in the market. 
<laughs> Don't you think Miss Sonya's amazing? She's seriously a 100% pure blonde princess. Yeah, she's dead. I can't believe I got acquainted with someone like her. I'm so glad I came to Host Week Academy. <laughs> well, obviously, I wish I wasn't in our current situation. What should I do? Should I invite Soda? No, let's see who else is around. Oh, there's a thing there. With a clam huh? shell. A Are you mon serious? Monokuma. Nice, more coins. Yo! What, you want something? What should I do? Okay. Okay, I, th I guess we have to pick our waifu right now. We have to pick our waifu. Okay, so what's in here? There's like water and food and stuff, right? So, mineral water, Ramoon? What's Ramoon? Blue Ram, chocolate chip jerky. Oh, why are they not in like order of, of their cost? Tissue. Tips and tips, second edition. Okay, let's just go. Let's let's go. Let's go gamble. If the other one's gambling, we'll go gamble. We should probably go check every single interior to see if we can find more of those Monokuma things. Is there one in the airport? Hey, Sonya. <laughs> as I suspected, there are so many unique people here. One keeps hamsters as pets, another has ham hands. <laughs> I'm so glad I came to study abroad. Damn. Let's see who else is around. The pet poops every hundred steps. Yeah, I, I think someone else said that earlier. I'll check it when we get to the beach. Let's just check 15 steps. Okay, is it is it distance traveled? Because he steps way faster if you don't run. Look look how look how look the, the long Oh. Not pooping. Why not pooping? Snakes don't poop. Okay, it's way faster to do this, I think. And Hunter used 100 bits to say, I haven't played the game, but I'm pretty sure Wendy's gonna die, pretty sure, so please hang out with my waifu soon while we still can. <laughs> oh, what the fuck happened? To oh, this is, this, okay, this is the thing. Is there a, is there a, a Monokuma to find around here? What the fuck is wrong with your shadow? Hey. Barracuda is very reliable, as expected of the ultimate affluent progeny. <laughs> With everyone working together under such a splendid leader, we'll be able to overcome any difficulty. What should I do? Okay, let's see who else is around. A tropical sea, just like one you'd see on TV or in a magazine. Maybe this would excite me if I'd actually wanted to come here. I feel like there should be something here, but I'm not seeing it. Maybe hidden in the tree somewhere? Or in the background somewhere? Or like the bird is carrying it, but I don't think so. It's okay, let's just use it. Alright, let's get a shot. Alright, so we just put all of our coins in, right? All of our coins? Obtain present. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. 
Ba, 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 ba. Uh, I don't know, like, they might have updated this and I, and I might be able to put all of them in, but it doesn't seem like it. Oh, it's a lot faster to get the presents. I missed this. Chat, did you miss this? Lucky, nice. Did we get a repeat so yet? Ooh, Hawaiian shirt. Chad Ketchy. Toilet paper, nice. Oh, is it fan art? I know exactly how to get off this island. <laughs> the, 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 the power of friendship boat. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm starting to think that maybe he's, like, it's, it's, it's all too, uh, it's all too, uh, fucking, everyone's getting along, and yes, we're rallying already so early, you know? Like, there's, I, I, I guess maybe he doesn't have to die for it all to go to shit. Like, if someone dies and it, and that's, like, the promise broken that he would keep everyone safe, then yeah. Should probably get going. Alright, who should we hang out with? I kind of want to hang out with Sonya. Uh, thank you, JJ Myra, 813 for another 100 bits. Also, one last small tip thing. You can only get the Monokuma things in that chapter, so you can only get the chapter 2 ones in chapter 2. Also, some can be in the murder investigation, so sometimes you can't get them all till someone is murdered in the chapter. Oh, so the ones that... So we have to go through every single area every single time? That seems kind of... kind of... kind of... kind of naff. I don't know. see one in this area. Is there an angle I'm missing somewhere? Last time it moved. It was moving in the airport. Yeah, I'm not seeing one. Okay. Oh, we're back at the hotel now. Okay, well, we didn't, we didn't really look at some of the other environments very carefully. I doubt there's some in this where you can move around, right? Well, maybe actually, but I doubt it. Okay, so let's hang out with Worst Girl. Let's do it. Let's hang out with you. I don't like you. I really don't like you. You're you're, you're my least favorite one of everybody. E even the punk chick. I like I like her more than I like you. I don't like you. Hey, nurse. You can't! 
Oh, same same thing again, okay. Shouldn't you hang out with the person you think is gonna die first? Yeah, that, that's that's why I'm thinking I wanna hang out with Sonya, because I think Sonya's gonna die. I'm not sure, I, I'm really not sure. I, I, have, I have three main candidates for who, who's gonna die, and it's, I, I, don't, I don't know why, but now I'm starting to think that maybe it's Chad Ketchy's gonna die first, but um, yeah, I, I thought it was either gonna be, or, or, or Makoto or Sonya were, were, were my original choices. He's the best. We have some tissues we can give to him too. Here's the toilet paper. Okay, I'm gonna hang out with Sonya, because I think Sonya's gonna die. I don't think we're gonna have all, all, all the guy characters fawning all over her for the for the for the whole game. I think she's gonna be deed. Let's go, Sonya. Sonya Blade. Do Celeste voice now? Some people are getting really upset about the Celeste voice, so I think I'm gonna drop it, or at least I'll, I'll do it a little less. Uh, thank you, Johnny Rage Twitch. Johnny Rage Twitch. Thank you very much for the new sub prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Johnny Rage Twitch. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Okay, let's hang out. Let's hang out. My. Oh my, are you going to teach me about Japan? Thank you so so very much. Oh, she has stars in her eyes. I spent time today struggling to correct Sonny's understanding of Japan. Probably don't deserve it, but it looks like Sonny and I grew a little closer. Would you like to give Sonny a Yeah, 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 definitely, 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 definitely. Let's give her a mini cactus. All right, what should we give? Should we give her a blue ram? A famous anti-energy drink that will make you feel very relaxed after drinking it. Um, a refreshing drink that contains no alcohol. It tastes more like sour grape juice. Okay, so she's a rich girl from a rich background, but until, but she's been like kind of impressed by how everything's so quaint. So I think maybe she wants like a quaint sort of thing. Dried be beef sprinkled with chocolate chips, a preserved meat product invented by, by an... What? Okay, so it says details left click or right click? I mean, like, it's, it's, it says that in the, in, underneath details, but also up there it says present. So what, what is it? I'm scared. Okay, we, we got through it. All right, um, this strawberry flavored shaved ice treat comes with a spoon containing lottery numbers. If your numbers win, you receive more shaved ice. Oh, that's cool. The pulpy white insides of a coconut, if you eat it with soy sauce and wasabi, it would taste just like sashimi. That's just what I was thinking, it would taste like sashimi, yeah. Uh, more ice. Oh no, we went, we went, we went down, Never mind. my bad. Uh, a regular t-shirt emblazoned with a, with a cluttered poem. Though the flower is gone, its scent lingers. Who in this world is truly unchanging? Today we cross the towering mountains of vanity, unswayed by superficial dreams. I wish I could see what, what she likes and what she doesn't like. Oh, there's like red things on the left to show you where they are. Another hope. This valuable diamond was created from the remaining fragments of the original Hope Diamond when it was cut long ago. Rumors persist that death follows anyone who has this item in their possession. Oh, let's give it to her. Jabani Jabanian jewelry? A pendant design with a coconut tree motif. There's a custom on Jabberwock Island which, in which parents give this to their children so they can one day pass it down to their own kids. Millennium Prize Problems. These seven important mathematical problems were posed by the Clay Mathematics Institute with a reward of $1 million for each one solved. Measuring flask, infrared thermometer, flash suppressor, Mr. Stapler. Oh, used in the medical field to give it to the nurse. Mesopotamia. Uh, this bright red spring shaped toy is made with steel. Why is it called that? Uh, Nitro Racer, uh, Koeshi Diamond Dynamo. Kids toy, Ghost Stone. Okay, what should I give her, chat? 
first in a series of popular Yuzuka films. <laughs> Century Potpourri or Potpourri. Memory Notebook, Broken Warhead, A Tissue, Dull Kitchen Knife, Occult Photo Frame, Man's Nut, a huge nut that can't be found in nature. It's said to exist within a man's heart. It's said that consuming this will increase your power to pursue romance. Bandage Wrap, oh, it's not, it's not a tissue. A manga, oh, should we give her a manga? Okay, what should we give her, chat? The nut? We're not giving her the nut. A cult photo frame? A picture frame that automatically converts digital photographs into ghostly photos. A cult or manga? All right, we'll give her. We'll give her the. We'll give her the the manga because people are saying she wants Japanese culture. All right, we'll give her the manga. Where was it? Is it right there when I started moving down? No, it was further down than this. There it is. I thought it had a different name. Alright, let's go to her. What? Sorry, we can't let you give that uh, give her that. It's what we in the industry like to call a key item. What what? What do you mean it's a key item? What? We have two of them! We have two of them! I'm trying again. Okay, what does she like? Occult Japan. Okay, and sour plums. She dislikes sour plums. Okay, let's give her the occult frame then. I'm pissed that we can't give this to her. Why is it frame spot like that? Wow! You are giving me this? All right. What a wonderful item. Then I shall accept it without any reservations. Um. I must say, this island is truly a wonderful place. The weather is calm and the sea is blue. Truly a perfect resort setting. That might be true, but... Oh, my. oh, did I say something strange? No, I was just... No, I was just thinking, you're strangely calm right now. Sonia, are you really not worried about our current situation? I... Of course I am worried. And I am also angry. Jesus, this is not something to joke about. Who's joking? However... However, what happens next depends on us. As long as we do not kill anyone, this will all be fine. That's the right attitude, but... Besides, I've come here to learn about your country. I would understand if this were my homeland, but in this case, this land is foreign to me. Well? I do not intend to kill anyone, and I do not intend to be killed easily either. The way she said that sounded a little dangerous. If this were my homeland, so this would be okay in your country? <laughs> anyway, let us forget about killings and cooperate with one another so we can return home quickly. If you have any good ideas, feel free to let me know. I shall also do my best to think of something too. Yeah, you're right. When I speak to Sonia, I somehow feel really positive and optimistic. Mm -hmm. Such an honor. Raise your head, there's no need to worry. What she's saying sounds odd, but she certainly looks the part. Typical of a princess, I guess. Ah, that reminds me, what was the name of your country? As I recall, the country's name was uh, the Nova Selic Kingdom. It was the Nova Selic Kingdom, right? <laughs> mm-hmm, it sounds as though you finally remember. Well, it's not a country I've ever heard of. Yes, that is understandable. It is often overlooked by cartographers. Um. Our Nova Selic Kingdom is an extremely small country and governed by an absolute monarchy. Though the population is small, our economy is thriving, so we are not in dire straits at all. For generations, the royal family has protected the kingdom and its people from its neighboring countries. Thanks to that, the people still have complete trust toward the royal family. Well? And also, wine and chocolate is one of our country's hidden specialties. I see, it really does sound like a kingdom. So since you're the princess of that kingdom, does that mean you live in a castle or something? Yes. Of course, the royal family has been living in the royal castle for over a thousand years. Though it may be old and small, the castle is truly a wonderful historic building. Of course! Of course, it's easy to get lost in our subterranean labyrinth, and our barracks are fully equipped as well. So castles really do have those. Um... Um, anyway, is it alright if I ask you something as well? Hmm. I can answer it. If I can answer it, it's fine. Who did you have your heart set on initially, and who do you intend to switch to later? What?
What? Huh? Th 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 this situation is truly similar to the story of seven men and women. I believe it is a standard tactic to start wavering and swapping partners. Um, hold on. What are you talking about? Called huh? Oot! Do you really have no idea? It's it is it is Japan's legendary drama. Well, it starts off really upbeat, but then it gets really serious. I never expected that to happen. I was all I was all like, seriously, what is going to happen? I could I just could not take my eyes off the screen. Uh. Momoko's feelings at the time were, <gasps> my goodness, so intense. I continue to listen to Sonya extensively talk about Japanese dramas. At least now I totally understand that she's a major weeaboo. Oh, Obtained hope fragment. Nice. After politely excusing myself from the long con from a long conversation with Sonia, I left the area. It's still bright out. I've still got some time left. I don't feel like doing nothing, so maybe I should go somewhere. All right, let's hang out with Makoto. Let's hang out with Makoto. Let's do it. What does Makoto like? Also, we should check on her pet. Oh, the pet pooped. Should we give the pet a present? What present can we give the pet? What would the pet like? Non-alcoholic wine? I don't think the pet's gonna like anything. Let's give the pet a t-shirt. Like, like, no, I don't think there's anything that we can give the pet. Can we give the pet the, the manga? What? Fucking pet only? <laughs> you see the the game Newell pose? Like, man, what the fuck? All right, what 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 does what does uh what what does uh, Chad Ketchy like? And also uh also uh Mokoto. Uh, pretty things dislikes noisy places, so likes pretty things. So we want something pretty. Uh, and for uh, fat catchy, likes coffee, dislikes commoners. Do we have any coffee? I don't think we have coffee. All right, what's pretty that we have? It doesn't just automatically go to the next one. Oh, fuck, it sucks. All right, well, this is pretty, right? That's gotta be pretty. That looks like it might be pretty, the pendant. Measuring flask, infrared thermometer. But I don't think we have any coffee. Tissues are pretty. Give him a man's nut. A man's nut is always pretty. I probably think the uh, the, the, the stone thing. Yeah. Okay. Let's go hang out with uh. Let's go hang out with him. Uh. Actually, where is he? Is he still on the beach? Okay, he went over there. All right. Are you gonna take another break this stream? Probably not, because uh, we might be done in 25 minutes. We might go a little longer than that. We might go. We might go until eight o'clock. I'm not sure. Uh, how do I get there? Can I? Is it, no. This is this is the way to the beach. We go past the the airport to the beach, and then we go to the thing. Maybe it was better to go right. Actually, my bad. Sorry. Right might have been better. I want to talk to uh, Monomi too and see if I can use any of my levels or hope crystals or whatever. Eight 
8 o'clock my time, by the way. It's it's 20 to 7 my time. So it's, we're going to go for another 20 minutes or another hour and 20 minutes. Being out with the nurse instead of instead of Makoto. Nah, let's keep going. We, we're committed. We're committed. I think nurse is gonna survive. Fan waifu. Oh, ow, ow, owie, and 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 he fu he Fumi's hair, and Owie's face, and Tube Tubi's outfit, and. Yeah, that's just that's just that's just the best, man. That's just the, the only way. The only way this could be better if it was if it was Tubi's hair, Tubi's face, along with Tubi's outfit. Like, damn, that's the only way it could be better. But right now, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, you're here again. Nice. Okay, I'm not seeing where where the. Uh where the thing is. Oh well, I guess we'll do it again another time. <laughs> when I get excited, I always end up saying the wrong thing. I already know that about myself, but I can't help but. it. But I never say anything that doesn't come from my heart. Everything I say is how I truly feel. What should I do? Should I ask Makoto if he wants to hang out? Yeah, let's let's hang out. Let's hang out. <laughs> I feel so calm around you. I think it's because you're the first person I spent time with on this island. I spent time with Nagito today looking for clues. I guess Nagito and I grew a little closer today. We just give Nagito a present. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We're gonna give we're gonna give him the thing that causes people to die. Okay, we're gonna give him uh, uh, this. Another hope, right? We're gonna give him this. this oh, he is... likes it. He likes it. Hmm, this is quite interesting. Thanks. Thanks. I'll take good care of it. Oh, he likes it a little. What? Jimmy, are you feeling sick? Huh? No, not at all. Nope. I see. Then it's okay. I thought you looked pale or something. I thought something was worrying you. Ah, but it'd be weird if you weren't worrying in a situation like this. Makoto is laughing in a carefree way, but seeing him laugh like that was enough to distract me from my worries. Huh? What? Is something wrong? No. How should I put it? I was just thinking about all the ways you've been helping me so far. Thank you. Wow. No, I haven't done anything to receive your thanks, but for someone like me, to be useful to you, and to even receive your words of gratitude makes me happy. You're being too hard on yourself. <laughs> I mean, my talent is just having good luck. It's not like it comes from hard work, and it's not like I can use it to do anything amazing. Regardless of how lucky I am, or if that luck even exists, I'm just too unimpressive to truly matter. Haha, <laughs> unlike you guys. Why do you sound so happy about that? It's possible that my talent might be more meaningless than yours. That, y that yours. You know? I thought the translation was better. I guess it's just a mistake. I mean, I can't even remember what it is. There's no mistake. That's not true. I'm sure you have an amazing talent. I mean, if you didn't, you wouldn't have been accepted into Hope Speak Academy. Somehow, when I see the way Makoto doesn't doubt me at all, I start to believe he's right. He really does help me in so many ways. Hey. Be a shame if you died. I know. If you'd like, let me help you remember. Let's see, a talent that suits Jimmy. I see. What about the ultimate serenity? Which part of me did you look at to come with a, up with a title like that? Is that even a useful ability? <laughs> hmm, I'm pretty sure the ability to... to... Yeah. Look, 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 look at the, look at the, 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 look, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking pose too, to, to bring serenity to others just by being there is really amazing. Let's see. <laughs> what about the ultimate clumsy student? Now nah, that's the nurse. Well, considering that I suddenly forgot what my talent was, that might be fairly accurate. <laughs> Then what about the ultimate scatterbrain? Don't go that far. I don't want to. I don't want an ultimate talent like that. Wow. Hey, don't take it seriously. It was just a little joke. And then, <laughs> how about the ultimate spiky hair? That's not an ability at all. I know, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> but it's going to be fine. I'm positive you have a talent that's bringing with hope. Jeez, he's totally messing with me. But thanks to him, my feelings are lighter than they ever were. Could it be? Was that his goal all along? Damn, so pleasant. If so, maybe he's a good person after all. Well, I guess it's too early to say. I need to get to know him better from now on. Hope we get to understand each other better, even if it's just a little bit at a time.
damn, we got it. We got a level up and a, and a new and a, and a new hope fragment. Nice. I was completely exhausted from hanging out with Makoto all day, so I returned to my room. Well, not all day. We saw we saw waifu before that. Is there more free time? Ding dong dong ding. Eh, that bell just now. Could it be? It's night time. Ahem. Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. And that announcement is... You need an extra manga in case one gets dirty. <laughs> Thank you for that. For, for the bits with that. Thank you, Crocano861, for the 12-month resub. Another year resub. Thank you so much. Here's to one more year of Weeb Games. Also, new batch hype. Hope you like it, Crocano. Thank you so much for the whole year. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Canon, Can, Canon or Canon? No, it's Canon. Uh, Inspector for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Canon Inspector. Thank you. Watch your head when you're inspecting the cannons. Hello, everyone. The fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin. I wonder what festivities await you. Oops. Don't want to ruin the surprise. Uh oh. It was a little meh at first, but anyway. Please gather at Jabberwock Park. Uh-oh. Is someone dead? Did he just tell us to go to the park? It's the middle of the night. What's he up to? I suddenly had a bad feeling about all this, and goosebumps sprung up all over my body. If we're not allowed to defy Monokuma, then there's no way I can ignore this, right? Which means there's nothing I can do except listen to him. Damn it, what is it now? Damn, damn, what's, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? But first, let's look at our pet. Oh, the pet pooped! Oh, shit. Oh, despair went down. That's good. Hey, cows. Is there a dedicated check on pet button so I don't have to always open the menu and get there whenever I'm running around? Hey, Pecco. Pecco, you came too, huh? I have no choice. After all, the e-handbook e clearly states that defying Monokuma is not permitted. However, It'd be foolish to resist if it's just going to make things worse. I hope everyone else feels the same way. That worries me a little. Anyway. At any rate, we must go to the park. All right. I like Pecco. There's there's a lot of good girls in this game. Everyone was already at Jabberwock Park when I arrived. <laughs> Once again, you're late. Did you lose your nerve? I'd like to deny that, but he's not exactly wrong either. That's fine. Anyway, it seems everyone all, everyone is here. How annoying! Look, what is it this time? So friggin' annoying. Then you shouldn't have come. I mean... Well, I mean, I don't know what'll happen to me if I don't come. <laughs> huh, since none of us know what'll happen, maybe you should be the one to test that out. You... Hey, you may talk like you're tough, wise guy, but you wouldn't be here unless we, you were scared too. Huh? Huh? What? Yeah, yeah. I guess even a big bad Yazuka like you must have been scared of, scared of that monster, huh? Why, you... What the fuck did you just say? Wait! It's, it's fucking Mondo, man. So stop it, you two. Fighting among friends isn't good. Huh? What? Did you just say friend? Dumbass! I'm not your friend, dumbass. When did I ever become friends with you bastards? Eh? <laughs> Humph. Let me, let me be perfectly clear. I can do it, you know. I can do it, you know. Huh? Huh? You. What did you just say? <laughs> oh, you didn't hear me? Then I'll repeat myself just once for you. I said, I can do it. Maybe he should get Manfred's voice. Oh, I can do it, you know. Oh, pretending like you didn't hear me. Do it. What are you saying? Don't tell me. Are you being serious right now? Damn. Hey, for you, Hiko. Why don't you just why don't you calm down for a bit? Bastard! Don't talk to me like we're friends or something. Don't misunderstand. I live in a completely different world than you bastards. Kill or be killed, that's the kind of world I live in. Jeez. Huh. The current rules make more sense to me than that play nice and get along crap. What are you saying? If you don't stop it right now, I'm going to get seriously angry. Oh no, Wendy's Why gonna get angry. You? 
Don't treat me like a kid, bitch. Just stop. Just stop already. This kind of fighting will not get us anywhere. Shut the hell up! Shut the hell up. There's no way I'm dealing with this. Come by ya crap? <laughs> if any of you guys want to die, step forward. I'll fucking kill you right now. I'm starting to get Sounds fun. Up. Give me your best shot. What's gonna happen if you're this easily provoked? That's enough. Enough. Huh? Huh? I see. Fuyuki Fuyuhiko, I understand what you're saying. Don't worry. I do not intend to dismiss your feelings. There was a time when I was also when I also thought the same way as you. Don't treat Are me you like treating a me like a kid, kid too. Let me say but what this. would reckless killing accomplish if you fail to get away with it? You know you'll be executed. Or perhaps that's what you really want. If so, hmm. you'd only be killing yourself to run away from this predicament. That's what a child would do. What you. did you say? Listen. Listen, so long as we're here, I will not let any of you die. I will not let any of you become a victim. And that goes for you too, for you, for you Hiko. I won't let you die. Yeah. What the hell? Everything you're saying, it's just empty promises. <laughs> it's true, my words would ring hollow if anyone else spoke them. My name but is Byakuya Togami. I am Togami. Barracuda Togami, and I'm destined to bring these promises to fruition. Or die. <laughs> Yowza, he's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. <laughs> I don't care what you say. I'm just gonna do whatever I feel like. <laughs> do what you will. However, remember what I said earlier. In the name of my I will family. not let any of you become a victim. That is the duty I have appointed to myself. <laughs> it seems like Barracuda resolved it for now. But even if he's the ultimate Yakuza, there's no way Fuyuhiko could have really meant what he said earlier, right? Well, I think so. Oh, nice, nice outfit. What? This is troubling. It looked like you guys were arguing, so I wasn't sure when to actually show up. It looks like I showed up at an awkward time. Hey, hey. Why are you dressed like that? Hey, um... Oh, I didn't mention it in my recent broadcast. It's my costume for the fun time. No way. Oh, don't tell me you're going to. Correct. That's right. Since we're on a tropical island, I'm here to do my two-man comedy routine. Uh, uh, Why does it yeah. matter that we're on a tropical island? However... But can you do a two-man comedy routine all by yourself? Of course. Oh, of course not. That's why I brought my partner. <laughs> Whoa, uh, what is this? Meaningless. Mm, that figures. Thank you for waiting. Now then, without further ado, I'm pleased to present Monokuma's side-splitting live two-man comedy show. Hey! Huh? I didn't hear anything about this. Are you telling me I have to improvise? How pitiful. I'm speechless. Well, this is gonna be good. Hello! I'm Monokuma! Oh, that's his name. Um... I'm Monami. Monami, not Mo Monami. Monami. And together we are the Monokumas. Now, I know it's sudden, but I guess I should show you guys my amazing mind reading abilities. I know it's sudden? That's what the tutorial guy says. <gasps> uh, you can read minds? Nah, he's just really intuitive. As practice, I'll guess your favorite food. Hmm. You can do it. It's obvious what rabbits like. Kid. That's right. Davers. I'd never eat a dead body. Now then, Monami's up next. Come Why do you guys on, want me to? Short Why do you guys something? want me to press right click? What do you want me to do? Right click. What's right click gonna do? Automatic. It makes it laugh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I was looking at the right click in the in the bottom right corner. What? There's no way I can do that. No worries, it's all good. I know a technique to summon the god of comedy. What do you mean that's a left click? The the, on, on the top left one, the, the left mouse button is, isn't colored in, and in the bottom right one, the left mouse button isn't colored in. They're the same. So, which do you think is better? Taking blood while you're still alive, or after you're already dead? Why would you ask such a cruel question? If I'm gonna summon the Comedeity, then I'll need a lot of blood! <laughs> so 
So, a god of comedy wants blood. Mm, pretty please. No matter how charmingly you ask, there's no way I'll let you take my blood. You're always so quick to make a scary face, Monami. You guys better be careful, too. You know, since Monami's actually a bad guy. She's as bad as the first villain the hero fights in a teen manga. They're always the underdog. Believe me, it's a fact that Monami's a villain. I'll let you all in on a little secret of hers. Monami went out of her way to erase your memories. <gasps> Say what? What? Wait, huh? You guys don't even remember how you got to this island, am I right? Shahira, well, how could that's you? That's because Monami stole your memories. Well, what are you saying all of a sudden? But wait, there's more. She didn't just steal your boring memories, like how you guys got to this island. She completely took away your memories of the years you spent at Hope's Peak Academy. What a shocker. Damn, deja vu. Paola. <sighs> I feel great now that I've shared that with you. Seriously, memory loss plots are so old hat nowadays. Only a total hack would wait until the end of the story to reveal a cliched twist like that. P please stop! <laughs> Wasn't that a huge surprise? In truth, you guys aren't freshman students at all. You guys just thought you were because you've lost all of your school memories. Quick, someone get a plagiarist because I feel like I've heard this story before. Oh, damn. Is this made by IGN? S seriously, this is bad in so many ways. I'm through dealing with you. The abuse. Yeah, his backhand is far too powerful. <laughs> Huh? That's... What did he mean? Hey! Hey! How was it? Was it funny? Or was the comedy too highbrow for you? Come on! Hey, what were you saying just now? Huh? What was I saying just now? <laughs> oh, you mean when I said your school memories were completely stolen? Completely stolen? Our school memories? Completely? What is he saying? <laughs> <laughs> There's no way. Because I just entered Hope Speak Academy and then I was brought to this island right away. It's true. That's because that's how you remember it. All thanks to Monomi stealing your school memories. What are you saying? That's impossible. Who knows? Man, how many years has it been since you guys first entered Hope Speak Academy? I wonder what happened to your friends and family. They're probably worried sick about you. Maybe? Impossible! Our school memories were stolen? That's ridiculous. That's right. That's right. There's no way I have memory loss. You can't. Don't don't listen to what he says. Limit breached. I won't believe. I, I won't believe. believe such a thing. Yep, everything's okay. I don't believe it. <laughs> you're, you're lying, right? Stealing our memories? That's a lie, right? You're just trying to make fools out of us, right? Wrong. Nope, it's not a lie. If it was a lie, then how do you explain this? The moment you arrived at Hope's Peak Academy, you all experienced a strange dizziness. What? How do you know? How do you know that? Actually! <laughs> Why, that was the cutoff point. Your memories beyond that point have been completely removed. What the hell? I could feel myself getting lightheaded. I couldn't think, I couldn't speak. I could only breathe in heavy, gasping breaths. <laughs> So a long time has passed since then? Impossible! I impossible, there's no way. Lie! On the contrary, why is it impossible? <laughs> That's... Whether or not it's possible, there's no way we can believe it. No, no! You just don't want to believe it, right? Yeah. But don't worry, I'm a generous guy. I can give you back your memories. Uh? Huh? Hey! However, um... there's a catch. Could it be? Don't tell me the catch is. We have to kill somebody. <laughs> <laughs> Figured it out yet? That's right! That's right! You guys have to kill each other. That's my bargaining point. Oh, uh, wa wa. Hey, hey. You guys want to know, right? I want your school mem. You want your school memories returned to you, right? Hey, man. 
then you better start killing a penny for your thoughts <laughs> and a murder for your memories. You pissed me off. Hey, stop running your mouth. Wah -wah? My, my, why so angry? I'm just providing you all a motive from the bottom of my big, generous heart. Otherwise, you cowards wouldn't get any killing done. <laughs> well, that's not your fault. Humans are natural-born cowards. They even cry after their mom squeezes them out. Special bleeding That's why I'm service. giving you a motive. Think of it as an excuse to commit your future crimes. Quiet. Stop this at once. Damn, Akechi, Akechi fucking stuttering. Do you really think your delusional rambling will convince us to commit murder? What are you saying? I don't even believe that memory loss crap in the first place. Sure. But more than that, what you guys really don't believe is each other, right? What's going on? What do you mean? Hey, You um... guys don't know each other, which means... Yeah none of you realize that a traitor is hiding among you, right? Huh? <sighs> hey, why are there 16 of you? If a total of 15 students from Hoax Peak Academy were arranged to come to this island... I got it! That's right, there's probably a traitor I don't even know about hiding among the group. What do you mean? How, 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 what do you mean? There, there, there are 16 rooms. Why, what? Just kidding. You. What are you saying? All this shit about traitors doesn't make any sense. Ugh. It's obviously nonsense. Lame. For real, you guys, how can you be so sure? You guys don't know anything about each other. You don't even know each other's true natures. That's why if one of you is planning to kill someone, it's impossible for any of you to know. With those words, everyone fell silent. It was us, we're the traitor. I wanted someone to argue with him, anybody, but nobody said a word. They just stood there. Uh -huh. Even so, is even so, if there really is a traitor, isn't that gosh darn awful? Pretending to be your ally and tricking you guys? It makes sense for someone like that to get killed, right? <laughs> come on, make the preemptive strike. It's first come, first served, and the winner takes all. <laughs> if you want to survive, you gotta find that person before they find you. <laughs> <laughs> Even after Monokuma's boisterous laughter faded away, we all just stood there. Every one of us. <laughs> the reason that the top left one and the bottom right one are so similar, yet different, is because they're in different time zones. For example, it's 10 o'clock where the top left one is. <laughs> Damn, what is it in the bottom right one? This situation, this circumstance, this phenomenon, this disaster, this nightmare, this hell, this despair. This deadly situation, deadly circumstance, deadly phenomenon, deadly disaster, deadly nightmare, deadly hell, deadly despair, deadly consumed every one of us. Um... Is it true? Is there really a traitor among us? You got it wrong! Uh, it's not me, by the way. I know I may look suspicious, but it's not me. Who is it? Hurry up and show yourself. You're only making things worse for you by staying silent. That's enough. Just stop. There's no way there's a traitor. Shh. There's no way. It's pointless to even discuss something so foolish. I won't believe. That's right. I won't believe. I don't believe it. Because there's no way I can believe it. There's no per reason in the first place to believe it. Hey. Monomi, you would know. Uh? Huh? Uh. Is what Monokuma said true about our memory loss and about the traitor? Um... Um, I mean... Everyone needs to look at the look to the future. That's why you shouldn't look back to the past. <gasps> Keep your eyes fixed upon the future. Let's do our very best. Huh? Ah, she ran away. <laughs> Humph, how ridiculous. Memory loss, a traitor. It's completely fictional. Dumbass! I can't deal with this bullshit, dumbass. As he said it, it's a work of fiction. As he said, it's a work of fiction. It's entirely different from the reality I know. Stolen memories, all of my high school memories. Oh, I'm just adding words, I'm sorry. Stolen memories, all of my school memories, everything, a traitor hiding among us. But what really struck me was when Monokuma said, You guys don't know anything about each other. Ding dong, bing bong. I mean, I know a little bit about Sonya and Makoto. Peak Academy, it is now. Please return to your rooms now, then. Sweet dream. Hey. Hey, what should we do? <laughs> it's better if we call it a night here. We should get some sleep and try to keep our minds calm. Oh, nice hoodie. Oh. I guess you're right. This is your leader's order. Just so you all know, do not think about unnecessary things. This is your leader's order. Tomorrow morning, let's meet at the restaurant after Monokuma's morning announcement. Um... 
How troubling. I think the saying goes, I am frightened so stiff. Huh? Oh, man. I feel pretty stiff right now, too. Ah. That's not how that saying goes, but it's not her fault. She's a foreigner, after all. To be honest, I don't really remember what happened after that, but later I realized something. I was sitting on my bed inside the cottage with my head drooping down onto my chest. As I sat there alone, a strange thought suddenly crossed my mind. It was the punk one. Traitor. Could it be someone who isn't like the others? Like someone who doesn't even remember what their talent is? Or someone that isn't from Japan? What the hell? I don't understand at all. I put these stupid thoughts out of my mind and collapsed into my bed and thought about the good thought. Immediately, I closed my eyes. Closing my eyes was the only thing I could do to escape from this otherworldly reality. Monica a theater. They say impossible is a word that's only found in a fool's dictionary. Obviously, it's impossible to use a word that's not in your dictionary. If someone can actually make the impossible possible, over you can you truly that. call that person someone who doesn't have the impossible. Ding dong, bing bong. Ahem! Hope speak good morning, everyone! Look now, then! Let's show some enthusiasm oh, this is new. Sorry, and make sure to thing. give it our all today! I slowly and awkwardly sat up in my bed. Both my head and my body felt heavy, but... It was still an improvement compared to last night. We all said we'd meet at the restaurant. Okay, so I don't think someone's going to be dead within the hour. So I think we're going to call it here. And um, we'll start again tomorrow. Uh, I think we're going to start an hour earlier tomorrow. And we're going to go for at least the same the end, same ending time or maybe an hour later. Um, it depends on how I feel. Uh, if I'm getting tired and I'm making mistakes while reading, I think we'll call it. Um, instead of... Instead of... Uh, instead of um, Kind of, kind of pushing forward, but I do want to get the game done. Uh, not in, 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 I think it's a longer game, right? So no more than than the first game. No, no more streams than the first game. Um, hopefully, but yeah. So we're probably gonna start an hour early tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, I'll tweet it out after this. Uh, so it's gonna be a noon, um, uh, Eastern start time, right? So it's usually 1 p.m. So we'll start at noon, and that way I can go for a little bit longer, and I can still uh, end in time to have dinner with uh with lily and the kids um yeah so we'll do that so we'll start an hour early tomorrow yeah so yeah uh hopefully someone dies tomorrow uh if i knew someone was gonna die in the next hour i would push forward tonight but um i don't know that and i don't want to be spoiled for it so i'm not gonna do that but yeah uh, game is much better so far I, I i think it's a much better introduction to than the first one uh it's throwing some shade against the ending of the first one too which i'm surprised i wonder if if there was a lot of criticism and uh and uh, the, the, the writer or writers, I don't know if it was one writer that did this, uh, is, is trying to, to own up to it a little bit. I have no idea. I don't know. Oh, there's fan art? Hold on one second. Get smoke. Yep. <laughs> the, vi the video game guy from, uh, from, uh, from Persona 5. Should I, should I read all her lines in that voice? I'm getting sleepy. I sent him home crying. Kind of man, Freddy. I think I only have a couple of voice, a, a, a couple of voices in me. Um, let's see. Uh, now there's deadly all over the floor. <laughs> uh, thank you for the bit, Starkling second. So Makoto is useless, and Nagito is Makoto. Hmm. Yeah. So he's useless. Thank you, Victus X, for another hundred bits. Thanks for the stream, Papa Dragon. You're well. You're welcome. Uh, thank you for stopping by, everybody. Hope you liked it. Uh, thank you, Wuggy Not, for 100 bits. Jack Ryan, thanks you for the stream. <laughs> the Jack, the Jack Ryan bits. Oh no! Why did you put Worst Girl's head on Tubi's body? What are you doing? What are you doing? Why? Yeah, Chihiro's hair on on that guy. Yeah, very much Chihiro. 
Yeah, I'm conf I'm confused by what's going on, and I'm okay with that. But I uh, I'm uh, I'm I'm keeping some some of my thoughts to myself for now until until I I have more information because I don't want to just like shotgun speculation all over the place. Um, I want to I, I want to get more information first, but uh, yeah, I won't I won't say I won't say uh, I won't say anything else. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so thank you very much, everybody. Um, yeah, see you tomorrow. Survivor prediction, predictions. I already did that. So if you want to go, some someone might know where where it is. Maybe it's on the vod somewhere, or someone clipped it. But yeah, I, I already did that. So yeah, see you guys tomorrow.